Great to see what I did there. Uh, already back, and I see I'm rested. I was that quick. And it kind of happened by accident, I have to admit. We are super excited to be with you tonight. Four big hours of In the Kitchen with David. We've got a lot happening with you tonight. Not the least of which will be this unbelievably popular today's special value from you know my favorite brand, Le Creuset. They're here tonight with this gorgeous enameled cast iron skillet. Our buddy chef Nate Collier is back, and we've got something exciting for you. The Le Creuset 10 and a quarter inch signature cast iron handled skillet with pour spout. Now, this has been an extraordinary day with this, and I will tell you, since we kicked this off at midnight last night, we've now taken orders for the day. Over 20,000, and that's over half the quantity we brought in for the day. We'll get a quick shot of colors if we can, guys, over on the shelf there, because I want everyone to see the gorgeous colors off to Nate's left, and look at every color still in stock and ready for you to buy right now, including the QVC exclusive color of Emerald, which I helped select. So we're super excited about that. We've got all the great colors, but already half the quantity for the day is gone. This is the final look, Rosé, today's special value of the year. You do not want to miss this. You wait till I get my hands on this. I'm just getting warmed up. I'm back from vacation. I'm rested. I'm ready to go. Now, fire up the grill for grilling grates, and who better to have with you at the grill than Mr. Ray Rostelli? He's our personal butcher here at QVC and brings us tonight a choice of either eight or 16 of these five ounce bacon wrapped sirloin fillets. Now, this is not fillet mignon, this is center cut sirloin wrapped in center cut bacon. I'm not even kidding. I'm going to lose what's left of my small mind. I'm going to be all about it. We're going to be talking about this. It's the perfect marriage of two great meats for your summer barbecue. We've got a lot going on tonight. It's going to be super, super exciting. So stick around for that. But tonight we're doing a really fun grill and grate that you're not going to do on your barbecue grill. You're going to do it on your stovetop, and you're going to use that today's special value skillet if you bought it today, or your favorite skillet at home. I'm making a stuffed French toast. Now, I start this French toast like I start every French toast that I make with challah bread. Everybody, challah. Thank you. That was a little unenthusiastic, I have to say. Okay. Everybody, challah. Challah. Better. Okay, we'll work on it. So, what we're doing is we've already sliced up our challah bread, and we're going to make the filling for the stuffed French toast. Now, in my KitchenAid stand mixer, I'm going to pop in some room temperature softened cream cheese. Let's get him in there. Get everybody into the pool. That was a little tight fit there. Good thing he's a little melty. Then we're going to put in some chopped pecans. Then in goes our maple syrup. That's part of our filling, which is going to give it a nice sweetness. And then some cooked bacon. You know I was going to put some bacon up in there. You knew I was going to. Yeah, I know you did. All right, come on now. Let's get some bacon in here. And then we're going to get this going with our flex edge beater. Slowly, because that room temperature cream cheese is going to work its way into the mixture. This will be the filling for our French toast. Then we're going to do a classic batter, and then we're going to grill this up in our Le Creuset Today Special Value skillet with an ample amount of butter, because that's what you do. And then we're going to serve it up with some delicious, ma delicious maple syrup. How about a little bit of that on top? How's that working out? What do you think about that, Miss Stacy Lou? Oh, more please, more syrup. More syrup. Yes. All right, I got you. I'm all, I'm all uh -huh. over it. Hey, uh, Stacy Lou. Darling. It's good to be back with you. It's so good to be back. Are you cooking under pressure, dear? Uh, uh, no pressure at all. You know why? I'm not heating up in the kitchen for hours trying to make fork tender ribs. No, I'm doing it with our two quart digital pressure cooker from Cooks Essentials. This has been a best seller since we debuted this. 75,000 sold here in fraction of the time, juicy tender ribs. All it needs is a little bit of sauce. This baby might be mini, but it is mighty, fully featured. Great for a household of two with leftovers. Oh yeah. How you like me now? Barbecue sauce. It's coming at you. Five easy payments, free shipping and handling. The last presentation you're going to see on our two quart digital presser cooker this month. This is it. Time to get it. $22 savings. Woo, wait till you see the demonstrations and what we're going to make. But David, right now, speaking of Cook's Essentials, 
How about some air frying? How about we fry it up with a little air tonight, leaving the fat and calories behind, but keeping all the crispy goodness right where it belongs. Good evening, everyone, and welcome into In the Kitchen with David. I'm David Venable, just back from vacation and thrilled to be home with all of you. We've got a four hour show, big show ahead of us tonight, and we're going to begin with our six quart manual air fryer. Called manual because it's got a manual dial on the front. So you're going to really love the ease of this unit, you're going to love the simplicity of this unit. You're also going to love the cost of this unit because it's now clearance, and that is fantastic. We're talking about a six quart manual air fryer with a seven inch cake pan. It's normally priced at $134.30. We are over $64 less. Have you been putting off buying an air fryer because you've been waiting for the right price? Tonight might, might be your night because this is extraordinary. I've got great colors as well. This is your black. How many left here, John? 1800. I'm sorry, my earpiece popped out. Uh, then I've got it for you in blue, or navy rather, 1800 in the navy, and then I have it for you in the red. And I have final 1900. What's the good news, bad news story about a clearance price item? Well, good news is you're at a sale price. Bad news is when it's gone, it's gone for good. You want to get yours while the getting is good. Let's come over and meet Chef Joe McAllister from our Cooks Essentials Hello, team. David, Chef, welcome good back. To have you back. Good Thank to be you. Here. Thank you. Well, and let me welcome you to our show. It's Thank good to have you. you with us. We don't see you very often. Thank you so, so much. So this is super exciting to have you here tonight. This is an amazing way to cook, yes. and probably one of the hottest trends right now in the kitchen category. But for people who are unaware or unfamiliar, Familiar, what is air frying? So air frying is basically convection cooking. So you have this uh, small space down here in the drawer, and what we're doing is we're hitting that with intense heat and a fan. So it actually will shave off cook time because you have this small space here. You're not heating up the whole kitchen. You're concentrating and the cooking. Concentrating the cooking, which is great. So we can actually do two pounds of French fries all at the same time. Wow. And I know that's your favorite, David. Well, look, well crinkle cuts are my favorite. Exactly. And they're gold. In honor of my friend Chef Nate Collier from Le Creuset, it's GBD, Golden Brown Delicious. There you go. Golden Brown Delicious French fries. And the best thing about a crinkle cut is that it's crispy on the outside, but creamy on the inside. That's right. And one thing that I was most surprised about when I first had an air fried French fry is that it was still creamy and moist on the inside. Yes, exactly. So you get that crispness because the fan and the heat are blowing around the food yeah. and they're crisping it and you're using very little fat. Mm. Very little guilt with this because you're not submerging in two or three quarts of fat. You're actually using about a teaspoon so of oil, mm. which is the amazing thing. And then of course, I love the fact that you get this little ding at the end, which is just like a toaster oven. Yeah, it's, it's like a little so, timer ding, right? Yeah, it's so pleasing because it is a manual air fryer. No presets on this. You're just going to uh, go ahead and set your temperature. You're going to put your two pounds of fries right in that drawer just like that. And then, David, we're going to give it a couple of trigger pulls. With our Evo sprayer? Evo sprayer, about a teaspoon, just like that. Little shake. And then we just go ahead and put it in. It's set to 400 degrees, and in about 12 minutes, those frozen fries will be done. Let's remind you, this unit at retail, and it comes with that great cake barrel pan, which is a casserole pan. You yeah, can make a cake in it, whatever like you that. really love. But what's amazing about this uh, pack up at retail, this is almost $135. We are over $64 less. You're almost saving as much as you're spending on this. Right. And that's what's really extraordinary. And this is a clearance price. So when these are gone, they're gone for good. I have only three colors. The red that's in front of Chef Joe. I also have the black. And then finally, I have the navy. So these three colors are all we have remaining. Get yours while the getting is good. Because remember, if any one of these colors sell out, we'll, we'll, uh, we won't get it back in, not in this model. This is an amazing thing as well, David, because we don't normally think about air frying and delicious steaks. So these are a couple of strips that we did, and we let them rest for about uh, two minutes right after they were done. But look at this. Look how beautiful that is, moist and tender, not dried out, absolutely incredible. And if you want to try that, you're certainly more than welcome oh, to do that. Oh, my look at that. Right there. That is just the perfect result for a can steak. Can you cut that, that by, and have one more time? Can yes, little, I can. How about bit. this guy right here? Now, see, if I were home, I wouldn't hesitate. <laughs> but, exactly. you know, I've got, I've got, to, I've got to talk and, and the whole thing. That's mm. right. That's exactly right. Oh, Chef Joe, it's amazing. 
Now we also and so did, tender too. I know, I know. Mm. And that's the amazing thing. We think of air fryers for things like wings and mozzarella sticks and French fries, but you can do so much more. Wow! Because it's a six quart capacity, David, we can actually do a four pound chicken. A, a, a roaster. A roaster in an hour. In an hour. And it's juicy and delicious. You can Look see at the juice pouring how out of moist this. That's that crazy. is. And then the good thing is, is that your fat is collecting down here under your basket. Can that basket go in the dishwasher? Yes. Dish Wow, Washer safe great. and the drawer as well. So usually what I do is I'll soak in the sink with a little soapy water yep. and then turn it right into the dishwasher. Okay. So over here, let's go ahead and cut into that chicken. Whoa! It's amazing. It's just exploding on it's the It's kind air. of like a water sprinkler. It, yeah, is. it is. Look how delicious that is. And, and you right know what? Here, here is proof tender. positive, my friends. Right. Hold on that tight shot if we can for just yep. a, a hot second, Judy. This is what's amazing, and hot being the operative term here. Right. Um, look how juicy that is. Right. This is air frying, folks. Right. This isn't deep frying. Nope. This isn't cooking under pressure in a pressure cooker where all the moisture is locked in. Right. What this does is it sears the outside of the bird and locks the juices on the inside. Exactly. So what we come away with is that crispy skin we love on the outside, the juicy meat we like on the inside. This is pretty extraordinary. Now, Chef Joe, that cooked how quickly? So that's one hour. So we're shaving off about 20 minutes from the cook time for a four pound bird. So this size, three pound or four pound, done in one hour. And the cutting board just wasn't big enough. I mean, that tur uh, chicken was so juicy. Now, um, Almost a slip of the tongue. You can do a chicken breast in here as well. The boneless chicken or turkey breast. Turkey breast. Absolutely, you can do that in here. Now, this is also something that we usually don't think about with air frying: shrimp and a scampi. How fast did that shrimp cook? So that was 25 minutes. The shrimp from fresh. Sorry, I got to get that. Eh, that's all right. I'm going to dump it anyway. So here's what I'm trying to show you. Well, right I now. love that you're dumping it with the, the, the garlic juice and the white and the wine garlic and, and the beautiful butter. And look at that. The capers. Everything is in there. And once again, it collects under the basket. And then we can just go ahead and do that. Look how delicious that is. Moist, not dried out, and done in 25 minutes. That's incredible. Corn now again, temperature top. you dial on top, right. time you dial on the front. This couldn't be any easier. It really can't be any easier than this. And you're only going to have a maximum cooking time of 30 minutes because most of your food items are going to have to either be flipped or checked after about 30 minutes. Sure. So that's going to be your maximum cook time. Now, what did we do in here? We actually did corn on the cob. So look at this. It How quickly is, did this corn on the cob cook? So this is done in 10 minutes. Corn on the cob in 10 minutes. And we actually have an ancho chili uh, aioli that we're just going to brush onto the corn on the cob. This is one of 16 recipes that you'll get with the recipe guide. And, and you decide you just want to put good old uh, melted butter oh, on there and absolutely. sprinkle a little salt, have at it. Absolutely. You can even add the butter a little bit later in the cooking process, David. Just open the drawer, put your butter right on. Oh, see, that would be nice too, yes, wouldn't it? Yes, I know. Wouldn't that now, be incredible? Now, we have three colors available for you, and only three. And when these sell out, they'll be gone for good. So I want everyone to take advantage of this and get it. As I love to say, while well, the getting is good, with clearance pricing, when it's gone, it's gone forever. That means this model. It doesn't mean air frying is going away. It just it means this one goes away. So I've got it for you in the black. Most limited. Here's the navy. And finally, I have it for you in this gorgeous red. Be sure and stick around for this. We've got a lot more coming your way tonight. In fact, another three hours and 45 minutes, 47 minutes, it looks like. So we're going to get you all squared away with that. Chef Joe, you're coming back with a great yes, pressure cooker. Absolutely. Thank which we'll you. talk about. Yes. The two quart size, which is also clearance price tonight, which it is pretty is fantastic. Small but mighty. Right now, <laughs> Stacy and her Peace Love World shirt tonight. Lighting up the rainbow skies <laughs> and the rainbow of Le Creuset. Yeah, right. I wore the, the sweatshirt in honor of our colors of Le Creuset because it looks so beautiful on our table, the Today's Special Value. But before you're going to be on with that, David, let's talk about and announce who is our foodie photo winner of the week. I happen to love his name, Larry. <laughs> Larry R., you are such a pro in the kitchen. Your seared chicken breast over cauliflower rice with that homemade sauce looks amazing right up my alley. So thank you for sending that in. If you haven't yet, please post the recipe in the comment section. If you would love to see the dish that you make for your friends and family here featured live on television, go to David's Facebook page, David Venable QVC, post a photo of it, use the hashtag foodie photo. We spell that with two Fs as you can see right there and make your submission. Who knows, maybe it'll appear here live on TV. Also, don't forget, we are live streaming the entire show on David's Facebook page and 
we're hosting the chat. So great place to uh, ask any questions. So come on over show. and join Miss Stacy in the chat. She's on my Facebook page at David Venable QVC. If you haven't already liked the page, we hope you will like it and come and join us. We're a happy bunch and we love having you with us. We've got something great from California Innovations tonight and this is extraordinary. Brand spanking new today. This is a portable cooler with dividers. This cooler will hold 112 ounce soda cans or spirited beverages, whatever you choose to put in there. I just ask that if you're doing the spirited ones, don't drive. Okay, there's my public service announcement. But this is extraordinary. This is the same company that we've known and loved for all these years for great ways to keep hot, hot and cold, cold. Marie Louise Ludwig, darling, come in here. I'm Sugar so pie. I'm so happy to see you. Good to you. see you, Angel. Welcome back. We're super, thank you. We're super excited about this because of its great capacity, yes. but also some of the ingenuity built inside yes. as well. Do, do we listen to our customers? We do. It's summertime and they said, okay, California Innovations, you know how we love those big, bulky, uh, plastic things that you have to lug around? The rigid around. coolers? Yeah, the rigid coolers. Yeah. Give us one of those big, Rigid coolers in a soft sided portable insulated cooler. That's exactly what we've done. Well, let's open this bad boy up. Let's show yeah. everybody what's right. happening here. Come because on over here. When this is full, it will hold up to, as we mentioned, 100 12 ounce soda cans. 100 cans. When it is collapsed, no more big bulky coolers. Look at this on the side. You release the hook and loop closures just like this. And look, you open it up just like this. Couple of ways to use it. You have got a bottom. So you can use it just like this and have Which, one yeah, big reinforces the, the floor. giant cooler and you've got it paneled all the way around with that super foam plus paneling board in there so it's very, very sturdy on here, ready to go or open it up. Open up the insert. You've got two, you've got a little loop and toggles right here. Toggle those together and now you have two sides which are divided. Love that. It's amazing. Three and great pockets big. on the front. And great big handles here to carry yep. this where you're going. And handles on the side as well. This will hold well over 50 pounds. This is extraordinary. It's, it's brand great. spanking new today. We've got it for you tonight at $37.96. You're also going to love that we put this on Easy Pay tonight. Two Easy Payments. Here's some exciting news. Use your Q card tonight. And I believe, John, my producer, it's four Easy Payments. Is that correct? So if you wanted to put this on four easy payments, just use your cue card tonight. Nice. We've got gorgeous we pattern sure choices for you. We do, as ever. So let's jump down front and talk to you about the blue dot stripe. That's what this is, blue dot stripe. Then we go over to the far side. This is black damask. Then up above that, I've got it for you in the, is that the green, green leaves? leaves. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then we've got it for you here in the gray. That's our most limited. And then finally, I have it for you in the red rose. These are beautiful, big capacity, collapsed down to almost nothing. Yeah. So if you're not using this and want to store it in the back cargo area or trunk of your car, collapse it down flat and then it just lays there flat and doesn't take up any room. Yeah, at the ready. I but love it. But here is what we want everybody to know. California Innovations built for performance. So if we're going to give you a big cooler, everyone's going to want to know, well, geez, how long can we keep the ice in here? So last night, 2.30 in the morning, if you follow me on my Facebook page, you'll see me load this up half full of ice at 2 30 in the morning because I just wanted to know for myself. Are you ready? Here we go. Look at this. Almost 18 hours and there's still tons of ice in here and ice cold. Wouldn't you know 18 hours later. How about that? You're going to want to drink this. Look at this. Let's see how cold this is. Going down, going down, going down, going oh, down. Oh my word. You guys, most people. It is freezing cold. Yeah, most people's refrigerator <laughs> is usually what? Between 38 and 42. And 42 degrees. This is right around 31 degrees, the soda in that yeah. can. Wow. 18 hours later, this is built for performance. So you've got that cooler to take the beach. Of course it's leak proof. Of course it's got the great thermoflex lining that we love. Of course it has the microband built in that's going to inhibit the growth of bacteria that causes stains and odors. So it's going to wipe down clean, easy to carry, but it also fits perfectly into a supermarket cart. I took this to the supermarket today, put my divider and filled it up because I wanted frozen on one side and fresh on the other. Wait until you see everything that is in here. This is one full supermarket trip. After the supermarket, then use it for the beach. Look at this. 
and Ooh. 100 cans of soda. These are going quickly. Lots and lots of you making your choice as Marie unloads her entire grocery <laughs> haul. I know. Let's remind you of your color <laughs> choices and how many are gone now, John? 500 of these are now spoken for. This is brand spanking new. You've got a lot of hot weather in front of you. It is muggy outside tonight. It's muggier than a dog's mouth tonight, all right? So you've got a lot of hot weather in front of you, and you've got a lot of ample opportunity to really enjoy this nice, crisp, cool cooler. Now, this is green leaves. Most limited is the gray. In fact, I have fewer than 500 left now in the gray, and there's no reorder on this. So when it's gone, we take it off the table. Alana's just chomping at the bit, take it off the table. She's my producer. She's like, give me that gray, give it to me. All right, here's your red rose. Down front, we're calling this one blue dot stripes. So it's basically stripes in the shape of dots. Yeah. And then we've got it for you in black damask, another popular choice tonight. Remember, when these are collapsed flat, mm -hmm. they collapse to almost nothing. This goes on the side. Yep. And Let's, then these, these fold and in. Look at this. Look, look at that. You guys. We went from this to this. To this. Think about those big oversized coolers that you have to store in your basement or your garage. Now, collapse it, but still have the capability and 18 hours we had. And 112 ounce cans will fit in <laughs> yeah, here. Yeah, here we go. Look. Think about, I mean, look at this. This is 112 ounce soda cans. Yeah. If you're taking this to the Little League game, if you're taking this to the kids' soccer practice, you're going to be going um, later this summer, what, the football practice and all that business starts again, but it's still mm -hmm. so hot outside. It is. Take all those cool drinks, bring the fresh juices, bring the orange slices, all that other business you bring out to the ball field, right? Right. So this is what it's all about. Two easy payments, unless you're using your cue card tonight, and then it's four. Take advantage of these. John, how many gone now? 1,000 now are gone. This is green leaves. If you want gray, I have fewer than 300. This is going quickly. No reorder on this. When it's gone, it's gone for good. Get your gray while the getting is good. Here's red rose. 600 now remaining. This one is blue dot stripes. And this is called black damask. This one right here. So don't miss out on any of these. We're going to get you all squared away. Marie Louise Ludwig, thank, thank you, Angel. You. Good to see you as always. Great to be Two here. Two easy payments. And don't forget, use that cue card and you've got four. Let's check in with Stacy. All right, David, you had mentioned the sweatshirt that I'm wearing, and I want everybody to know it is from here, QVC. It's Peace Love World. It is kind of an oversized, relaxed, raglan style sweatshirt. It's really nice and lightweight, so it's perfect for those air conditioned office spaces like this right here. We have three colors. There's a banana color yellow that says, I think it says, I feel happy. And then you've got the two rainbow, this in blue. We also have an ivory with the rainbow stripes. Um, nice, roomy, comfy. If you're between sizes, go down a size. That's exactly what I did, but you can find it online. Three colors, really super cute and comfy. All right, so that's it for what I'm wearing. In the meantime, talk about decorating or outfit Fitting your kitchen with color. With color. Look at these gorgeous colors, but color is only part of our story tonight. You're looking at a brand that has been around since 1925, proudly made in France. This is enamel cast iron. This is Le Creuset. This is our today's special value. So as pork chops go into this screaming hot pan, you're going to get a gorgeous sear on those pork chops. You're also going to love one skillet meals in this vessel. You're going to love it for everyday cooking like your breakfast scrambled eggs or the kids grilled cheese at lunch. This is the quintessential vessel to have in your kitchen. And why shouldn't it be from Le Creuset, the brand that has been around since 1925, proudly made in France. The one that is generational cookware, the kind of cookware that we're enjoying and passing down to new generations of cooks in our own families. This is our final Le Creuset Today's Special Value of the Year, and I couldn't be more excited about this. First of all, from a value standpoint, this is a 10 and a quarter inch stick handled skillet that also comes with a pour spout. It'll also come with eight recipes developed uniquely for this size vessel. Now at Lucris or at retail on this is $170. We are $70 and two pennies less. Do you know how many of these have been ordered already today? Over 22,000, and that's over half our quantity we brought in for the final Lucris Today Special Value of the year. Wow. 
I am so excited about this. I've been waiting all day to get my hands on this. I'm rested up after nine days of vacation. Y'all better buckle up, because here I come. All right, so here it is. This is an extraordinary skillet, and we've got the colors you've been wanting. This is Cerise. This is the color I collect. We did one, we did Cerise in, in uh, both directions, so you can see the back of the pan and also see the inside. This is a pan that will never need to be seasoned. This is a pan that will be gorgeous every time you use it, and it's easy and simple to clean. We'll tell you all about that. Cerise is the first color. From there, we go to Oyster. And from Oyster, we take you into this gorgeous color, which I'm personally very excited because I helped choose. This is the Emerald, and it's exclusive to QVC, and you're not going to find this anywhere but right here or at lucrase.com, but you're going to pay a whole lot more for it there. Here's the other thing. We have how many left? 1,800 left in this emerald. It's going to go quickly, and I'm going to make sure I don't turn that over. There we are. All right, so there's your emerald. Then I've got it for you in Caribbean, the beach that we all wish we were sitting on, right? So this is what it's all about. Then Marseille, named after the southern port city of France. From there, we go to this gorgeous color. Now, this color was just introduced. Chef, was that last year? Uh, Provence? A little. Okay, and they're durable. They are durable. Yes, they're durable. So this is Provence, it introduced in the last year or two, uh, right? 18 months or so, yeah, 18 not quite months. two years. This is Provence, which is that beautiful lavender color. We'll work on getting those set back up. Then we've got it for you in white. Now getting limited in flame. Started with 3,000 for the day in flame. 850, all I have left. Here it is in Soleil. 575 remain, and then finally the palm. 850. Did I also mention that all of them come in the beautiful Le Creuset branded box? No, yours won't have a ribbon on it. You can certainly add that if you choose. But this is $170 at retail. We are $70 and two pennies less. Now, how many ordered for the day, John? 23,000. How many in this show? 500 already in this show. Super excited about this. Get yours now because when this sells out, we won't be getting any more of these back in, not at this price. It's our final look for, say, today's special value of the year, and it's only July. Let's head over here and welcome back an old friend, Chef Nate Collier, back with us. It's great to be back Good here. To welcome see you, back buddy. to you, too. How was your vacation? It was fantastic. Wonderful. I laid around like third base for like almost 10 days. And I bet you did a little cooking, a little eating, little too, bit. while you're there. A little Just bit. A little, little bit. bit. But this is what's exciting because now you've got that skillet that you're going to reach for every day. Every day. This is the workhorse of the kitchen. I tell people, if I have a good sharp chef's knife in a, in a high quality skillet, I can cook almost any recipe out there. You yeah. can do almost anything in it. We've been cooking in cast iron, I say we, people have been cooking in cast iron for thousands of years because of the heat retention properties of it. So you're gonna get this beautiful sear on you these pork chops. You just put that in. Not just put that in. Maybe two minutes ago. And David, you can see how easily it turns. If these weren't turning, you would know that they weren't ready yet. That beautiful brown right there, that's flavor, that's texture as the fat crisps up and caramelizes in there, and you only get it with cast iron. Now, I'm looking at the inside of this pan and I'm seeing black, but this is not a nonstick coating, correct? Correct. It's not a nonstick coating, and it's also not raw cast iron. So that's what sets Le Creuset apart. We've got the beautiful heat retention of cast iron where you get all this flavor, but the black enamel coating will protect it. It's durable, it's easy to maintain. Here's the animation showing exactly how that goes on. So a ground coat or a base coat goes all over this vessel. Every single piece of it is already sealed and protected. Then those beautiful colors go on. And then on top of that, you'll see the black enamel actually sprayed onto the inside. And I know this animation makes it look really simple, like we just spray it on and we're done. That takes a lot of practice to spray on in the right uh, proportions. It has to be fired every time in between all those coats of enamel wow. so it fuses to the cast iron. It's a lot of time. It's 15 pairs of craftsmen's hands. So this is typically why this is investment grade heirloom cookware. It's wild. The cast iron, the enamel, and then of course the beautiful colors and the reputation of Le Creuset. So here's the other thing. We've got these pork chops almost all the way cooked through. If you had thicker ones, David, you could go right to the oven with this to finish them cooking. Because this is safe into the oven up to what temperature? Uh, up to um, any temperature. So it's broiler safe. There's not a lid or a knob on this. So you can cook to anything here with this, wow. uh, with this skillet. The other thing I love about the black enamel is that you don't have to worry about cooking with acidic ingredients, tomatoes, wine. It won't react. Re it won't react. We're just going to hit it with a little bit of um, white wine. And of course, we're a French company, so I'm going to 
Oh, that smells nice. Smells oh, you're gonna put a little French creamery butter little in there. Little French creamery butter in there. And again, I'm not gonna scrape the bottom of this and deglaze it because you'll see how clean this <laughs> is gonna get. This it's is like you know me. It's just, I mean, so you go, you go to a restaurant and you ask why does food taste so good? It's because butter's in there. But it's you know what? You know, Chef David Burke was here earlier and he told me once, he said, David, you know how we make the soups at my restaurants taste so good? <laughs> right before we serve them, butter. we swirl butter of into course. the top of the, of the soup bowl. I'm like, oh my word, that's uh, what it is. But, but still, even though, I mean, obviously you can regulate the amount of butter you want to put in it, but this is just pork chops, salt and pepper, fresh summer peaches straight from the farmer's market. And this sauce is going to cook down just a little bit here in this pan and we're going to use the spouts to plate this beautifully uh, and it came together in probably 15 minutes at most. Stick handle, helper handle, two pour spouts. You'll never season this pan because that is an, a proprietary enamel, black enamel Absolutely. on the inside. So you're going to clean this just the way you would any enameled piece of cookware. Correct. And you're going to love it because you're going to reach for it every single day. You're never going to see, season this pan. My grandma had old cast iron, raw right. cast raw iron. Raw cast iron. And she would put real lard in there and then season it in the hour in the oven for hours, hours and hours and hours. You'll never have to season this, not a day that you own it. And what would she do if she came in and she saw you soaking it or scrubbing it with water? Uh, well, first of all, water? when I went to clear the dishes, she'd say, darling, put it in the sink, but don't dare put a speck of soap in it. Don't put a speck of soap in it, she'd say to me. And I, I love this enamel cast iron because it gives you the best of both worlds. You have the heat retention of the you know, original raw cast iron. It's already protected with enamel. You don't have to wipe it with oil to protect it when you put it away because no rust, no oxidation is going to form. And then it's beautiful, it's durable. We're going to do these pork chops just right over some mashed potatoes. You could go over some rice. You could do this over even a salad or some grilled summer veggies. We're going to put this down and then watch. You could also serve that over butter noodles. You could, <laughs> more butter. We're just going to pour that pan sauce. That's just butter, wine, salt and pepper, and the delicious fawn from the pork that we made. Not to mention a little bit of uh, peach juice. A little bit of peach juices in there. And then, David, I want to show you something else, too. Here's that pan. Let me just turn this heat off. I'm going to take just a wet rag okay. so you can see. Now, of course, we'd use a little bit of soap to clean it, but just watch how easily that cooked on pork. It just wipes the out The butter, of it just wipes right out. Mm. Sometimes when I cook in my cast iron skillets or my griddles, this is all I do to clean it. I just wipe it clean. It's amazing. You could do a sponge and some soap on here, but this is all you need to do to keep it clean, and you never have to protect it again. Chef, I'll tell you now that for the day, we've taken orders for... For the day, 23,800 in this show alone. Wow. 1,400 of these are now gone. This same skillet, chef, is $170 at retail, as I Correct. know you well know. Yes. We are $70 and two pennies less tonight. This is our final look or say today's special value of the entire year 2019. And this is going to be your opportunity to get your color. Let's go through them again. We'll start at the back this time, beginning with palm. I have 790 of these palm left and then it's coming off the table. There is nothing coming in behind this. This is the only quantity we have in this today's special value. Then I've got it for you in Soleil. I have fewer than 500 now to go around. Then it's coming off the set. This, this is Flame. 750, all I have left to go around. A white is a color we don't do often. Correct. So I would encourage you to think about white because this is going to be that iconic color that lasts for generations. Popular for um, bridal and baby registry, which is that perfect white color. for that. This is a color that is newer to look per se. It's called Provence, and this one is that lovely lavender color. This is Marseille, named after the southern port city of France. This is Caribbean, named after where I'd like to spend my next vacation. Yeah, in the Caribbean. Yeah. Then only a thousand left here. This is the brand new emerald. Now emerald is a color. That is exclusive to QVC. I had the great pleasure of helping to choose this color. Green right. is my favorite color of all time. So I'm super excited that we've got this. And we have how many left, John? There are only 1,600 left in that emerald. If you have any other pieces in emerald, it is a direct and complete match. So be sure and choose that if you love it tonight. Then I've got oyster, which is Stacy's color. So I'm sure she's probably already ordered hers. And then here's the color that I collect in my kitchen. This is the cerise. And cerise is the French word for cherry. So if any of you have cherry pieces in Le Creuset, exact same color. So again, we are $70 and two pennies less than retail. This is $170 at retail. We're coming in at 90, is it 99 and change? Thank you, I can't quite see the graphic from here because my eyes are old. $99 <laughs> and change, so we're about uh, $70 and two pennies less. Get yours now while the getting is good. John, how many in this show now? 
2,000 are now gone, and we're just getting warmed up, my friends. And it comes in this gorgeous flame-colored box. Anytime I order a piece of Le Creuset, I sit on the front porch. I don't care what season of the year it is. Even if it's 20 degrees outside, I'll sit right there and open that bad boy up right on the front porch. And then as soon as I see that orange gleaming out of the box, it means my heart starts beating faster. And when I take the piece out, I just start thinking about all the great food I want to start cooking. This is extraordinary. If you want to get a couple of these and put, tuck one away as a gift, boy, would that be an impressive holiday gift. We will not have another Le Creuset Today special value for the remainder of this year. We'll have other Le Creuset pieces, but this is your final Today special value of this year on QVC. Let's go back over with Chef Nate. He just pulled out of the oven a deep dish pizza in Chicago where deep dish pizza is so very popular. What do they cook those pizzas cast in? Cast iron. Cast iron cast pizza iron. pans. I love baking in cast iron, David, because you get the beautiful crust, a nicely cooked interior. And here's something I love to do when I'm doing pizza in a skillet. When I pull it out of the oven, pop it on the stovetop for like 30 seconds. Yeah. And it'll crisp up the bottom a little nice. bit more to okay. give you some beautiful texture. And again, so easy to come out of the oven, come here. We're going to lift it up. And I want to show if we can get right in here and just look at this beautiful oh, brown, okay. delicious crust. You see how it's crispy and golden brown delicious on there? I, I but, quote you all the time. I hope look, you hear that. Look here. I might ruin it a little bit. It's still tender and soft. It's not because it's overbaked. It's because the cast iron knows how to heat so the crust good. so perfectly. Oh, my word. When I was in Chicago back in March, we went out for deep dish pizza. Oh, oh my gosh. It was so good. It's the kind of pizza you have to eat with a fork and a knife because right. it's just a meal. It's so thick. And David, those pizzas, as thick as they layer them with the cheese and everything, they take 30, 45 minutes to cook. Oh, easily. Store bought pizza dough, a handful of cheese, some sauce, and pepperoni. We've done this at home with my girls. I have a three and a five year old at home. Yeah. It takes 20 minutes max That's to great. do that in a skillet. Well, remember, cast iron holds temperature so nicely. And it's going to evenly brown your food. That means your crust comes out beautifully. That's right. These vegetables and this chicken fajita that we're making up here cook so effortlessly. And remember, you don't have to cook on screaming high heat when you're dealing with cast iron because it's such an efficient conductor of that. That's heat. absolutely right, David. I'm glad you mentioned that. Even we're going to sear some steaks later and show that. You just leave it on medium, it'll heat up slowly and it will grab that heat. Not only does it hold on to the heat to make your food taste better, but your stove's not pushing all that heat out into the kitchen, heating you up, making you sweat. Exactly. It's going right into the food. Holding it right it's where it belongs. Efficient. And cooking the food more efficiently. Let's go to our phone lines. We're going to welcome Joyce in California. Joyce, good evening to you. How are you? I'm fine. Hi, Joyce. Nice to have you here. And what do you think of our Today's Special Value? I'm, I'm excited. This will be my seventh piece of Oh, wow. Wow. Now, do you have a favorite color that you collect, or do you have all different yellow. colors? Yellow. I like that yellow. It's called um, Soleil. Soleil. Right here, we're doing these fajitas in that bright yellow. Yeah, the one yellow. that you're standing next yeah. to right there. Yeah, that's no. the Soleil. Is that the color Soleil, you got tonight? The yellow. Uh, Joyce, is this the color you picked up tonight? Yes. Well, you're lucky you did, because I've got fewer than 400 of them wow. left. So you are a lucky duck. You've already got yours on the way. And I, I get excited when it comes and I see the package. I start to cry. I don't know why. <laughs> well, you know what? I don't cry, but I get excited like a little boy on Christmas morning because it's. I start thinking about all the things I want to start cooking, and then I want to get it into the kitchen and get it unpacked and get busy. Absolutely right. Absolutely, it's 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 the most wonderful cooking product that I have. Oh, and I have a lot so of it. I love to hear that. Well, we're thrilled you've been so happy, and I'm glad you got that Soleil because, as I mentioned, it's going quickly. I'll ask my producer again. John, how many left in the Soleil? 350 wow. all I have left. So another 50 flew out the door just since we've been chatting, Joyce. Wow. Yay, great. I got <laughs> mine. You got yours. You better believe you did. There's already one rolling down the assembly line with your name on the label. <laughs> all right. All right, my darling. Well, it's nice to meet you tonight. Be well and enjoy cooking, okay? Thanks, okay, Joyce. Thank enjoy the Soleil. So much. Be well. Bye bye. You too. Bye. So, 3,000 now ordered in this presentation. Wow. There are an awful lot of you who are saying, you know what? David and Chef Nate and everyone talks about this great brand. It's been around since 1925. 1925, 94 years. Wow. And you know what? You don't stay in business 94 days in this environment right. anymore unless you're delivering what you promise. That's absolutely right. Unless you're right. delivering a product that does what it intends to do and delivers for you every single day. There's a reason. 
that people buy Le Creuset and they pass it down to the next generation right. and the next generation of cooks in their family. This cast iron will be around long after we're gone. And that's what's beautiful about this. Think about uh, back to the days of the Old West when the cowboys would cook over an open flame in cast yeah. iron. This has been the cookware of choice for generations. Now it's your opportunity to bring home the brand that everybody gets excited about and do it at a value that you can feel very, very excited about. <laughs> this same pan at retail is $170. But that's not what we're charging you tonight. We're $99 and change. We're $70 and two pennies less. So take advantage of this and get the color that makes your heart smile because we've got them all. All right here, but some are more limited than others, That's Chef. Correct. So let's go back to the more limited ones first. What was that, John? 26,000 now gone for the day, over 3,000 in this show. This is Palm. I have 650 left in the Palm. If you are ordering the one Joyce just bought, the Soleil, I now have fewer than 300. Another 50 have just gone out the door. This is Flame, also getting limited. And 600 left. You're holding on this color for a moment. This was the very first color ever at Le Creuset. It was named after what the melting cast iron looked like in the crucible or the crusade because it looked like a flame. You got it. So they named the first color ever flame. And that's where the, the gradient ombre was inspired from too, the cooling cast iron. Exactly. As it cooled, the color would be a little more intense in the middle and then got kind of uh, lighter as you went out. Then I've got it in white, a color we do very seldom. So if you've got white look or say, or you're looking to build kind of combinations of colors, white goes with everything. Then I've got Provence which is this beautiful lavender color. Then we go into Marseille, which is named after the southern port city in France. Then here's your Caribbean. 850 now, all I have left in the Caribbean. If you love the emerald as I do, I help choose this color. It's exclusive to QVC. You're not gonna find this anywhere, but at Le Creuset and right here. And in that uh, emerald, 1450 left to go around. Here's the oyster, which is Stacy's color. And then the color I collect, the cerise which I know has been very popular all day today. And a thousand cerise ordered just in this show. Wow. Okay, so now we're looking at for the day over 26,000 in this show alone, almost 4,000. And remember of the 4,000 ordered in this show, a thousand of them are the cerise, which is the French word for cherry. We are seven, over $70 less in retail and this is our final Le Creuset Today Special Value of the Year. You're also going to get eight recipes uniquely designed for this skillet. So you're going to get a color photo with every one of them. Here is sausage ricotta meatball bake. That just looks delightful. And then here's one that I am going to have to make. This is called Snickerdoodle Biscuit Plum Cobbler. Kidding me? Snickerdoodle Biscuit Plum Cobbler. Delicious. I'm all about it. And if you don't want to put plums in it, you cho choose another fruit. There you go. Just do them all. And they're all included. Everything and the branded box. This is the brand, guys and gals, that I love so much and that you hear us talk about, that you turn on every cook show on television and they're all cooking in these vessels. There's a reason that it's been around for 94, do we say 94 or 97? 94. 94 years. 94 years. Since 1925. My math is not so good, but I do know good cookware. And this is incredible cookware. Don't wait for that holiday Le, Le Creuset Today special value because there's not going to be one this year. This is the last one of the year today on June uh, or July the 10th. So this is your opportunity. Tonight is your night. This is your moment for Le Creuset. Boy, what a great price. What gorgeous colors. Just choose the one that makes you smile and bring it home. We've got something very, very special for everybody who makes this purchase tonight. Now you got fajitas, this is that meatball This bake. is, we're gonna finish that in just a moment, but I wanna talk about these fajitas because you talk about weeknight dinners, David. Sliced chicken, sliced pepper, some fajita seasoning in here. Comes together beautifully, you get all that flavor in here. This burner has been off for a while. We're still steaming, we're still sizzling. We're gonna walk this to the table because you know how you go to the Mexican restaurant and the fajitas come out and they're sizzling? Yes. They're on cast iron first of all, but everybody loves it. It just makes it so much more fun. You bring this to your table, you set it down with your family. 
I told you I have a three and a five year old girl at home. I cannot get them to stay at the table for longer than 30 seconds. But when we do taco for heat at night, <laughs> it's interactive. They can build their own. It's steaming. It's fun. It's experience. And it just makes you feel so much better about your cooking. And you're not dirtying up another serving dish, David, because you went right from the stove to the table. Now, this looks like succotash, but what is this? Exactly? So it's a Mexican corn succotash. So we did some corn, some jalapenos, some of the same flavors you get nice. in the Mexican street corn. Like a street corn. Exactly. Sure, sure, sure. These are fantastic. We also have these little cocottes coming up in the show. I wanted to mention these. The little stoneware oval cocottes. Each one is 10 ounces. Right. You get four of them, I believe. Four of them, and they match the colors of the cast iron. David. And did you notice my emerald? So gorgeous. Pretty excited about that one, I have to tell you. So, this is K49006. It's our today's special value. Chef Nate has more cooking behind us. What I don't want you to do is wait. If we sell out of any color tonight and we are close on a handful of colors, they'll come off the set. Because right now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten colors. You got it. But when they sell out, they're gone. This is the only, for you, I should say, the final today's special value from Le Creuset of the year 2019. There won't be one coming closer to Christmas. There'll be other items that we'll do from Le Creuset, but this will be the last today's special value. And this value is extraordinary. $170 at retail. We're over $70 less tonight. This is an exciting time. Five easy payments on your credit card, and that's any card you want to use. I'm excited about this brand because I know what it's going to mean for your cooking. I know what it's going to mean to you as a home cook because I know what it means to me. It means quality. It means heirloom cookware. It means generational cookware. And it means marvelous results. The day I took over this show over 10 years ago, I said, if you want to be successful in the kitchen, you have to have the right tools. This is your right tool. There is probably no more used vessel in the kitchen than a skillet. Tonight is your chance to pick it up. Let's go back and see what Chef Nate is cooking. David, All right. I just want to say I love what you said about having the right tool for the job and the skillet um, being that tool for the job. I tell people all the time, get really good ingredients and get good quality cookware and just let the pan do the work. And so speaking of letting it do the work. This is, sounds amazing. This, Tell us about this dish because so the recipe is included. The recipe is included. They're sausage ricotta meatballs and we tried, the, tried these at the midnight kickoff. It, they're so delicious. Ricotta, breadcrumbs filled in there. The meatballs are browned in the skillet. You pull them out, you build your tomato sauce, you can see how it's simmering a little bit right here. I watched you cook this earlier. Didn't you saute onions and garlic onions, in here? Onions and garlic. Uh, olive oil. Olive oil, crushed tomatoes, a little bit of basil and oregano, Parmesan and mozzarella cheese on top. And then... It goes into the oven. Take it to the oven, and we'll, we'll let this melt ah, a little bit ah, so you can pull it out and see it. But David... give me some crusty garlic toast to go dip it in there. This is one you set down on the table and just eat right out of the pan. We're yes. not bothering putting it on a plate right now. Yes. Like you've been lost at sea for a year exactly. and you eat that thing when it comes out of the oven. Are you kidding? And here, this is a beautiful sweet potato gratin. And I just want to show another use for this. You can use this skillet like a casserole dish. So you're going to get that beautiful. Some mac and cheese in here. Oh, we might or might not see a little bit of that later. Who knows? But yeah, it's a the, good chance. The cheese is bubbling. I would let this set a little bit before serving it, obviously, because it's pretty loose right now. Yeah, it'll hold. You know, um, casseroles are a lot like meat. You need to let them rest so they kind of reabsorb their juices right. because if you serve them too quickly, they're soupy. Exactly. Yeah. I, but I do want to show quickly in here how this just swipes right off of that black enamel. And again, this is not a non stick spray on chemical coating. It's not raw cast iron. It is our proprietary black enamel. And just with one swipe, all of that cooked on cheese and cream and beautiful deliciousness in you know here what? swipes right away. And Chef, on my Le Creuset, when I'm cleaning mine at home, I just grab my Smiley Face Scrub Daddy. Works very well. And I get in the sink and I use a little dish soap and it comes clean every single time. My little Smiley Face Scrub Daddies we sell here on QVC, they're perfect inside the Le Creuset. And that means on both sides, the inside and the outside, I, because I'll clean the outside many times as well. Absolutely. Don't miss out on this opportunity. This is the extraordinarily versatile skillet you've been waiting for and looking for. John, how many ordered now in this show? 5,000 now wow. gone just in this presentation. Wow. 27,000 for the day. Wow. Well over half our quantity for the day is now gone in our final look or say today's special value of the year. Chef, any of these colors that sell out, we're going to take them off the table. Absolutely right. Now you're searing meat? We're searing some steaks, and I just want to show something again with this cast iron skillet. One, you want to heat it on medium to maybe medium high at the most because heat it low and slow. The pan will hold on to that heat, but let the pan do the work for you. Right now, these steaks are not turning. They still have longer you know what they're doing? to sear. They're talking to you. Yeah. 
Well, they're saying, don't turn me yet. I'm not, I don't taste good yet. Yeah, because if you turn me right now, you're going to rip and tear me. Yes. Yeah. What it's going to do is when that steak is ready to turn, it will naturally release. You got it. And then when you go to turn it, it won't fight you anymore. Right. And that means it's perfectly seared and ready to be turned. Right. When you fight it, that's when you leave all the little torn pieces on the bottom, and that's what burns to your skillet. This, you can wipe this out. If you sear it properly and turn it, you just wipe it out and you're good to go. I clean mine with soap and a little bit of mild water at I'm home. I'm hoping you're going to do a nice sauce in there too, maybe. You know, I'm going to show maybe some additional butter to go on there, but I can tell these need a little bit longer time. So well, I maybe we can throw in some, I don't know, some uh, peppers, not peppers, um, mushrooms. mushrooms and onions, oh, right? Mushrooms, I'm going to run over here and do a color tour Perfect. because we are getting limited in a few of our choices. So nearly 28,000 gone for the day. That brings us in this show to how many? 5,500, and we are still very, very busy. Your best ordering experience comes through QVC.com and your mobile app. Let's begin with Palm. I have 550 in this Palm to go around, then it comes off the table. If you want Soleil, I have 100 left. We will sell out of Soleil in this presentation. Right now, it's going to, well, not right this second, but here probably in, a, in another minute or two, it's going to be gone. If you want that Soleil, I've got fewer than 100. And then we're taking it off the table. There's no more coming in behind it. This is flame. 400, all I have left. Better than good chance flame will go as well. This is the iconic color, the first color ever at Le Creuset. Then I've got it for you in the white. Here it is in Provence, which is that gorgeous lavender. Then this is Marseille, named after the southern port city of France, that gorgeous darker blue. This is Caribbean. I have 600 left in the Caribbean. If you want the emerald, which is exclusive to QVC, 1,300 all I have left. Here's your oyster, which is that gorgeous darker charcoal gray. And then finally the color I collect in my kitchen, which is the cerise, and that's been most popular. Out of the number ordered in this show alone, 1,500 of them are cerise. This is $170 at retail. We're $70 and two pennies less. You're also getting five easy payments, and that's on any card you use. And that's any one of the seven that we accept here at QVC. So take advantage of that. You will get eight recipes, including, wait for it, Snickerdoodle Biscuit Plum Ooh. Cobbler. Right there. I could put my whole face in that. Okay. <laughs> and then leave her some room for ice cream. All right. I'd eat some room for ice cream. I'd just like eat a whole biscuit out of there and then make some room for ice cream. Okay. And then you're also getting your Le Creuset branded box. But all of this, proudly made in France, in the same foundry in the same small town of France as the company started 94 years ago. We have a little videotape of the factory. Chef Nate, will you narrate for us? I love this. You know, again, David, I promise we're going to get you there one day because you can see all well, of the history. If you get me there, you may never get me out of there. That's fine. Yeah. That's fine. They might miss you here. But <laughs> 15 different pairs of Craftsman's hand touch every single piece. Individual black sand molds are broken apart. They're really one of a kind. And this is what sets us apart more than anything else. That beautiful the emerald. And, uh, emerald, you can see it going on in the darker colors and then into uh, the lighter colors and the darker colors. You can see it firing in that oven at unbelievably hot temperatures. Look how shiny it is. It's so shiny. They're inspecting it. They don't want anything to go out that's not up to our beautiful quality at, at Lake Crusade. There's me packing up your box. And you can see me also giving some love, David. I bet you would share that uh, They'd sentiment. They'd have to pry me, me off that pallet. They'd have to pry me loose. But it just goes to show that it's the same process. It's casting. It's enameling. It's firing. We've we uh, we brought color to the kitchen in 1925 for the first time, and we're still doing it today. Chef Nate, some exciting news. What's that? We have lost our first color. Oh my goodness. Any guesses? Any guesses? Any guesses? Soleil. Soleil. Good. All right. Lucky our caller, our caller, previous caller got the Soleil. Joyce got the Soleil. So we're going to hand this off to Alana. Thank you, my friend. Now I'm told that the next color to go will likely be flame. So why don't we start? And I'll move this color up. I'll try to do this without doing the domino effect again, knocking them all over, because I do that sometimes. I do. All right. So there we go. Perfect. So this is the palm. 540 in the palm. Here is flame. 300. A moment ago, that was 400. So another 100 of those have flown out the door. Here's white. This is called Provence. I have 1,200 left in the, in the Provence. It's starting to get limited as well. This is Marseille, which is the darker blue named after that southern port city in France. Here's Caribbean. 
500 all I have left in Caribbean. Then in the brand new Emerald, only available at QVC and Le Creuset, 1,200 left. This is Oyster. And most popular is the cerise, which is the French word for cherry. You will get nine recipes with this. The branded box, our final Le Creuset Today special value of the year. And why buy it today? Well, at retail, this is $170. We are $70 and two pennies less. I think if you've never cooked in Le Creuset before, give yourself permission to buy this tonight. Get it home and see what all the excitement's about. Because I think the first time you cook in it, you'll understand why generations of cooks for 94 years have sworn by this cookware. Why we love it so much, why we have been anxious to bring it to you for on QVC now. This is why we're so excited to have this tonight, but tonight is your night, this is your moment. If you already know it and love it, maybe pick up an extra as a gift and help introduce the world of Le Creuset to another home cook that you know and love. Because this is the kind of cookware that will be around long after we're gone and other generations of cooks will enjoy it just the way we have. Let's go over here and check in with uh, Chef Nate Collier, who has already done some gorgeous cooking on this side. We've graduated to the other side. We have graduated to the other side, and I just want to show some more uses for this skillet. Like I said, it's the workhorse of the kitchen. I could pretty much cook almost anything, and you could too at home, cook almost anything with a skillet and a good knife. Two things I definitely need. This is a bacon wrapped pork tenderloin. It's one of the recipes As it in the booklet. Yes. I mean, pork wrapped in pork. It's just, it's delicious. It's my kind of redundancy, is what it right. is. Right. Yeah. And I love this skillet being used as a roasting pan because you can sear and render that bacon on the stove top right here to make sure you get it crispy all the way around instead yep. of having like a soggy spot on the bottom. We're going to add our veg up. Got one guy leaving. Add our veg right to this. <laughs> and then you're going to finish it in the oven. And you could even actually, here, I'm going to set this right back down here. Mm. You could even take it out, slice it, and serve it right in this vessel, too. But I want to show this will fit, if you wouldn't mind, David, uh, opening up the of door. Of course, of course. This is one of the table, uh, excuse me, countertop ovens. This is the Oster. QVC. This is the and Oster countertop oven. Fits in here with the handle, just like it should. Chef, if you'll step on the, either oven, back or this me. way, yep. one way or the other. There we go. Look at that. Both fit in there beautifully. Yeah. Close these doors, and everything is bubbling along, cooking along nicely and beautifully. Here's a cobbler fresh out of the oven. This we is... also did a skillet brownie in this as oh, well. David, do you want to show what I do want to show this brownie? Like? Because you know what? And you know what this is? This is a box brownie mix. This is not anything crazy. I mean, you could make homemade brownies if you want to. If you make homemade brownies, God bless. But you know what? I buy a box mix. And you pop it in here, and then you, you slice this up, and you serve it with ice cream and chocolate syrup. Scoop it right on top and just or eat it Or do that. Or do that and just leave me alone with a quart of milk. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. So this is, oh, hello. Well, now you're just getting, <laughs> now you're just getting serious is what you are. So you know what? This is what's so great about this. It's an everyday pan for brownies. It's for your morning scrambled eggs. It's for grilled cheese for lunch. It's for a stir fry for dinner. Whatever you love, Le Creuset is ready to stand up to this challenge. Now, this soleil is gone. And That's true. quite honestly, this brownie is going to be Maybe gone, too. Maybe let's just eat that brownie. Right I'm going to tear this up. And David, I'm going to put this back here. I love that we showed that because, again, box brownie mix, just like you said, it actually does taste better in cast iron. Well, to me, it does because I love those beautifully crusty corner pieces. Everybody loves it. Uh, everyone loves a corner piece, right? Cast iron, you get that all over because the entirety of the cast ah, iron ah. makes that beautifully crunchy, chewy corner piece. It's it's amazing. We're just starting a stir fry here, like you mentioned. Yeah. Similar to the fajitas, sliced meat, veggies. You can buy pre-sliced veggies at the grocery store beautiful, now. Beautiful. Beautiful. Little bit of um, it, this is going to be a ginger lemongrass stir fry, which is Ooh. one of the beautiful recipes included. But just this technique alone on this skillet, you can put dinner on the table in 15 minutes. You mean it's included along with that uh, snickerdoodle, snickerdoodle biscuit plum, plum cobbler you got it. thing? It's delicious, I promise. Oh, I'm ready for that. So we're going to let All this right. go a little bit and get a nice sear on it before we start moving that steak around. Hey, Chef, are you ready for a big number? I am ready for a big number. How about for the day now, we have taken orders for over 30,000 wow, skillets. Wow, that's a lot of skillets. You should also know that in this show alone, 7,600, and now we're putting in a beautiful breaded chicken cutlet. Chicken cutlets, you're right. We're going to make some chicken sandwiches out of this, but you could do, let me just turn this down a little bit. Yep. You could do a lot of different things in here. I love pan frying, David. I guarantee you that your grandmother, um, here you go. I'm just going to give this a little bit of a... I guarantee you that, David, that your grandmother 
uh, pan fried chicken in that skillet that you oh, of course were talking she did. about. And, and I was, would come over, she'd be doing hamburgers in that yeah, skillet. She'd do everything in there. Love hamburgers in a cast iron skillet. But in the South, in South Carolina, where I'm from, chicken is fried in a skillet. It's not deep fried because you get the beautiful texture on the bottom, those bits that don't scorch. They're golden brown, delicious. Mm. And again, this cast iron skillet, it's deep enough to do that pan fry. You don't have to worry about the oil. Obviously, you want to be careful, but you don't have to worry about the oil boiling over. And here's the best part. The cast iron keeps the oil hot. Yeah. What happens when you get cold oil and you put food in it? Uh, well, you get greasy food. Greasy food, and yeah. nobody likes to eat that. So as long as you're seeing the, oil, the bubbles come out, the steam is escaping, and the oil's not getting into your food. That's already browning. It's already browning. And David, look, we're going to flip this just so you can see. Oh, hello. Some of the little darker bits on there, you get those nice, delicious. G-B-D, golden brown delicious. delicious. And you know what that also means? It's not scorched. This was sitting on the bottom of the pan, frying, getting nice little texture on there. No black spots, no scorching. It, it hurts my feelings when people overcook chicken. Doesn't it? Yeah, because it's, it's, it gets too hard and crunchy on the outside. I'm like, what's the point? Yeah. You got to be careful. You gotta, it's an art. It is. You got to watch it. And you have to cook it in the right vessel. You absolutely cook it in the right vessel. This, if you're doing multiples of these or frying batches of fried chicken, you don't have to worry about the oil cooling down in between batches because that cast iron is going to keep it hot for you, David. It is so. And good. another important tip when you're frying chicken: don't take it cold from the fridge, flour it, and dump it right into the oil. You need to let that. Uh, you need to let it come to temperature a little bit more. I'm not saying leave it out for two hours. You've done this before. Yeah, you? but you've got to get it out of the fridge and get the chill off of it. Because if you don't, it doesn't matter what vessel you're cooking in, you're going to bring the temperature of that oil down if you put a super cold piece of chicken into hot oil. You got it. So you want to let that, come, you know, get some of the chill off there. Don't leave it out for two hours, that's unsafe. But just leave it out for a little while so you get the chill off and then get it in that grease. And just like this, because this has been sitting out for just a little while. It has. But Look right how back quickly. in, we had just fried that other piece and we're already up to temp going right here. Cast iron is the secret to doing this. And of course, you have the beautiful enamel to protect it, you have the beautiful colors to bring it to the table. This is what Lake Crusade is all about. You know what I was thinking would be really good in this skillet too? What's that? Chicken fried steak. I love where you're going with that because mm. you know what else you can do, David? You pull that out and you make your gravy in the yes. bottom of this thing and dump it yes. all over the chicken fried steak. Yes, that's oh, what my man. mother does. That's, I oh, my love word. that. You could do that with sausage She makes the gravy right and gravy. in the skillet. Yes. Absolutely. Yeah, the white gravy, the white pan gravy. Cream, the, cream, the cream pepper gravy. gravy. That's right. Yes, yes. All right. So over 30, is it over 30,000? And now over 8,000, oh, 30,000 on the day are gone. Well over half our quantity is gone. And over 8,000 in this show. If you want the palm, 450 left to go around. The flame, I only have a couple dozen left in flame. What? Alana's ready. She's going to take it. She's going to take it. Here it is in the white, a color we don't do very often. This is Provence. 1,000 now remaining in Provence. This is Marseille. 1,400. Caribbean. 300. We may sell out Caribbean as well. If you want the beautiful emerald, which is exclusive to QVC only here and Le Creuset, a thousand left to go around. A moment ago, that was 1,200. This is oyster. And finally, the cerise, which is the French word for cherry. This is $170 at retail. We're over $70 less. We're also going to do this as our final Le Creuset today special value of the entire year. There won't be another today's special value from Le Creuset closer to Christmas. This is it. So that's why you want to get yours now. Will we have other Le Creuset pieces leading up to Christmas? Absolutely. But this will be the final today's special value. You're looking for that great value. You're looking for that great price. You're looking for all the gorgeous colors. The one emerald color you can't get anywhere but right here in Le Creuset. And if you go to Le Creuset, you're going to pay more for it. So why not get it tonight? Treat yourself because when you get that box home, you're going to come to understand what it means to have your heart start beating a little faster when you see this orange, this flame color, and you see that brand. And then when you pull this out and see the picture of the skillet and the color that you ordered, then you start getting really excited because you know what you're going to cook inside here. Okay, we just lost flame. Flame is now gone. All right. So head back this way, Miss Alana. Hand you the flame. Thank you. So now we have sold out of two colors in this show. We started the day with 10. There are now eight left. Don't miss out on your opportunity. Is that right? Two, four, six, eight. Yes. All right. So 
If you're looking to pick this up tonight, this is your opportunity. Your uh, palm won't come with my fingerprints on it, I promise. There we go. Try to turn that so you won't see them. So here it is in the palm, the white, the Provence, the Marseille, the Caribbean. How many? 200 in the Caribbean. That'll be the next to sell out. A moment ago, I told you 500 in the Caribbean. Now 200 are left in Caribbean. This is emerald, the brand new emerald. Here it is in oyster. And here it is in the cerise, which has been the most popular color all day. $170 at retail. We're over $70 less. We're also five easy payments on any card that you use. And it's our final look or say today's special value of the year. Don't let this opportunity pass you by. For the day now, John, 33000 Wow. 31,000. 31, I, I was going to say, my goodness. Still, congratulations right. to That's everybody. Still very, very strong. <laughs> 31,000 for the day. And in this show, John, 9,000 wow. in this presentation. Wow. Chef Nate, the good news is we're not saying goodbye to you. We are not. We've got another look at this. We also have the oval cocottes coming Absolutely up. Absolutely right. And if you're looking to pick those up, do we have every color that, that, that we have in the today's special? I, I don't think we have 10 colors in it. I'll have to double check. But, but the ones we do have do match. Correct. Absolutely yes. right. We have six of the ten colors. Cerise, emerald, Marseille, white, oyster, and Caribbean. Perfect. And how's Caribbean doing in today's special value? 150. Wow. Last call in Caribbean in our today's special value. Stacy's over, got the meat sweats. <laughs> yes, she does. In such a good way. Though I would like some fries for some steak and frites. Yes, look what's coming up. A one day only from Ristelli's. Brand new for you today. You all are going to flip your lids. These are five ounce bacon wrapped sirloin fillets. These are center cut, completely trimmed, and you have your choice of whether you want eight fillets or, or 16. And you get your choice of one of three double smoked bacons, three different flavors of this beautiful double smoked bacon wrapped around, again, sirloin fillets that are completely trimmed and center cut. Comes with the steak seasoning. It's a one day only and incredible value on four easy payments. All right, so let's do a little trivia, right? Speaking of Rostelli's, we wanted to know, wanted to know, before becoming what is known today as the first Rostelli butcher shop, Ray Jr. and his wife frequented this location as children for which of the following? So think, before the Rostelli butcher shop, it was something else. Was it an ice cream store? Did they go to this place for fried chicken? Was it donuts or pizza? Hmm, ponder that one a little bit. I'd Ray be very Jr. happy with any one of those four wife. choices. Yeah, why not all together? I mean, it would be okay if it were an ice cream, fried chicken, donut, pizza joint. Well, <laughs> well, they do do fried chicken and donuts together in Philly. Um, federal, federal donuts. donuts. Thank federal you. Federal donuts. Mm -hmm. It's one of the best places in the city for chicken and donuts. You been there? You go there a lot? I live lots from there. <laughs> you mean you live blocks from there and you don't bring samples sorry, when you come down to Westchester? Sorry. Mm. You got to ask. I'll bring. You know what? What do I need to paint a sign? <laughs> Mark Charles, Massilli, and I are both back from vacation. We are. Although you went to Europe, I, I understand. did. I went on a food and wine tour. That must have been fun. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Did you have any of this on the cruise ship? I Yes, we did. <laughs> like this on the cruise ship every time. <laughs> they could have used the trace. You know what? I, now that you say it, they could have used that on the cruise ship. They could have used your product on the cruise yeah. ship. What we're talking about is Mark Charles brings us a set of two rectangular non slip serving trays. Now, this is a tray from our QVC commissary, mm -hmm. which is a fancy word for cafeteria. <laughs> and uh, these are like the old cafeteria trays we had in high school. They're just super, super slippery. But look at Mark Charles's tray. It's got little silicone tabs on it. It does. So, what it is, it's a grid system. That grid system is all pure silicone. It's never going to stain. It's never going to absorb any odors and it's never going to absorb any heat. But what's unique about it is it grips, but it doesn't adhere, it doesn't adhere to anything. It's not trickery. But the thing is, it's a grid system. What's a grid system? That's all one piece that's actually punctured through. Those aren't painted on, those aren't glued on. That's part of that. Why is that important? This is 10 times thicker and larger than these little nubs. Why? So when this is sitting in your lap, no sliding. When it's sitting on your ottoman, when you're eating in front of the television, not going to slide. In bed, breakfast in bed, not going to slide. So not only is your food and elements not going to slide on the top, 
but the bottom is not going to slide on any of your clothing. You get two of them. They nest beautifully. They're one of my most popular products that I brought to QVC. So They've one's a, a little smaller than the other. A little smaller. See, they nest right there. And large handle, guys, by the way, fits all. You grab it any which way on both of these, and the grid system is on both, and so are the silicone nubs. Now, it's important to know these are customer top rated. So we're super excited about that. We should also let you know these are our final quantities yep. of the entire year 2019. And some colors are gone already. Exactly. We only have three left. Yep, we only have three colors yeah, left. Yeah, because we actually had three, four, five, six. Six colors, and they're and all gone. And three of the six are already gone. Yep. So here's what I have remaining this is the white. Then I have it for you in red. From the red, we go to black. Now, Mark Charles, can I put these in the dishwasher and they get dirty? You can. I would, a top shelf. Oh, is it top shelf? Yeah. Okay. But remember, it's everything you know and love about silicone. So take something hot out of the microwave, it's not going to transfer the heat. Take something and spill spaghetti sauce, it's not going to stain. Silicone does not uh, hold odors, does not hold heat, and does not hold any kind of staining. So we love that. Here's the other thing that I love about it. What do you love about it? Hang on. Good. Hold the phone. What's up? Okay. Oh. Oh, look, I spilled. Yep. Oh, don't wipe it out yet. Okay. It's got a lip yeah. all the way yeah, around. So even if you do spill. So even if you if the soup dribbles out a little bit or if something sloshes over, yep. nothing's going to go into I'll your lap. This. And then if you do need to wipe it out, just take a wash rag. Yep. And it wipes or out Or a, a kitchen towel and bang, you're done. And what I love is remember, life is not perfect. Just that's why these trays are great. When you are transporting them from just a small area or going outside to the pool area, this is something to help you carry things with full glasses, everything from bottles and wine. This is not trickery, okay? So what it is, is a beautiful bottle of O'Leary's and some great wine that's actually been poured in. This is real glassware. It sits on there and it doesn't slide down. That's the secret behind having it. We put these angles here to show you. Now, this is not like some kind of trick that you should take everything, see how long it's going to fall over eventually. It's not glue. But yeah. the idea is that it doesn't slip on you. Every other traditional tray that doesn't have these nubs, whether it's marble, glass, plastic, wood, is going to slide on you. I'm going to bring this commissary tray out again and show you. When you've got a slow, thanks, David. When you got a slick surface like this, look, even just, a, let's just ju show you the uh, angle of this. Just a little bit, I'm tilting this, and it slides up. There's nothing gripping this. There's and a storm at sea. Bruce, Captain, Captain, oi. So now take this. I'm going to take this one guy. Yep. Thank you, boss. Put it on there, and let me put the same tilt on you. Look. And Not that's real sliding. Sauce. Not sliding. And if you really want to get, don't try this at home. It's, I've been practicing for years. But look at this. So the idea is, Total control, but it's not trickery. There's no glue. Did you see Mark Charles doing a little salsa move there? A little salsa. Dun, 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 it dun. was like a little. You should have seen me on Cinco de Mayo with this. I was all, I was crazy with the salsa and the guacamole and the margaritas. Nothing spilled. Hmm. <laughs> and by the way, I want to make a hands, comment about crazy, but I'm not going <laughs> to. I mean, we're just back from vacation. We're I don't want to start Things with are starting out nice. Okay, hey, let's talk about the white. <laughs> Most limited, how many? Just 900, 900 sets left to the white. Here it is in the red, 1,500 in the in the red, and we have a few more to go around in the black. Is that right? Final quantities of the year. This is customer and top rated. Is it on Easy Pay? You better believe it is. Four Easy Pays tonight. Any card you use. Oh, I beg your pardon. On this, you're right. If you want an Easy Pay on this tonight, you need to use your Q card. It's four Easy Payments on your Q card. Got it. Thank you. I just saw four pay and I lost my mind there. I don't know if we can get All close All right, so to four see. Easy Payments on your Q card. So this is $19.98 for a set of two of these. Yeah, for a set of two. And I got to tell you, all ages, everybody needs this. Whether you're clumsy, whether you're not. Again, these are the nubs just to show you that they're not painted on. They're actually pushed through. See the way my nail can get? It's just enough to get right on there. But it's flat enough that I can still put glassware and things. You know what I'm not those gonna are? Slip on it. What? Little grippers. Little gripper nubs. And one of, the, one of the things that I got asked about, you know, this was, again, unexpected. My father-in-law needs a walker, and he has to go from the kitchen to the living room to bring his coffee every day. And he asked me, and he saw this on TV, and he said, will it fit on the seat of my walker so it doesn't rattle the, the coffee? And I was like, sure, Dad, I'll get it. I got it from He asked for two more sets. He uses them every day, even something as simple Sweet. as that, that it fits on top of the seat of the walkers to get things from sliding. Remember, with that grid on the bottom, it doesn't slip on your legs if you're going to eat in front of the television and on your lap. If you are a person who wants to eat in bed, if you're sick, or you want to treat mom or dad to breakfast in bed, this is not going to slip on the bedding. And to have the non-slip here and the non-slip there, it just makes for a better mouse trap, what I like to say, for something we all need. It's a basic tray, folks. We didn't reinvent the wheel, but we put it, an edge on it to make it a better mouse trap. If you're looking to pick this up tonight, how many are gone? 
Oh, in the white, I have 650 remaining. That's the one Stacy has. Is it? Yeah. A few more to go around in the red, and then I also have the black. Don't miss out on this. It's $19.98, not for one tray, for two. Two. The next. And if you want to put it on four easy payments, use your Q card. Use your Q card. What's your big card today? Um, you know what? I don't it's know where the big it's card in your is. It's your wallet? Uh, well, it's in the wheelbarrow <laughs> somewhere. Hey, can I, can I, can I guess on the, on the question? Okay, uh, but, but well, let me read it first. Yeah, and read then it you again. Guess. I want to guess. All right. Before becoming what is known today as the first Rostelli butcher shop, Ray Jr. and his wife frequented this location as children to buy which of the following? Ice cream, fried chicken, donuts, or pizza? What guess? do you think it is? Well, only because of the Italian part, I would say pizza. It's actually donuts. Oh my gosh, I would have never guessed that. According to the Rostellis, this tiny one room butcher shop in New Jersey was once a beloved donut shop. What was it called, Ray? Oak Valley Donuts. Oak Valley Donuts. Yes. And what was your favorite donut to buy there? Uh, always the old fashioned. The old fashioned, like glazed? Nope, just the old fashioned. Just an old fashioned just donut. An old fashioned. All That's right. An achy one, David. I kind of would like a joint that sold ice cream, fried chicken, donuts, and pizza. But that'll work. Yeah, <laughs> that would work for me. All right. Hey, let's talk about a one day only value. Let's talk about Ristelli Meats. We didn't just dream up that trivia question and not tie it to Ray Jr., who's right here, who took his wife to that Great donut to shop as kids. <clears throat> this is exciting. What we're talking about tonight is bacon wrapped sirloin. Yes. This is two of my favorite flavor combinations. <laughs> when you bring Fine center cut beef with fine center cut bacon. There is no, there is no better pairing. What you should also know, this is not filet mignon. I don't want anyone to be confused. Right. This is sirloin, but we call it sirloin filets. Why? And I'll show you right on the block, Dave, because it's easiest to see. When we take a whole sirloin, we take just the center. And just the center, as you can see, it's very cylindrical. So it gives you a filet shape. So that's why they're called filet of sirloin. But look at the beautiful marbling inside this steak. This steak has been aged for 28 days. Wow. Completely trimmed. So you can see there's nothing on this except meat. And then we take that double smoked bacon. Double smoked applewood, double smoked pepper, and double smoked hickory. And we wrap that around that, and we put a little pin in there, and all you've got to do is just put it on that La Crusade skillet like we've done tonight, Ooh. and it just comes out incredibly tasty. Now, this will be available in a choice of three flavors. There is no combo. I'll alert you that off the top. So, choose one of the three following flavors. Hickory. Now, that means the meat is... Um, is cooked over, or excuse me, is um, the bacon. The bacon, rather, excuse yes. me, is seasoned with the hickory. Yes. That's our most limited choice. <clears throat> then I've got it for you in black pepper, and that means the bacon has been dusted with black pepper. Yes, and smoked over hickory. That's correct. And then dusted with the black pepper. Yes. And then finally, the applewood smoked bacon. This is double smoked bacon, yes. right? Mm -hmm. This is not going to be, you know, kind of mm -mm, just mm -hmm. a little bit of flavor. It's a lot of flavor. And then each one of these choices comes with the packet of the steak seasoning mix. All of this for a choice of either $59.98 or $99.98, depending on whether or not you choose eight or 16. Each one is five ounces. Auto delivery brings these to you every 90 days for a year. Stock up and save with that 16 piece count, Ray, and you're getting $19.98 savings. Now, this is the sirloin filet. This is the sirloin filet. With the bacon. With the bacon. And you can see it looks mm. just like a filet mignon, but we wrap that bacon around it to give you that flavor. Okay. All right. Uh huh. Mm. Melt in your mouth sirloin. Double smoked bacon. Yes. All conspiring for the first happy dance there since we're vacation. <laughs> Come on. I might have done a few yeah. of these on vacation. <laughs> Come on. That is crazy good. Is, isn't that incredible? Mm, you now, know, these will last in the freezer how long? These will last in your freezer for 12 months. They come individually vacuum packaged. We don't make sure that they last. They won't last that long, though, because you're going to, once you put these on the grill, we get, we're in the you're middle of the They'll just go very quickly. But they're all center cut. And look at the thickness on this. I want to show you how thick this Gorgeous. steak is. And it's wrapped completely with bacon. And of course, we've got a little skewer inside of there. And I want you to sh want to show you that actually on the cooked one. So we put that skewer in there to make sure the bacon stays on. So after you're done cooking it, just pull that out. That way you don't eat it. All right, just pull it It'll out. It'll be a little crunchy. Aside, be a yeah. little crunchy, but look at this steak once we take That's that. That's a mistake you make yeah. only once. <laughs> <laughs>
But look at how gorgeous this steak is. Every single steak has just Come got this on. kind of beautiful texture. It's all sirloin. It's got that kind of juiciness. Now that juice is, Dave, we see most of it's coming from the beautiful sirloin. But when you take this double smoked bacon and you wrap it mm -hmm. around it and you cook it, the sirloins get infused with that incredible flavor from that bacon. The bacon is thick sliced. Yes. The bacon is double smoked. The bacon is made just for Ray. Yes. And these steaks. And it's all center cut because we want to make sure that it's only the best bacon goes around this incredibly good steak. Oh, my word. Now, again, these are not filet mignon. This is sirloin, but it's <clears throat> center cut sirloin. That's why we call it a sirloin filet. It is then wrapped in center cut bacon that has been double smoked. Yes. <clears throat> now, either double hickory smoked, double hickory smoked with a, uh, a dusting of black pepper, or the applewood bacon double smoked. That's correct. Yes. Ooh. But if mm. you want the hickory eight count, 200 remain. Hickory in the 16 count, 100 remain. Mm. All right? Now, the reason you want to think about auto delivery on this is because you're locking in that great price. Yes. Now, Ray, you have uh, educated us a lot over the years about the cost <laughs> of beef. And when does the cost of beef tend to go up? It tends to really spike midsummer, but then around the holidays, David, just typically we see a 15 to 20% increase in pricing. So if I buy this tonight and put it on auto delivery, then I lock in this price every 90 days for a year. Yes. So the same price, regardless if your cost goes up, you honor this lower price. That's correct. That's, that's correct. a great deal. And David, we only do this for QVC. Um, this is a steak that's very, very special. Um, being aged 28 days and getting this type of bacon to wrap around it. This, and I have to tell you, each one of these is done by hand, trimmed by hand. Mm -hmm. It is cut by hand. It is wrapped in bacon by hand and then individually vacuum packed. So every piece of steak here is, is really touched by our butchers. And we have a simple saying at the butcher shop, David, and you know it, and that is if it's not good enough for our mom, and it's just not good enough to give our QVC guests. Or Here's your meat guests. shop. Yep, and you know, that's where we live. You know, we've got our guests that have been coming into that butcher shop for over 42 years now, and I get the pleasure of talking to guests every day, and it's, it's my favorite thing to do, because when they come in, they trust me. They trust their butcher, you know, and because I know they're going to be back next week. So the one thing I always get asked is, Ray, what's for dinner tonight? So I have to make sure that I'm always make, giving that, that mm. guest something they're going to be pleased with, and I will tell you, Trust me, on these steaks, this bacon oh. infused flavor on this steak gives you a steak that you just never tasted before. And the tenderness of the filet of sirloin is just incredible. The, the beautiful marbling, and that's really what it's all about, David. We're, we're Italian, and we live for food. And, you know, we around the holidays especially, so you're thinking about a wonderful gift. This is absolutely an incredible gift as well. Well, and I always say a gift of food <clears throat> is the perfect gift to give when you're buying for someone that has everything. Yes. Because you know what? They're going to love a gift of food. They're going to love an elegant gift of food. I will tell you now that if you want the 16-piece count in any one of our three flavors, they're all getting limited. If you want the pepper, 250 to go around in the 16-piece count. Applewood, 175. And the hickory, uh, I have six dozen left in the hickory 16 count. Oh, my count. goodness. So these are all going quickly. Everyone's loving this bacon wrapping on here. This is what makes this an extraordinary taste experience. When you pair a double smoked bacon with this gorgeous center cut sirloin, now that's a flavor combination I'll have every day of the week. It really is, and the thickness. Uh, this is something I think is so important. This is center cut, and when you get a center cut sirloin like this, we get a nice, big, thick, juicy steak, which means I can cook it rare if I'd like, or I can cook it medium rare mm -hmm. without really destroying the steak. If you like them well done, it's real simple to go that way. But again, beautiful steak is gonna, it's, when you marry the sirloin steak with any kind of bacon, and now that it's a double smoked bacon, the flavor is just gonna burst in your mouth. And oh, boy, does that ever. <clears throat> isn't it incredible flavor? This is wildly <laughs> yes. good. Don't miss out on this opportunity. Everyone's loving the great price tonight. You're going to love this because we've got a lot of summer left in front of us. Yes, we do. We've got a lot of grilling season left in front of us. And <clears throat> even after the summertime is over, it stays warm and it's grilling season well into October. So this is, uh, and, and good grief, sometimes in some years here in Pennsylvania, early November, I'm still grilling. Yeah. So this is what is so exciting about this. And if you want to throw these in that look or say today's special value, let them cook away. You don't need to fire up the grill. You can cook them inside. Yeah, and that actually, that's what we've done right here, David. You know, Lacrosse is such an incredible product. We've been able to sear these steaks 
pull them off of here and they're just perfect each and every time. Just can't go wrong with it. Mm, 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 mm. Uh-huh. Might have had another little bite. <laughs> well, it's, you know, once you start, it's very difficult because, again, you marry those two incredible flavors of a sirloin, center cut sirloin. You want to be close point. to this. Yes. And you, what you want. You had, look at this beautiful bacon. And I love getting the crispiness. Look how crispy yes. it gets on the outside. And, and, and again, because it's lean, that's one of the things that's really oh, good. ever good. So one of the things that I love to do when I cook my steaks, if you go right down here to the skillet, I'll show you something that's, that's really simple to do. Please. Just take your steak and put it up on the side like this, right? Oh, to get a little sear on get the side. Get a little sides. sear on the side, and, as you, and get a little sear all the way around. And what that will do is it will crisp up the bacon, just like you see there. And of course, yes, it will. if you like to crisp up that bacon like that. Chef Nato, they're smiling. Yeah. Yes, he is. <laughs> yeah, he loves bacon just like we do. Yes, yes. All right, so let me just tell you, the 16-piece count getting limited across the board on all three flavors. A lot of folks choosing auto delivery so they can lock in that great price. Remember, you may cancel that at any time. So you're not locked in. All you're doing is locking in the great price. Yes. And then enjoying this great, great steak. Now, in the hickory, eight count, 100 left. Two dozen in the hickory, 16 count. In the peppered, eight count, 350 remaining. 200 in the 16 count, and then the applewood smoked, 150 in the 8 count, fewer than 100 in the 16 count. This is going quickly. This price only good until end of day today or until your choice sells out, whichever happens first. So get yours now while the getting is good. Mr. Rostelli, it is always a great hey, pleasure, great sir. Nice to see you. Nice Thank to you have so you back. Much. Thank you. All right, stay on the line for this. Let me update you about today's special value from Le Creuset. 32,000 for the day, and in this show, you ready for a big number? I am. Over 10,000 wow. in this show. We just had another color sell out, and I'm going to guess it's Caribbean. Caribbean Good is guess. gone. We now have only seven colors left wow. out of the 10 wow. we started the day with. Now, we go from enameled cast iron to Le Creuset in stoneware. And one, one thing we know to be true about stoneware completely versatile, wonderful efficient use of your heat or your cold, depending on what you have inside. You're also going to love that cleanup is so easy because of that wonderful glaze on the inside that makes it just so easy. It makes it a wipeout. And then you can also pop these into the oven. You can put them into the dishwasher. They're microwave safe. These are awesome. They're called cocottes. And you get four of them. Each one is 10 ounces. And here they are in my gorgeous color, the one that I love. This is the cherry. We also have it for you in the Caribbean. Hey, Stacy Lou, I have your oyster in these. If you love that oyster, I know you do, and you collect. Mm -hmm. And Stacy Lou, I know how you like to cook nuts and twigs. <laughs> <laughs> you so have you some could for me? you could do a vegetable gratin in here. Ha <laughs> 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 ha! Your mic is up, so be careful. <laughs> and uh, then you could serve it to all your dinner guests. But you might need two sets, darling, because I know you got a lot of friends. So you might have eight people over. See there, you get four. You might need two sets. Just saying. And this is free shipping, which is a good night to do this. That's why you want to get. See, you knew what I, where I was going with that. Yes. So here's the Caribbean. Here's the oyster. This is Stacy's color. Here's the white. I also have it in uh, Marseille. And finally, that gorgeous emerald. And Chef Nate, let me ask you, is the emerald in the stoneware also exclusive to QVC? It is, yes. It is. So mm -hmm. the emerald in any treatment. You got it. Is ex OK. I will tell you, already going quickly are the Caribbean and the Cherise. I bought a version of these. I believe the ones I bought were round. The round ones. And I bought them because I love doing individual dishes in these. You can do individual meatloaves in here. You can do individual uh, mac and cheeses. You can do individual pot pies, which I believe I spy with my little eyes, and you, you're doing just that. You're absolutely right, David. So these are great for individual portions. And you can do individual portions just as a service style, or we're, we've got the pot pie filling going in our skillet right here. I'm going to fill it up. This looks now, a little bit like my recipe. I, I think it actually is your recipe, <laughs> David. Now, you could actually cover this whole thing in a pie crust and do a pot pie in here and serve it. Well, you it. could just put all the biscuits on top. You could. Yeah. I, you are a smart man, David. See there? But here's what you do that's so much more fun. You put these on top, and make little biscuits. These are 10 ounces, David. That is a, a big portion of pot pie. Can for I freeze you to in these? You can freeze in these. You can fridge oven, 
Uh, I believe the cream brulees were browned in the oven in that, and a microwave safe. Under I'm, the uh, broiler? Under the broiler. Wow. I'm glad you mentioned the microwave safe, David, because a lot of people don't want to heat things up in plastic anymore at home. Yep. I love to heat in the microwave vegetables and other things right in here, and you take them right to the table. And what's great about these, those go right into the oven now. Right I, would, into the I oven. might put those on a sheet pan. Um, Depending on what size oven you're, you're dealing with, or how big your oven racks are, or how wide they are, but they will fit right on the rack if you need them to. And here's something that I think is lovely. Is that French onion soup? It is. You want to help me make some? So here is some shepherd's pie. So oh, just that's like, shepherd's pie. Just like okay. the pot pie. Again, you fill it. You put it into the individual portions. You put it in the oven to brown it, and it will stay warm, David. Now, look back here. We've got the soup filling all ready to go. We'll take a shot of this right here real quickly before I pop this one on. Now, we've already got that beautiful beef broth and those caramelized onions inside, right? Then you put some toasty bread on top, or what the French would call a crouton, right? You got it. And then you top this with, you can either do Swiss, you can do Gruyere. You can do a couple different cheeses. Why yeah, not? Why not? I, I only sadly only have three slices here, so I'm gonna half this one. I worked in a restaurant where we sold a lot of French onion soup, and we did Gruyere and some mozzarella right on top. Oh, you did mozz also. Also, a lot of nice. string when you pull it out of there. So ah these are gonna go back in as well, David. Those are my fave. I love down. French onion soup. And then, David, you can see how well this is so melty and delicious. I've got your oven door. Thank you, sir. Take your time. Got these out, and again, the stoneware is oven safe. It stays warm when you bring it to the table. These beautiful, cute little cocottes, again, they're going to match the color of your cast iron. So you can do your onions and your broth in your um, Dutch oven or in your skillet, and mm. then they will match exactly what you put in here with the French onion soup. And when, I, and when you caramelize those onions, I want you to caramelize them low and slow, and I want, you to, I want you to spend some time with it. I want you to get those onions dark. David. Because that makes the best and most flavorful French onion Patience soup. Patience is key with those. It yeah. is so much better. If you pull better. onions out of your skillet and they're still a little bit white and translucent, put them back in. I want them to get good and caramelized you and brown it. because that's where the great flavor comes from. Now, we don't have a lot of any one color to go around. So if you see a color you'd like to have, you're getting four of that color. Now, here's the set of four in the cerise. I have 600, and that's our most popular choice. Look how shiny and gorgeous this is. And we'll always look this good. Because of that wonderful high fired glaze that Le Creuset puts on these. Now, here's Caribbean, 300 left. Here it is in the oyster, 450. Here's the white, 450 left here. This is Marseille, 500. And finally, I have it in the exclusive color of emerald, 500 there as well. This is free shipping and handling. And as I mentioned to Stacy, if she's gonna buy two sets of these, tonight would be the night to do that Absolutely because you're not right. paying not a single dime for shipping. Shipping is free on this. So order as many sets as you need because you're gonna be saving a lot of money just in the shipping alone. And then now you've got oh thank you. Just be careful of the platter. It's all the platter so warm. is very hot. I just want to taste the broth. It looks so it's nice. It's so good. And David, I'm glad you mentioned that because the broth is so key to so many different di dishes. You have to be patient, cook those onions, get your broth going. Mm. Sweet so onions. So good. Sweet onions. And good. It's just it's so delicious and it makes it so much more fun to eat right out of this. You can do um, side dishes, individual sides to pass around the table with the lid on. You can do crudités and warm dips. Mm -hmm. You can just use it as a bowl. You can store in this. So if you have a little bit of leftovers left over, leftovers left over. That's I got a little, <laughs> if you have any leftovers left over. You put them right in here. You put the lid on it. It goes in the fridge with the lid on it. You don't have to worry about covering anything up. I was just tasting the cheese to make sure it was safe. It's safe. Mm. And so, David, again, hot stays hot, cold stays cold. So this will be hot when you cook your cream brulees, and then when you want to chill them to serve them, they will stay cold in room temperature. You could even put the lid on here after, um, before you brulee them to, to prevent them from getting a film on them, and just brulee them right before you're ready to serve. And your once guests. that sugar caramelizes, you crack it with your spoon yeah. and get in there and just oh and hello. Also. Look how easily that just swipes right away from the glaze. I'm going to eat this bite in a second when the hammer's not should. anymore. I think you should. It just wipes it. right away. And again, similar style glaze and exact match colors to all of our cast iron. So it has the same cleaning and maintenance properties as the cast iron. You're iron. getting four of these no matter what color you choose. Uh, that cerise is most popular. I also have it in the Caribbean. 200 here. Here's your oyster, your white. Your Marseille and the exclusive color. Look at this gorgeous emerald.
I love that ombre on that lid. It looks so Look great. how pretty that is. So gorgeous. So stay on the line for these. They, of course, have a Le Creuset emblazoned across the lid, which is important. You have to say it like this and wave you your hands. Do. So that's going to be important. Don't miss out on this. You enjoy the creme brulee. I will. We're going to see you back with today's special you got value. It, David. Speaking of today's special values, there's one kicking off at midnight tonight, but Stacy, we don't have to wait until then, do we? No, we are going to have a special preview. You know, it's one of the most popular brands at QVC in Germany and is quickly becoming a household name here in the States. Kuckbluma, you love their silicone brushes. And so for the first time here in the U.S., we're going to have a today's special value, a four-piece silicone brush set with extras. First of all, these brushes are designed to clean anything and get into tight spaces. We're going to have, for the first time ever, from Vintage Wine Estates, a sparkling wine. So after you're done drinking, easily clean out your champagne glasses. But look at this. I mean, how about vessels skinny like this? What would you use? This four-piece set covers it all. And then on top of the four different silicone brushes, you're getting two of these amazingly plush microfiber cloths. All of this for less than $30 because it's going to be a today's special value. By the way, for washing your face, ladies, oh my gosh, you're going to love these. So we'll have a preview coming up in just a bit. Incredible value, incredible brushes. Now it's time to throw it back to the big guy. So happy he's back. And I'm so happy about those great tools. We're going to be giving those a little preview coming up. And you won't have to stay up till midnight tonight if you order yours during this show, which is always an added plus. Get the little extra, you know, shut eye. All right, let's talk to you about Cook's Essentials. Let's talk about the two quart digital stainless steel pressure cooker. Now, what we love about this two quarts. You've been asking in overwhelming numbers to bring in the smaller appliances, the ones that'll cook for two or four people, depending on what you're making inside, or cook for two people with leftovers for the next day, right? So this is what it's all about. We're going to do it tonight at a great clearance price. That's the good news. The bad news is once it's gone, it's gone for good. That's why you want to get yours now. Let's welcome in Chef Joe McAllister, who's back, member of Hello. our Cook's Essentials team. How many years now for you? Uh, 11 years. 11 years. Yeah, wow. Looking crazy. very sporty there in your jacket, Chef. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, so let's talk about cooking under pressure. Right. What happens when we cook under pressure? So when we cook under pressure, you're sealing in all of that moisture, all of that flavor, whatever ingredients, whatever aromatics you used, all of that flavor is sealed inside. So you're also cutting down on your cooking time as well because it's a small vessel compact space and all of that moisture and pressure is actually cutting down your cook time. So let's say for example you want to do some baby back ribs. So a whole rack of ribs is done in about 30 minutes and the way that it's done is that we use our searing or browning feature first okay. and then we cook under pressure actively for about 10 minutes to get that kind of moist result right there. Look at that. The bone is left in there. It well, you just know what? I always right say out. with ribs, if your bone comes out clean as a whistle, you you done good. Yes. You done good. You did it right. Exactly right. And then what we can do is we can add our favorite sauce right at the end. But look how delicious that is, and tender, and done in 30 minutes. Mm, that's crazy. Amazing, right? So when we cook under pressure, two things are happening, as Chef Joe just explains. We're cooking faster, but we're also cooking with greater flavor. And I think for most of us, we would sacrifice cooking faster if we thought we were going to have a greater flavor. But here you get both. Exactly. You get faster cook time and you get greater flavor because whatever you put inside is being forced into what you're cooking. That's right. Now, in this case, we did beautiful barbecued beans. Is that right? right? Yeah, so this is a very simple recipe, favorite sauce, some brown sugar, um, some aromatics. But we started with dried beans, right? So the dried beans actually cooked in about 25 minutes and then adding the sauce another 10 minutes, so in 35 minutes minutes from dry. But chef, if we were doing these beans from scratch and we had dry beans to start with, wouldn't we have to soak them in water? Overnight. Overnight yep. to Overnight. get them soft enough, right? And then cook them. So instead of waiting <laughs> almost 24 hours to cook yes. them, you cook this dish in how many minutes? So this is done in 35 minutes. That's crazy. Isn't that crazy? So 35 minutes or 24 hours? Huh. Yeah. What do you want? Huh. Who wants beans faster? Yeah. That's exactly right. Exactly. And so. you want to throw a little bacon in there for extra flavor? Oh, we'll infuse oh. the bacon, the bacon flavor right in there as well. Absolutely. And you can see from the two quart serving here, I'm serving out portions of beans, and now I have leftovers. I have enough for the next day. That's great. Maybe with lunch. That would be fantastic. Now, Chef, I'm going to go through colors real quickly yes, sir. and uh, let everyone know and remind you this is a clearance price. When it's gone, it's gone for good. This is the only on-air presentation of the month. And I am told at retail 51.66, we're 16.68 less. 
with the free shipping tonight. $22.18. Oh, that's just crazy town. So this <laughs> is the eggplant. The most popular is the stainless steel. I have a thousand left here and then it's gone. Okay. Here it is in the cinnamon. Right. Eight fifty in the cinnamon. This is like expensive car paint colors, is what this is. Then I've got it for you in the copper, eight fifty. And then I think that's it. Just the four. Yeah, we're done. Um, you should know colors. there's no reorder on this. The five no. easy payments will go away end of day today, and it's already uh, 20 minutes to 10 East Coast time. So this is why almost 20 minutes to 10. Um, hello, mac and cheese. Yes, hello, and a bacon. little bacon. Let's introduce bacon to the mac and cheese. There well, we go. Well, um, I think they're well acquainted, <laughs> at least in my kitchen, they are. Yes, yeah, they, they are. are. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Look at that. I know. I love that you're not stingy with the bacon. No. And this mac and cheese, believe it or not, is done in about 12 minutes. So oh, I believe it. So you're putting your dry ingredients in, you're adding your cheese, the bacon garnish right at the end, and how incredible is that? And you may try this if you wish to. Well, you know what? <laughs> Twist my arm. There you go. All right. I'll be glad yes, to do I that. I want you to go ahead and try that. It's delicious. It's creamy. The, the, the macaroni is actually not an overcooked macaroni, mm. and I love that about this. You get the perfect texture, and any time of day is a time for mac and cheese. I swear, when we're here at 3 in the morning, we're eating mac and cheese. We're eating mac and when cheese. When we're here at 6 in the afternoon, we're eating, we're eating mac, mac and cheese. You better believe it. I always say I'm the big kid who never grew up. There you all grow. right, so this is what it's all about. So this is lovely too because we can do a braise like this. Remember, two quart capacity. It is tiny, but it is very mighty. Now, is this chicken? This is chicken cacciatore. So chicken done in a hunter style with the mushrooms and the red wine. How long would this take and uh, in a traditional braise? So in a traditional braise, I just wanted to get some sauce down on the plate first. In a traditional braise, you're looking at about three to four hours to get that kind of tenderness. Yeah. And this is done in just a half hour. Oh heavens! I know it's amazing. So those chicken thighs. They're so tender. Look at this. I can just pull that right off of the bone right there. That is, that is tender. That is delicious. And we're serving it over a lovely polenta right here. And then we can garnish with a little cheese if we want to. But look, I'm still pulling food out of this two quart pressure cooker and we're going to have leftovers tomorrow. That's amazing. Let's talk about color choices and let's remind you we've got this in the eggplant. Mm -hmm. And this eggplant is the gorgeous purple color here on the end. So remember, when these are gone, they're gone for good. There is no reorder on this. And we've got it at a great price tonight and free shipping and handling. The five pay will go away end of day. Here's your eggplant. Most popular is the stainless steel. Six fifty, all I have left to go around there. And when it's gone, gone for good. This is cinnamon, six fifty to go around here, and finally the copper. There you go. Seven hundred left in the copper. Eleven hundred ordered in this presentation. I want to remind you, with the free shipping, you're saving over twenty-two dollars with this. There you go. Now I'm just going to take you through the presets on this, David. So we're starting over here with a high pressure option, low pressure. So that's about seven and a half pounds per square inch. The high pressure, fifteen pounds per square inch. You can keep warm, which is the default function when all the other functions are done. It'll go to the keep warm over here. If we just want to use it as a slow cooker, we can do that, and then we. We move on to other options like the browning option up to 30 minutes. So if you're doing a pot roast, yes, I said a pot roast, you can do a three to four pound pot roast in this two quart pressure cooker. And then chili done in 15 minutes, believe it or not. That is amazing. And then lastly, rice in just eight minutes. Only on air presentation of the month. Five pay goes away end of day today. Oh, are you doing potato salad? Potato salad. So we've got our potatoes. They're nicely steamed here. Now, this is a non stick interior, and remember, not metal utensil safe. So, what we want to do is we want to be careful. We want to use silicone tools or wooden paddles when we're working. So, you're with working that. in a little mayonnaise? Absolutely. We've got our. Uh, uh, there's a radish in here. We've got a Japanese radish, or the watermelon radish, rather. Some celery. We can watermelon add. Watermelon radish is so pretty. I know, right? A little Gorgeous. pop of color in there. It's just amazing. Now we're going to add some parsley to that and a little bit of scallion. Why not? Can there I add go. a little black pepper? Absolutely. Please do. I love black pepper. Now that's a wonderful presentation to your table. And with <laughs> potatoes that are steamed in here, done in just 10 minutes. Whew. That's fast. Can you also think about steaming potatoes in here, then popping it into a mixing bowl oh, or and, and get your hand mixer out and make some quick mashed potatoes? Absolutely. That's what's really great about this as well. And remember, the cleanup on this is easy, just a little warm soapy water because this little cooking vessel comes out. That's right.
right. I do want to let you know how many gone now, John? 1,500 are gone. I have four color choices. Two of them are going quickly and will likely sell out. Let's first tell you about eggplant available. Here's the stainless steel. I have 350. A moment ago, it was 650. Now it's 350. Here it is in the cinnamon. 500 left in the cinnamon. And then I've got copper. 600 in the copper. Let me move that. Oh, absolutely. Oh, table right so there. You're, okay. you're also noticing that it's, the floor. there you go, a small footprint. It's 10 and a half inches in diameter, and the cord is 36 inches. So you've got three feet there, and you're going to leave this on your countertop. Why? Because you're going to use it almost every day. Your side dishes. In the morning, you want to do your grits. Perfect for grits. Love it. Over here, rice. Rice done in under 10 minutes. This We could do a saffron rice. We could do a chickpea rice. This is just a simple pilaf with some tomato and some celery. It's just gorgeous. Now do that's a wild one, rice in there. Yeah, absolutely. One Can I do portion. risotto in a pressure cooker? Absolutely. So the thing about pressure cooking is you get the risotto started using your browning feature and your, your right. fat, right? And then cook it uh, for just 10 minutes or even under 10 minutes, and you're going to add your other ingredients, your uh, stock and your cheese, right at the right, end, right, right, right. and it'll soak it up. Oh. And it won't be overcooked. It really actually is a love, very good process. Love risotto. So here we did some braised beef for the tacos. Well, right? you know what? It's what was really exciting tonight. Um, uh, every uh, every so often, QVC does a broadcast crew appreciation day Aww. and they bring in dinner for us and they yes, did that today they did and they had tacos tonight and they were oh, so good nice they had like a big taco bar and that's I fantastic had a, i had a few of those before i went on the air tonight you want a few more <laughs> we've got it was here. two i wanted to do five there was a line all right so i had to move along uh, but this is fantastic because if you want to do a braised beef like this for tacos how nice right yeah wonderful and ready in 30 minutes and ready in 30 minutes now the only thing better than that is when the company buys you dinner and no you're not cooking yeah <laughs> which was what happened tonight but, but qbc thank you for our lovely employee dinner tonight it was lovely so this is the eggplant i've got stainless in the stainless Oh, that just sold out. Uh oh. Stainless completely. Very If you want popular. the cinnamon, 350, and in that copper, 500. Chef Joe, a great pleasure. Thank you so sir. much, David. Thank Good you, to see you. As always. Thank you. 2,000, I think, are gone now. Well, let's check in with our girl Stacy because if there's a place. That is close to her heart. It's near the wine. Oh, of course it is. And what are we doing for the very first time? We are going to have. Just wait. Our very first sparkling wine from Vintage Wine Estates. This is the Summer Celebrations Collection. This is Leticia. This is a California sparkling wine that is delicate, slightly sweet. Look at those bubbles. Yes, salute to that. It is one of several selections. We have a Cab Sav. We have a beautiful Pinot Noir. We also have a gorgeous Chardonnay. You can choose a three bottle set of the variety you like best, or you could do a case. You could even get a mixed case. And I have to say, if you do the case, a $24 bottle of wine now becomes $11 and change. It's the first time we're going to have sparkling wine from Vintage Estates. Perfect time of year for that. And again, cheers for sparkling wine. Well, we find ourselves in a unique and exciting place tonight because typically you wait for midnight Eastern time to see a today's special value kick off. Well, we thought tonight we'd take some time during In the Kitchen with David at 9.46 p.m. East Coast time and bring you a sneak peek a look at what we're going to launch at midnight tonight. Now, many of you are familiar with this brand because you've seen it on In the Kitchen with David before, has sold out so many times we can't count, but the first time ever we've done it as a today's special value. And it's silicone, it reaches the places other tools can't, paired with some great microfiber and already 1,000 sets are gone. This is a sneak peek of tonight's today's special value. Here we go. So the name is Kochblume. Did I get that right, Mark? So this is a beautiful brand, a four-piece silicone brush set with two microfiber towels. These tools are made of silicone. They've got lots of little scrubbing fingers 
that will get into places that other cleaning tools just simply can't reach. The microfiber cloths will clean without scratching. Yes, the tools are dishwasher safe. Yes, the microfiber is safe for your washing machine. You're going to love it because these tools become heat resistant up to 400 degrees. And you're getting all four of these great tools and look at the size and shape of them because you've got the ones that will fit up into the little tiny baby bottle tops. Those wonderful cylindrical vases that you may have. The brand new tool tonight, which is going to be your best friend in the kitchen for all the washing that you're doing. And then this flat scrubber with those flexible little fingers. In addition to these four tools, you're getting this plush, super absorbent, two-sided microfiber towel and you get two of them. You're getting all of this for $29.46 and already over a thousand of these are gone. I've got great colors for you, but let's also talk to you about value real quickly before colors. If sold separately, this is nearly $51 at retail. We've got it tonight for $21.50 less. Here are your color choices. This is the orange. This is the beautiful purple. Here it is in green. Don't forget the gray. I also have it for you in aqua. And I finally have it for you in the red. This is two easy payments tonight. Use your cue card. It's four easy payments. This brand comes to us from Germany. This brand is one of the most popular kitchen brands at QVC Germany. And again, here's what you're getting. Long brush, dish brush, bottle brush, the new glass brush, and two microfiber towels. A value story again brings these in at nearly $51. We are over $21, well, we're $21.50 less. And then two easy payments on any card you use. Use your cue card, and it's on four pay tonight. Let me introduce you to the man that brings this brand to QVC, both in Germany and here in the States. Mark Denenberger is back with us. Good to see you, sir. Hi. Did I pronounce this correctly? You, I, 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 fantastic. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so Koch much. Koch Blumer. Koch Blumer. Well, it is so exciting. And what we're, what we're really tickled about is that this does so many different jobs in the kitchen yes. and reaches where other tools can't. Um, this one is perfect for your dishes, also for your pans. So perfect and heat resistant, up to 400 degrees. We have the bottle brush in the set. Comes in every bottle, in every corner of the bottle, also on the bottom. Then new, we have the glass brush. So you can clean every glass, like wine glasses, drinking glasses, perfect. And we have the long brush, which is perfect for your vases. Um, in the set comes two of these towels extremely soft and um, with open hairs, no loops. So you can touch even if you have like the strong uh, skin on your hands, nothing will, will um, stay there. And look at this. You can go on your iPad, on your iPhone, even if you have your glasses like mine, plastic glasses, no problem, nothing scratched. 1,200 now in this presentation. Everyone is loving this great idea because what we're excited about is having the tool that reaches the nooks and the crannies that other tools simply can't get to. And we all have those pieces that we put in the dishwasher and they never come completely clean because we can't reach those areas. This is the top of a baby, this is a cover for a baby bottle. Do you have another tool in your kitchen that would be flexible enough to get way up into the tip of this baby bottle cover? I'm going to guess probably not. And what would most of us do? We'd soak it to try to get the dirt or the mess or the food particles out of there, right? The perfect thing is all those uh, four brushes you can put in the dishwasher. It's always clean. No it. germs, no smell, no nothing. They stay for nearly a lifetime in your kitchen and you can always use them again. Perfect. So then we talk about these microfiber towels yes. and they are super, super absorbent. And you've got a little demonstration for us. Right. This is the, the white one. It's a normal towel. Dish Maybe, towel. Yeah, you have at home. This one is our microfiber. Here we have twice uh, 10 ounces of water. Yeah, we have okay. two cups with the identical amount of water. Look at this. I just put them in. See that? And I, I pull it out. And you see what happens? Oh my word. This one is empty and it's really empty. And even here on the, on the tip, it's dry. Okay. So and it's I not even dripping and you get two of these, uh, of these claws. And these are 
safe for your washing machine. The only thing we ask is you don't use any fabric softener. Don't put these in the dryer. They're best if you hang them to dry and then they're ready to roll again. If you're looking to polish or shine your, your stainless steel appliances in your kitchen, your glass countertops, or not glass countertops, glass stovetops, all those areas where you want to be able to have something that will clean but not scratch, microfibers where you want to go. Look at how absorbent these towels are. Look oh, at that's this. crazy. And the fantastic thing is, if you have like sink mats or something like that, you pull everything well, now let's out. Let's do this. Let's just come over here yeah. and get with the other towel left behind. Easy. Look at that. <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> now it's all spotless. And, then, and, and it's all in here. And what Stacy said is it's perfect just to for your body if you if you have makeup in your face my my wife loves it. Let me uh, real quickly just show colors. Yeah. I'll be right back with you because how many gone now John? 2000 are now gone in this presentation. You're looking at a sneak peek you guys and gals. So if you don't want to stay up until midnight tonight or you can't keep your eyes open at the end of our show then you can order yours now and go on to bed knowing your color is on its way to you. What are you getting? Let's actually, guys, can we look at those graphics? That might be the best way to do that. And then I'll do colors. So here's what you're getting. Let's hold on this for a moment. You're getting the long brush. You're getting the dish brush, which is the flat uh, brush with all the little fingers on it. Then the bottle brush. These are super flexible on the end, so they get into those nooks and crannies. The glass brush, which is brand new, and two of the microfiber towels holding on this graphic still. The handle on the long brush, the bottle brush, and the glass brush are all interchangeable. And I'll tell you, I'll show you what I mean by that in a moment. But let's first look at value. If you were to go to buy these separately, you'd be paying almost $51 for all of it. We're going to do it tonight for $29.46 or $21.50 less. Two easy payments on any card you use tonight. Four easy payments if you use the Q card. Now I told you that I'd show you what I meant by being able to interchange the handles. These brushes come off. Hang on. There it is. So you pull the brush head off, and now I can swap it out with either of these. So if I need this brush head on that handle, or I need that brush on this longer handle, I can do that. So they're all interchangeable. The only one that is not is the flat brush. That's a single piece. But they all go in the dishwasher. Yes, Mark? Yes. So they're all going to go into your dishwasher. Quick and easy, here are your color choices. This is the orange. I also have the purple. Here's your green. This color may look black to you at home, but it's a, it's a dark charcoal gray. We're calling this gray. Just know it's a charcoal color. Then I've got it for you in aqua. And then here's your red. Again, we're looking at $51 and nine, excuse me, $50 and 96 cents, almost $51 at retail. We're going to do it tonight for $21.50 less. Talk to us about this, Mark, about what we're seeing here. Uh, you see the lung brush and the ring. You can go into, into uh, bottles, really narrow bottles, um, and clean everything. Um, even the hot pan, we will see that live here in the show. Uh, up to 400 degrees, no problem. Dishwasher safe, what I love. I love. Uh, about these items because they are always clean, no smell, and you can use them every day as a fresh, like a new brush you bought, like maybe in the morning. And if you got a super hot pan that you want to scrub out, no worries, because these are going to resist heat up to 400 degrees. That's what makes these so extraordinary. You want to be able to put a little dish soap on there, you can. It'll hold that dish soap, but all those little Scrubbing fingers there, Mark, are all made of silicone. Yeah, and the perfect thing is you go in with that brush in your glasses and you just turn it once around and that's it. And look what I do. I just put that on the oh, side of my... Oh, you use it as a drying my... towel. And, and look at this. You put it here and all the, all the water goes into that towel and you don't have the... What's that? Kalk? I don't I only have the German word, but like the... the, the oh, um, the water spots. Yes, right. water spots. You don't have them water spots. Uh, at the end. You're probably talking about the calcification, aren't you? Yeah, uh, water, uh, water um, stains, water spots. And even if you have those, if those uh, beer classes, you take this... Do you all have any beer in Germany? Um, <laughs> at some spots. A little. Yeah, a little. A little. A little. Look at this. I just take this with the brush. And I go inside, and you try everything uh, in th on the inside. You only have some of the finest beer in the world in Germany. Yes. We yeah, I've been to Oktoberfest. Oh, you that did? Was, yeah, it's a good time. Yeah, it's a good time. Um, I've never been to the Oktoberfest. Have you not? No. 
And the tapping I'm, of the tape now, they do on I'm national now, television? Uh, I'm now 24 or something. I, I forgot. If he's 24, so am I. Okay. <laughs> he's younger than I am, but he's not 24. I'll tell you that. Um, hey, this is $29.46. I do know that for a fact. So we're super excited about this set tonight. It's already very popular. Lots and lots of you are making your choice now. If you're using any credit card, we'll honor two easy payments. Use your Q card tonight. It's four easy payments. Don't have a Q card tonight? Then feel free to apply because if you apply and get approved, make a purchase of over $25, which this is, we're going to put a $20 account credit on your membership account, which you may use toward a future purchase. So let's back out $20 on this purchase. Now you pay $9.46 for this if you apply for a Q card tonight and get approved and make this purchase because ultimately we'll give you that $20 credit toward a future purchase or toward the balance of whatever you're doing. Now here's a hot pan. Yeah. And yep. we've got two different types of brushes. Your today's special value. Right. And a Brand X brush. Yeah. Right, and we, now we have 400 degrees in that hot pan, and now I do something. I push both brushes inside the pan very, very strong, and look what happens. This one will melt. See oh. that? And to ours, nothing happens. And look at the bottom of the and pan. This... Look what happened. That Brand X brush melted all over the bottom of the pan. And now, nasty. see what? We go and take the, whoop, the pan under the water, and see that? I can clean all that. What? And it's gone. And it's gone. That's crazy. And see that? I think we have a little tiny bit there we missed. Oh. We'll just go back and get him get in there and, and get after that. Scrub him off. Now, let's remember also, and you've also got that little, um, the little rigid part there that you can do some scrubbing with. Don't miss out on this opportunity for two easy payments on your credit card or. Four easy payments, any card that you use, excuse me, four easy payments on your Q card, two payments on any card you use. This is a pre sale event, meaning this kicks off tonight, midnight Eastern time. You can order your set now. What are you getting? Let's take a look at our graphic again and remind you that you're getting the long brush, the dish brush, which we just used, the bottle brush, the glass brush, and two microfiber towels. What is our value story? If sold separately at retail, you're looking at almost $51. We've got it today at $29.46. Well, actually, it kicks off tonight at midnight. You don't have to wait till then. You can order it now. Get the lower price. You're saving $21.50, then two easy payments on that credit card, and that's any card you use. Here are the color choices. I've got it in red. Here's the aqua. I have it in gray. Now, this is a charcoal gray. So I want you to think about that darker, darker uh, charcoal gray. It's the closest color I have to black, okay? Here it is in the green, then purple, and finally the orange, which they can see from space. Yes, they can because it's <laughs> very bright. All right, there's a reason they make those traffic pylons out of orange so you can see them. I saw a lot of them driving to work today. Pennsylvania is a state covered with them. I don't know why. All right, so this is two easy payments of 1473. How many gone now, John? 4,000 gone in this presentation. Here's another great example of how these brushes get down into the nooks and crannies that other brushes would fail to reach. Now, this is a beautiful little wine carafe. It's a decanter. A decanter is the word I was looking for. Yeah. Thank you. And uh, you can clean with the long brush. See that? You reach every corner of that decanter, and that's perfect because the head is flexible, even the handle is flexible, and so you reach in here. And sometimes if you have a strong red wine, you have uh, all the... You have the, some residue. The, yeah, yep. rest inside. And we take the same one, and we go into vases. Like and you know what? You have I have a decanter at home, Mark, and when that happens to me, I don't have your brushes. So I'd have to run water in there, put some dish soap in there, and leave it to soak. Then I'd have to swirl. Then I'd have to put more water in there yeah, and keep so rinsing it until I can. And it never comes completely clean. This doesn't fit in my dishwasher. Yeah, it's, it's made of glass, so I, it's going to be something that's hard for me to clean. We're talking about something as small as a wedding ring. Look at how this will absolutely be flexible and clean something like your wedding band. Isn't that crazy? Because if you're leaving that wedding band on as you should, I'm told, 
Um, then it's going to get dirty. You got to clean it. All right. So this is V36300. Look at this. Here's the, here's the top of the baby bottle. Do you have another tool that'll get up there and get that dried milk that starts to stink when it gets caught up in there and you can't rinse it out or clean it out? And look at that. It's flexible. These tools are amazing, folks. This is why they have sold out just about every single time Mark brings them to QVC here in the States. This is one of the most popular kitchen brands at QVC Germany. Mark is one of the best known kitchen guests in, at QVC Germany. People stop him on the streets in Germany and say, aren't you, the, aren't you the dude from QVC? They probably don't say that in English. Yeah, they don't. They probably said that in German. They said All right, so 5,000 of these are gone. Um, and the aqua and the red are both super popular. Let's go to our phone lines. We're going to welcome Carrie in Nevada. Carrie, how are you tonight? I'm good. How are you? We're doing very well. And Mark and I would both yeah. love to know, what do you think of these wonderful, flexible silicone tools? I think they're, they are the neatest things I have seen for cleaning. I'm so excited. Now, what, what demo did you see that kind of said, all right, I've got to have these? Uh, when he was doing the glasses. Yeah, and getting down into the, the little, the very bottom. Uh, the, yeah, into the grooves, the glasses, mm -hmm. and I was real impressed with that wedding ring deal. How about that? This thing is so flexible, and it's it not going to damage his wedding ring because I'm sure his wedding ring is a beautiful 18 karat gold. We already know that's a little softer, so you don't want to do anything to damage it. So no, it just looked incredible. I just had to have this. Well, and look how nice this is as well. You can get in here and clean out the inside. And I don't know if you have any of these little um, these little uh, sport bottles that are made of double uh, wall stainless steel. Yes, I do. Look how nicely it gets right down in there and right. cleans it all the way to the bottom. I am so excited. It fits in anything, even the little uh, my perfume bottle deals in my bathroom. Yes, yes. What color do we have tonight, Carrie? Green. You got that nice lime green, didn't you? Yes. Yeah. Oh, I'm so glad. Mark, let's walk over this way to colors Yo. if we can, because we're going to show Carrie hers up close and personal. But And you're also getting two of the microfiber cloths, Carrie. Yes, I'm so excited. Well, this is fantastic. I'm so glad we had what you were looking for. And here's the good news, Carrie. You won't have to wait up until midnight Eastern time to order yours. Yours is already on the way. Right. Oh, I'm. So, oh, they just look wonderful. I. Haven't seen anything like this in a long time. Well, we're super thrilled that we had it for you tonight. Glad that we could help you out, and we hope that you will stay tuned. We've got another couple of hours tonight on the air and lots more to share with you, okay? Okay. Thank you kindly. David, you're the best. Oh, you're sweet. Carrie, it's nice to meet you tonight. Have a great rest of your summer, okay? Okay, I will. Thank you Thanks, so kindly. Thanks, love. Be well. All Always right. a pleasure. Take care. Bye-bye. Okay. So let's take a look again, Mark, at the, uh, and now over 5,600 ordered in this presentation. Pretty incredible when you realize that you're getting so much in this offer. Real quickly, Mark, walk us through what we're what we're receiving, and we'll take a look at this graphic. So the long brush, and then we have the dish brush, the bottle brush, and the glass brush, and two of these very very soft microfiber towels. Then of course the value story, nearly fifty-one dollars at retail. You're four pennies shy of fifty-one dollars at retail. We're going to do it tonight for twenty-one dollars and fifty cents less. I don't know about you, if somebody offered me $21 in cash today, I'd take it and promptly order a pizza. All right, two easy payments on your credit card of $14.73. Use your Q card. You can put this on four pay tonight. Let me share with you color choices. And again, we have this beautiful orange, bright and cheerful. Beside the orange is the purple. This is what Carrie in Nevada picked up. This is the green. This is gray. It's a dark charcoal gray. Then I've got it for you in aqua. Very popular in the aqua. And then finally the red, which I know is popular with my foodies. And take a look down below. You're getting the matching colored claws, but they will have another color on the reverse. So the red has orange, the aqua has pink, the charcoal or the gray has a lighter gray, the green has yellow, the purple has pink, and the orange has yellow as the reverse. And you get two of those super absorbent. I've got 20 seconds. You want to show us this absorption demo again, real quickly? Hang on Look. one second. Two cups with each one. Is that one cup of water? Yeah. Okay. Uh, it's one and a half. No, one and a half cup. Yeah. One and a half cups. Ten ounces. Okay. So Look regular kitchen towel and the microfiber. And watch this. Let it do its thing.
and check it out. Which towel would you rather use? Yeah, that's an easy choice to make, isn't it? So this will officially kick off tonight at midnight. And when it does, Jane Tracy will tell you that already over 7,000 are gone. Mark Denenberger, a pleasure, sir. I'm going to see you tomorrow. Tomorrow evening. Yes, you and I will Thank be together. You. We're going to be cleaning the kitchen with David at 7. Yes. Okay. And then we have down home with David at 8. Looking Perfect. forward to it, my friend. Always good to Bye. see you. Thank you. Pleasure. We're going to be back in just moments. We've got another hour and about 50 minutes to go. And we've got more of today's special value. We've got more great items to share with you. Stick around. You're in the kitchen with David. It says on my apron right there. Get your home ready for the holidays with the help of home decor expert, Valerie Parhill, during House to Home Holiday Edition. Be there starting Friday at 1 a.m. Eastern on QVC. It's our 32nd annual Christmas in July sale, and we're celebrating with a $25,000 sweepstakes. All month long, you can enter for chances to win great weekly prizes from some of our most popular brands and our $25,000 grand prize. Visit QVC.com or the QVC apps through July 31st to enter and for official rules. Now when you share what you love about QVC, you can get rewarded by being a part of QVC's brand new advocate program, Q Crew. Share your faves from QVC.com on social with your family and friends, and when someone shops your link, you get a commission. To find out more, search Q Crew on QVC.com. Supersize your holiday decor this year and be the talk of your neighborhood. Be there at 2 p.m. Eastern for David's Great Big Christmas on QVC. Welcome back, everyone. It's In the Kitchen with David. I'm David Venable, and this is time to get excited about wine. And it's a one-day only priced item, and or I should say items, because there are multiple bottles here. We're talking about all California wines, and for the very first time, my foodie friends, we're including a sparkling wine. After all these years of doing gorgeous vintage wine estates selections on QVC, it's an extra dry sparkling wine, meaning it's a sweeter sparkling yeah, wine, right. perfect for summertime, get it as cold as you can get it, <laughs> and then serve it and enjoy. This is going to be extraordinary. Now, I have a choice of four varietals. You may choose those in a three or a 12 bottle option. Three bottle will give you three of any one varietal. The 12, you can do all white, all red, or what is always our most popular, a mixed option, where you get all of them. You'll get three of each of the four varietals. Now, Auto Delivery delivers these every four months for a year. These are all California wines, as I mentioned. And you've got five easy payments, and we're delivering to 41 states, including Pennsylvania. But the newest state to join the vintage wine family is Oklahoma. And the wind's not the only thing sweeping down the plane there. <laughs> the wine comes right behind it. All right, let's welcome Brian Doherty back with us. Nice David, to see you, sir. Thank you, sir. I'm hoping you've got that sound we're all anxious to hear. Oh, I, I think I do. That's the one. <laughs> That's the one. Sparkling wine for the first time. This is it. So we have uh, so many people enjoy Prosecco. We've given you our California take on Prosecco. Ooh. And you say that an extra dry sparkling wine is going, you were telling me and helping me understand before the show, that it's a sweeter wine, yes? Yes. So the, the, the uh, sparkling wines work the opposite of the still wines. Mm -hmm. So you have extra dry, extra brute is the driest, then brute. Then extra oh, dry good. is kind of what we have here, which is just over the sweetness, just a little sweetness on the finish, and then there's a demi sec. So this is a hair on the sweeter side. Oh, but I like it. How is that? Oh, that's good. Is that great? I love a sparkling wine, particularly in summertime when it's so hot outside. You know, some whites you want to chill but not get super cold. Right. You want to get this one as cold as you can get. Oh, it. it's beautiful. Get in that California Innovations tote with all that ice and get it down there deep in the ice until you're ready Add to serve it. Out on the it. deck, on the barbecue. With fruit, with spicy food, whatever you love Isn't to serve, great? this is going to be ideal. It's got that. Beautiful little hint of sweetness on the on the finish that That's kind of really offsets nice, the crisp. Oh, it, it came out great. We're so happy. Oh with my this. gosh, it just came out so beautifully, and it's so refreshing. Yeah. And nice because it is muggy as a dog's mouth outside. <laughs> it is so hot. Now I know come winter I'll be complaining about the snow, but seriously, it's hot outside. This, this is, is gonna be so refreshing and lovely. Oh, it's great. You can make mimosas with it. You know, you think about bringing a gift. Well, bring we a bottle of sparkling to somebody. Totally. Right? And what I wanted to let you know, and we want to spend a little more time with the sparkling because yep. we've never done it before. Yeah. <laughs> but we do have four varietals for you to yep. choose from. So, first is the set of three in the sparkling wine. Right. 
Then we have, I believe this is a Chardonnay. Chardonnay. Yep. Chardonnay. And then from the Chardonnay, we go to the reds. We this is the Pinot Noir. Beautiful Pinot Noir. And then we have the Cabernet. Cabernet. Now, if you want the Cabernet three bottle or Pinot or um, Chardonnay. Chardonnay, I have 100 each in the oh three my bottles. Gosh. <laughs> now, those would be $75 for a, a trio of those yep. at retail worth $30 less. Yeah. It's crazy. Yes. <laughs> then, if you want to go with the 12 bottle route, which I would highly recommend because we're going to deliver it straight to your door. You don't have to lug a case of wine out of the wine store. Plus, people talk, and then it just gets weird. Yeah. All right, so here it is <laughs> in the all white. I have 200 in the all white. That's all I have to go around. That's it. If you want the all red, get six 200 and six. there, six and six. But what is going to be the most popular will be the, are we calling this mixed? Mixed. Mixed. And in the mix, you're getting three of each of the four varietals. So three of the sparkling wine, three of the Chardonnay, three of the Pinot Noir, and three of the Cabernet. Yep. That's always our most popular choice. You may choose this either in the three bottle for $45 or the 12 bottle for $139. Three bottles at retail would be $75 worth $30 less. 12 bottles at retail would be almost $290 yeah. worth $150 less. And Brian, we deal. deliver straight to everyone's doorstep. Right to your door. And you know, if you follow David's advice, you get the mix. You've got everything covered. You've got your beautiful sparkling wine to greet people or just for having cocktails. Mm, I love it. You've got an incredible Chardonnay, which we're going to taste in a second here perfect for seafood and fish and then you've got two different reds all the way through those beautiful uh, steaks wrapped in bacon do a big <laughs> old sirloin wrapped in bacon with that cabernet holy cow hey can i tell you also that we're awfully excited that we can do this for you tonight at this price and at this easy pay there are five easy pays tonight so take advantage of these but this price will expire end of day today real quickly let's take a look at our delivery map and then we'll sure. get right into the chardonnay take a look here the newest state to join the vintage yep. wine family is Oklahoma. 41 so now, states. Yep. 41 states. Everywhere. If you live in one of the white shaded states, make <laughs> friends with someone in a red shaded state. Or get invited. Yeah, that would be the best way to handle this. And then we're going to get you all worked out. We have the sparkling wine, now let's get into the, into the Chardonnay. So this is a great, well we're all excited about the sparkling. This Chardonnay is really something to try. I love it. So it's a Chardonnay. crisp, clean Chardonnay. It's got a little bit of Sauvignon Blanc in it. Mm. It's got a little bit of Riesling. Great for summertime. So this is, I think of this, you think of lobster tails. Yes. Right? Crab cakes, any seafood. Any fish on the grill, exactly. Any fish on the grill, anything outside on the deck is just, mm. oh, it's just crisp, clean, refreshing. Boy, is that perfect. Isn't that good? Really <laughs> nice. This is not an oaky shirt. Oh, no, no, no. Not at all. Well, it's summertime, right? Yeah, you don't want the oakiness yeah. in the summertime. At least I don't. So this is really, really dynamic. Oh, that's good. Great color. Really, great really flavor. Good. All right, let's get into nice reds. Nice and fresh. So next up is our Pinot. And you can see it right out of the gate. This is the lightest of all the reds. It's got that beautiful light red hue to it. Think of it kind of as red fruit is what, what I think about versus the Cabernet. Mm. So oh, this well. is good. Anything with red sauce, right? Oh, or, or I made spaghetti and meat sauce the other night. It was so good. Ah, or as a crossover. Mm. Like, uh, I mean, I like a Pinot with salmon. You know, some mm. of the beefier. Fish. That would be nice with right? salmon, some wouldn't of the, it? Right? Really look nice. At that. That's lovely. And Isn't not nice? bitter. No crazy aftertaste. Smooth finish. The tannins oh. are, are nice and smooth. This is lovely. Isn't that great? It's a nice wine. And last but not least. The Big Daddy. The Big Daddy. <laughs> and we've pulled out all the stops for this one. So this has got, it's mostly Cabernet, but it has some Petite Syrah, some Petite Verdot, Ooh. and a splash of Merlot to finish it. Just a splash. Just a splash. Just a splash. So it's got all those big, bold flavors. Mm. So if you were getting that, uh, the sirloin with wrapped in bacon. Or a big old ribeye on the grill. Or a ribeye. Or a, or a, a or York strip. A couple of burgers. I might serve this maybe with a big, nice um, prime rib roast. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yeah. So it's got all that great flavor, but it has that smooth finish that's a sign of a really well-made more you know expensive what? wine. If you've not had great experiences with yeah. reds because you feel like they've got too much of an aftertaste, they're a little too bitter, a little too strong, this is the way you want to go. Yeah. Because you're getting all the benefits of the red, you're getting the great flavor, but you're not getting that, that unpleasant oh, yeah. aftertaste. This is smooth as silk. Oh, this is, this is from Cosentino. These guys mm. do a fabulous job. It's one all of my, California wines. All California wines. This is one of my fav favorite wineries to visit. Sadly, I cannot finish all of them. <laughs> because I'd have to Uber home. Yeah, I would. Yeah. So, this is your opportunity. I've got, I may, I may have some takers. 
in the studio if we need to like finish off these <laughs> bottles that we've opened. But let me tell you, if you're looking at this uh, sparkling wine I, in the three bottle, in the three bottle sparkling wine, I have fewer than 100. Oh my gosh. These are going pretty quickly. They're going to enjoy it. We've ne <laughs> oh boy, are they ever. We have never done sparkling wine never. before, and this is summer. Get it as cold as you can get it. It is so it's beautiful. delightful. Beautiful. This Chardonnay is light, crisp, not oaky. There's some Sauvignon Blanc in there. This is a lovely, yep. perfect drinking wine for summer. Then your Pinot Noir, which is that nice bridge wine you always, you've always taught yep. me. That if you're not a red wine drinker and you're wondering where do you begin, a Pinot Noir is a great place. Pinot Noir is a great one. And last but not least is this big, bold Cabernet with the Petite Syrah, Petite Verdot blended into it. Gives you all that big flavor, no harshness, smooth as silk. Mm, Just so fabulous. Nice. Now, if you want the three bottle sparkling wine, John, fewer than 100, then. And then the three count in the Chardonnay. Oh, 100 each in these. Okay. If you want the 12 bottle all white that gives you six and six, 150 remain. The all red that gives you six and six, 200 remain. But if you want this mixed, that's our most popular, and only 400 remain. But we brought wow. in more of those oh, because yes. they're always the most always. popular. <laughs> it's important to know that this price will go away at end of day today. And that means you won't see it again at this price for a minimum of six months. Right. And in six months, summer will be over. Yeah, yeah. If you Way want to, over. If you yeah. want to stock up. You, you know, know what's happening six months from now? Here comes Santa Claus. Here comes <laughs> Santa Claus. So this is what it's talking about. This is your time now because summer is here. We're in the midst of it. Yeah. Yeah. This is the night. I mean, when I was on vacation, people said, David, what'd you do on vacation? I said, I laid around like third base. That's exactly what I did on vacation. <laughs> yes. I did as little as possible to relax and recharge my batteries. And this is the kind of invite folks over, put nice music oh, yeah. on, the, on the stereo, and you just know, enjoy you know, some, some outdoor summertime. Some people think you have to be someplace fancy or somebody in a tuxedo has to serve you with sparkling wine. That's not the case. You can enjoy it where you want, how you want it, especially mm. at this kind of a deal, and I deliver it right it. to your door. Brian, these are so nice, so refreshing, great? so perfect yeah, we're for very summer. Proud of this. And they're all California wines. Look at this delivery map. We delivered to 41 states, including Pennsylvania and now Oklahoma. Brian, a pleasure, <laughs> sir. Thank you, David. Nice to have you back. Welcome back. Well, thank you. <laughs> it's quite a welcome back with all that great wine. All right. We are making my stuffed French toast tonight, and earlier we made that wonderful filling that includes softened cream cheese, chopped pecans, cooked bacon, and a little maple syrup. Spreading that in between sliced challah bread, and then we make a traditional batter for this French toast. Now, to my two eggs, I'm going to add some whole milk. Then I'm going to add in some cinnamon and a little sugar that has been out here in the muggy heat. So let me break it up a little bit. There we are. Now, get in, do some little tight whisking in the middle of this bowl so you don't slop it everywhere. Break up those yolks. There they go. And then we'll take this bread and we'll soak it. Now, the bread's already been filled with that great filling we made earlier. And then we're going to get this into a buttered skillet. But where will we find a buttered skillet? Hmm. Does anybody know if we got any skillets in the studio tonight? Are they hot and full of butter? I think Le Creuset is right around the corner. Another look at today's special value. So I'm just going to take this tray right over there. We're going to get these onto the skillet and get ready for your very best value of the day. The one that is already well over half gone. Our final one of the year. This, my friends, is Le Creuset. And our today's special value starts right now. So now two-thirds of our quantity for the day and today's special value is gone. Wow. Two-thirds of what we brought in is out of here. We brought in 10 colors on the day, and three of them have sold out. We only have seven remaining. And when I tell you we only have seven remaining, some of those are now getting limited. Wow. So what we're talking about is a brand that has been around in France, made in France, proudly made in France. Since 1925, 94 years, they're still located in the same small village of France, in the same foundry where this company was founded, 
back in 1925. So now you're looking at this versatile everyday skillet. The skillet that is 10 and a quarter inches in diameter, nice and deep and holds what you love, two pour spouts, a stick handle, and a helper handle. All of this done in beautiful cast iron that has been very carefully coated with enamel. And that enamel has been fired on at unbelievably outrageously high temperatures to make it strong and durable and to last long after we're all gone. That's what makes this so extraordinary. Now, we started the day with 10 colors, but now 41,000 units. Oh, I beg your pardon, we started with 41,000. Here's what I have left, okay? In the palm, 320, and then we'll take it off the table. In the white, 2,500 to go around. In the Provence, 900 in this gorgeous lavender, it's called Provence. In the Marseille, 1,000. In the QVC exclusive Emerald, 850 all I have, and then we'll take that off the table. In the Oyster, 750, and in the Cerise, 1500 but we brought in more cerise than we did anything else. Just in this show, we've taken orders for 3000 in the cerise alone. I have 1500 left in cerise. What are you getting with this? You're getting eight recipes, all crafted by the chefs in the Le Creuset Test Kitchen. All of these recipes are uniquely designed for this skillet. This is the one that I want to make, sausage ricotta meatball bake. How are you doing? Yum. Or... Snickerdoodle biscuit plum cobbler. Yeah, I'm loving that too. And then warm spinach and potato salad with crispy prosciutto. Oh my word. <laughs> and all the great recipes that are in here, there are eight total of them. And there's that cobbler, brown butter, berry, and pecan oatmeal bake. What? Brown butter? Okay. So this is what it's all about. Great recipes, great cooking vessel, unbelievable value. How much would you pay at retail? $170 for this skillet. What's our cost tonight? We're $70 and two pennies less. We're $99.98. This is our final look or say today's special value of the year. So we started the day with 41,000. We only have a handful of these colors remaining. Well over two thirds of our quantity for the day already spoken for. A lot of folks buying two of these today Why to not? give us gifts. Chef Nate Collier is back with us from Le Creuset. It's a great pleasure Everybody's to have David, you here, sir. Great to be back. Thank you for working on my stuffed French toast. Look at how beautiful this is. I mean, you can see that nice golden crust on the French toast. It's not scorched. It's not burned. You know what some of that is? It's the cinnamon. That, I smelled that. Mm -hmm. And you know what? Cinnamon, some spices like that can burn if your pan gets too hot, yes. if it's too thin. Yes. It smells deliciously like cinnamon. We're cooking slowly all the way up through so the custard bakes all the way through that bread, David. This you is going to be so good. If your butter browns a little bit in that pan, I won't be mad at you. No, brown butter is good, David. Oh, Scorched black butter is bad. not good. Bad. And butter will burn in a hot second. And cast iron will keep the perfect temperature for you to get that delicious, I love that nutty aroma and, and flavor of brown butter is Ooh. so good. When Chef Jeffrey Zakarian was here not long ago, he made scallops and a brown butter oh, sauce. Oh, delicious. That's one of the best things I've ever put in my mouth. Um, this is an extraordinary pan tonight. We are very, very busy. Lots and lots of you are saying, you know what? I can't miss out on this. It's the final today's special value from Le Creuset of the year. Now, does that mean we won't, we won't have any other Le Creuset for the remainder of the year? No, no, we will have items. But we won't have another today's special value Correct. The, for the rest of this year which is why you want to get this skillet now. Chef, you were telling me in the last presentation that the skillet is probably one of the most versatile and most used vessels in the kitchen. It really is. It's such a workhorse because it can do everything we're doing here. We're doing gentle French toast. We're going to do fajitas. We're searing steaks. We're searing chops. We'll do this um, sausage uh, ricotta meatball bake in the oven, which I know I don't think you've tried it yet, David. We tried it on the midnight airing with Rick. It is so good. Oh, I'm ready to but tear it up. Flat cast iron and covered cast iron have been used for cooking for thousands of years. We've perfected it by putting that enamel on it, both for our covered Dutch ovens, but for these skillets too. This 10 and a quarter inch skillet, it's enough for two, four, six people. You got the helper handle, the stick handle to maneuver it. But look, we have five of these on the stove right now, David. <laughs> and sure, it's crowded. We got a lot going on, but it's not too crowded. We still got plenty of room to You've move around. You've got plenty of room and nothing's getting away from you. And that's what I love about something like this because it allows you then 
to enjoy that fantastic, beautiful result and also allow you to cook over medium heat. You got it. Now we've got a little factory, not factory footage, but animation that will talk to you about this enameling process and how it works. So let's take a look at that if we can, guys, and I'd love for you to narrate for us, Jeff. So you can see here, David, as this enamel is going on, first the base coat, that goes everywhere, including the lip around here that, that you might think is exposed cast iron, it's not. That coats everything. Then you have the um, first color coat, the second darker graded color coat. Then that black enamel gets um, sprayed on. Every single firing happens after that. So it takes a long time. It takes a lot of coats of material. It takes 15 pairs of craftsmen's hands. That's where you get the flavor, David. That's where you get the performance. That's mm -hmm. where you get the durability. That's where you get the beautiful colors. That's where you get the tears of joy when it comes to your house. You get to cook on it and serve all your family and friends with it. It just gets me really excited. I might have cried a couple times when I cooked <laughs> it. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. I mean, I love in my some of my vessels to do, I love to sear chicken in them. Uh, if I'm doing a pan seared chicken or if I'm searing chicken to make chicken and dumplings and right. I'm going to do a big stew. This is what's so great about it because you've got such versatility with this and you'll never season the skillet. Never. This has Le Creuset's proprietary black enameling on the inside of the skillet. Now, you're not going to have to worry about seasoning this because it won't require it. You're also going to love that it's going to keep that beautiful color. You're also going to find that it cleans beautifully. I use my scrub daddy sponges on my Le Creuset and it comes out beautifully. It really does, David. You can almost wipe everything clean when you're cooking with this. The other thing I love about the enamel is that you can go ahead and add the rest of those veg to there too now that they've sweated down a little oh, bit these? the peppers okay. there. Yep, yep, yep. Um, you know, sometimes you don't want to overcrowd the pan. They can steam a little bit. And these fajitas, we want to get a little bit of color on them for that yeah, beautiful Yeah, you want a little smoky. char on them, Exactly right. right. Yeah. And you see here these pork chops. So we've got this beautiful sear, this beautiful brown crust on it. That's flavor, that's texture, that's not gray tough meat that has been steamed. We're gonna go ahead and hit it with just a little bit of white wine. And that's not gonna damage your cast iron. It's an acidic liquid. Sometimes that can uh, leave off a little metallic um, flavor or it can take your patina off of a raw cast iron pan. Right. You do not have to worry about that with this because of that proprietary enamel that's not only sprayed on, but baked on at unbelievably hot temperatures. And a little bit of French butter in the bottom never hurt anybody. No. We're hey, just gonna let that cook down a little bit into a nice sauce. You mentioned about getting the char on the vegetables. I have a recipe in my latest cookbook for Mexican street corn off the cob. Love it. And what I love to do with corn, particularly this time of year when it's so fresh, is right. I'll zip it off the cob. Perfect. And then I'll put it into, a, into my hot skillet and right. I'll get some color on it. Love it. Because it gives it that smokiness that is really nice. So Chef was talking about letting these vegetables cook down a little bit and not overcrowd the pan with a lot of cool vegetables. Let them start to get a little color, and then when they do, you can add in your meats. Because what we'll do is we'll kind of scrape these to the side. You got for it. Our, our let's chicken go and, ahead and let's go ahead and do that. Oh, see, I'm getting some nice color on these peppers. Beautiful. And David, again, that's flavor, flavorful. I don't know why I can't say that. Easy for you to flavorful say. Flavorful color. Right. That's not that's not burnt char. That's going to taste bitter or off. It's going to taste delicious. And excuse me one second. The chicken is right. Oh, is he right here? here? Okay. We'll just add that right into the pan, and you can see already still sizzling. And that will take a while because the chicken yeah. will get a nice sear on it as well. Just but spread it out a little bit so we get it all you got touch it. the surface of the pan. And that cast iron is what really, truly develops that flavor. Now I'm going to let this go because if I try to turn this too early, just like the pork chops, it'll stick. You are absolutely right. It will release when it has browned on that one side, when it has seared on that one side. So we'll let that go. Now, Chef, as you're plating up those gorgeous pork chops, I'm going to remind everybody of colors and take you through what we have remaining. But I'll tell you, we started our day with 41,000 skillets and 10 colors. Wow. We now have only seven. Some of them are getting limited. Out of the 41,000 total we began the day with, here's what I have left. If you want the palm, 250, and then we'll take it off the table. There is no other order coming in behind this. Here's your white, 2,400 in the white. This is Provence. 800 now left in Provence. Here's Marseille, 900 left. The QVC exclusive color of emerald, 750, all I have left to go around. Then in the oyster, 600, but if you want cerise, 1,300 remaining. A moment ago, I told you it was 1,500. That means 200 of the, of the cerise, which is the French word for cherry, already out the door in this presentation. Wow. 11,000 now ordered in our show. Everybody's loving this idea of an everyday skillet 
that gives you all the versatility that you're going to need in the kitchen to create beautiful food like a deep dish pizza. Deep dish pizza. You talked about everyday food, David. This is everyday food. Now, you can take layers and layers and layers like they do in Chicago because they do cook it in cast iron in Chicago, but it takes a while. This is store-bought pizza dough. Yeah. Sauce, handful of cheese, your favorite toppings. Mine usually uh, includes some type of cured meat. But you hit this in the oven at a super hot temperature. You get the beautiful rise in the crust and that crispy dough. I like to set it on the stovetop for about 30 seconds to a minute when you pull it out of the oven mm. to really crisp up the bottom of that crust. Because then what you're going to get, David, we'll bring it over here. That cast iron gives you such a beautiful crust golden brown and delicious on the bottom. It's not overbaked. It's not dry. It's not crusty. You can see how there's still that beautiful pillowy yes. interior in there. That is texture. That is flavor. And that is 100% the heat retention mm. of the cast iron that can make that happen for you. It's so nice. Don't miss out on this opportunity. We are getting very, very busy on our phone lines. In fact, your best ordering experience is now going to come either through QVC.com or your mobile app. Let's go off to our phones, welcoming Joan in Maryland. Joan, how are you tonight? I am great, David. Thank you for taking my call. It is a pleasure Hi, to have Joan. you on the air. Chef Nate and I would love to know what color did we tempt you with tonight? I got the Marseille Blue. Nice. Beautiful. Named after that southern port city of France. Do you own any I'd other... I'd love to be there, but I'm, <laughs> I'm anxious to... I'm anxious to cook um, on um, my stove with the Marseille Blue because I bought the a Dutch oven for myself several oh, months ago, I guess, um, through a show on QVC. And uh, my husband it rarely um, will comment on how well something cooks, but he loves that pot. So That's wonderful. I decided to treat myself to a skillet. Good for <laughs> you. Good for you. And you said you picked up the Marseille Blue, so that's going to be a gorgeous little pop of color in your kitchen. What would yeah. you say to people at home who are on the fence tonight, maybe who don't own any Le Creuset? What would you say to them? I would say treat yourself. It is, you're, you're worth it. And it does really such an incredible job. Um, my, I've, I've purchased it for my son, and I just thought that he was a better cook than I was. And then I found out that it wasn't that. It was the pots. <laughs> <laughs> so um, I decided to treat myself, and I, I, I really enjoy it. And so I'm looking forward to having the skillet. See there, he's not a better Perfect. cook. He just had better tools. That's right. Yeah. That's right. I, I enabled him, so I'm enabling myself tonight. Good for you. <laughs> I love it. Joan's like, enough is enough. That's I'm right. going to cook on the good stuff. That's All right. right. And I thank you so very much, and it's a pleasure to see you cooking with it. It's an experience, and I'm waiting for the recipes, too, because every single one I've tried um, before has uh, worked out really well. So oh, Joan, I'm, that's, I'm excited. That's so great to hear. We love to give people amazing ideas to cook in our cast iron products. And again, this skillet is such a workhorse. Look at all the different things that you can cook yeah. in here. Joan, I want you to make the snickerdoodle biscuit plum cobbler, okay? I'll take a picture of it and, and send it to you. I'll e email it to you. I love Either it. that or put it on Facebook. I love it. And, and okay. join us. Yeah, join us there on my Facebook page at David Noble QVC and put your pictures up of what you cook. I would love to see it. Me too. I thank you so much, David, and thank you very much, Chef, for, um, for bringing this wonderful product to QVC. Thanks, Joan. It really makes me happy to hear all that, too. Right. So the pleasure is absolutely mutual. Well, Joan, you well, take have good... a wonderful evening, and I'm going to certainly enjoy my purchase. Thank Thanks, you, Joan. Joan. Be well, my friend. All righty. You too. Thanks. Thanks, bye -bye. sweetie. Bye-bye now. So everybody is loving this opportunity to pick up their skillet and look at the stir fry. But, uh, or actually, uh, fajitas. This is fajitas, but stir fry would be the same. And I want to show you how we're walking over just like in your favorite Mexican restaurant when the fajitas come through the restaurant. They're going to serve it on cast iron right at the table because it's sizzling, it's steaming, you can smell the aroma, it looks beautiful, you don't have mm. to dirty another pan. And I love this type of family dining. My girls are three and five, they don't like to sit at the table, but if you put something fun in front of them that they get to serve and make themselves, they love this. And I love not only cooking with them, but eating with them too. When they actually sit down for dinner, it's one of my favorite things. Well, exactly. <laughs> and you know what, when they're probably not so, um, 
um, uh, distracted by SpongeBob and all those, right. all those great things on television, <laughs> uh, they're going to be spending more time at the dinner table. And, and from what I, you tell me, your oldest girl is quite a cook, isn't she? She loves to cook. In fact, my wife actually just called me and said she was watching the 6 p.m. hit with Sandra mm -hmm. and deciding what she was going to put in her stir fry when I got home. Ah. And, and what's your oldest girl's name? Lily. 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 And we do have plenty of cast iron in her house, uh, obviously, but she will get some of her own one day, too. That's awesome. Yeah. So let's talk to you about colors again and remind you that we've got a great, great selection of colors still remaining. But you don't want to wait long because we started our day with 41,000 skillets. And two thirds of that quantity is now gone. Three colors have sold out, some others are getting close. Let's take you through what we have remaining, beginning with, uh, tell or reminding you rather, 41,000 we started the day with in the palm, 175, all I have left. In the white, 2,400. In the Provence, 750. What our last caller, Joan, picked up, the Marseille, 750. Here's the emerald, 700 now in that emerald. This is oyster, 475 in the oyster and in the cerise. Only 950 left. A moment ago, I told you that was 1,200 left. Now it's 950. These are going very, very quickly. You're going to get the eight recipes included and that gorgeous branded box from Le Creuset. What would this cost at retail? $170. What's our, what's our savings tonight? $70 and two pennies. You're paying $99.98 for this skillet. That is a crazy good price for Le Creuset. This is the kind of generational cookware that will be here long after we're gone. So that means you pass it down to the next generation of cooks in your family, and then the next generation after that. That's how long this cast iron will be around, and will continue to deliver these fantastic results for every cook that picks up this pan. You're buying something that will become heirloom cookware in your family. This is an important night, and a great night for all of you. Choose the color that makes your heart smile. Choose the color that will light up your kitchen. Just get it while the getting is good. Let's go back over. Chef Nate, what are you working on? David, so we're doing that sausage ricotta meatball bake that looks so beautiful in the recipe booklet. It's one of the mm. things that's included in there. And I just, again, want to show the versatility, but also the one pan usage of things like this. Sheet pan dinners are all the rage, but skillet dinners are so easy to do. You know, if you want to go ahead and dump the apples right in that I butter. I was going to we'll, say this butter starting to melt. We'll so come back to some. that in just a minute. But this meatball bake, again, the recipe creates these beautiful large sausage meatballs that have um, ricotta uh, folded into them. We brown them in the skillet in the oven so you get that beautiful browning all over. We're going to just do a little bit of onions and garlic in the bottom. We're going to come over the top with some of our tomato sauce. And again, we're doing this on the skillet so the tomato sauce can cook into those onions and garlic a little bit and cook into the meatballs. These were browned. They're probably almost nearly cooked all the way through, but we'll finish this in the oven. Little or a lot bit hit of red pepper Ooh, on top. Doggies. Some mozzarella cheese. Love cheese. Let's just go ahead and get it all yeah, don't, down in there. Don't be shy with the cheese. And some Parmesan too right on top. And I know it doesn't look that pretty right now, David. I think it actually looks beautiful. But it beautiful. all melts but in, right? Let me grab a towel real quick. You know what, chef? Let's just do it. I say, if we're going to eat this after the show, we need to put a little more cheese on there. I love it. All right, there we are. And Perfect. again, we brown the meatballs in one pan. We're going to put it right under the broiler in another pan, or in the same pan, excuse me. And then we are going to come um, right out with it and serve it out of that too. And this is the type of delicious, bubbling, melty, cheesy dish that you're going to get. Those meatballs will come out doing the same thing. Sweet potato gratin, all that beautiful cream and cheese melting down there. One thing I want to mention to you also, and we get this question every time we offer Le Creuset on QVC, can you use it on a glass stovetop? We're cooking on a glass stovetop. We absolutely are. And David, um, we've seen as all the skillets over there are displayed, the enamel goes all the way across the bottom. So there's right. no rough edges on the bottom. Of course, you want to be careful and not bang it into the, or the glass top. It. But that's the same with any piece of cookware. The bottom of this is smooth. It will not create any scratches on either your, your pan or the cooktop. Um, you just have to be careful what's in between the pan and the stove, obviously. Yeah, if there's, if there's any debris on your stovetop, it might drag across if you try to. So I wouldn't drag it on your gas, or glass stovetop. But you can certainly do it because we're cooking on it. Absolutely. You can see it right here. These apples are cooking in butter over here. How but, perfect. Butter. We're just sweating them down to release a little bit of the moisture. And then what we're going to do is take them out, wipe the pan, 
pie crust, apples back in, pie crust oh, on top. Look at that thing. Yeah, I see what you're doing. And baking doing. in the cast iron, that bottom crust, just like the pizza we showed, will stay brown and crispy and delicious. There's nothing worse, David, than getting a, a pie that looks delicious on top and then the bottom crust is a soggy mess. Did I spill some brown sugar in those apples? Oh, whoops. Did I? <laughs> Maybe just a little brown sugar in there? Maybe just a little? And it's, again, pie dish, pizza dish, casserole dish, searing steaks, pork chops and peaches, breakfast, a whole chicken in here. And I'll tell you what, David, I like to take my chicken and sear it on the stove top as well to yeah. get some nice brown flavor in it. it. Works well in the skillet. You can turn, um, this is probably like a three and a half pound chicken or so, uh, maybe four, turn it, sear it, pop it in the oven to finish cooking. And again, you've got your roasting dish already there in your skillet. And you know what? If you didn't want to turn this into a pie, you could also serve those beautiful cooked apples yes. with that breakfast, with the pork, with the chicken. With a biscuit topping. With a biscuit topping. Now we're talking. Maybe a snickerdoodle biscuit. <laughs> Woo! I may have to play a little bit with the snickerdoodle topping idea. Or, D David, look at how beautiful, first of all, your French toast came out right here. Nicely, perfectly browned on top. Some of those warm apples on top of this would just now really kick it up. Now you're talking. All from the same skillet. See there? I don't know why we're not next door neighbors, you and I. We should be. We should be. <laughs> Wouldn't that be great? That'd be fantastic. Um, hey, this is K49006. We are very, very busy. How many an hour? Great day in the morning. 13,000 skillets wow. ordered during In the Kitchen with wow. David. And, and for the day now, Got to do some adding, some ciphering. Some some math, some quick math. Some quick math. 35,000. We started wow. the day with 41. We, we wow. only sold 35,000. Wow. That's crazy. And, you know, we talked about doing the roast chicken as a roasting pan. This is a beautiful bacon-wrapped pork tenderloin. It's one of the recipes included in the booklet. And, again, something else, we're going to use the skillet not only as the roasting pan, but to, to slowly render that bacon down because mm. you want it to be crisp, but you don't want it to burn. You want to be able to control your temperature, mm -hmm. and that is exactly what cast iron does. And we're going to take this and pop it in the oven, and it will come right to the table just like that. I uh -huh. see you're getting a beautiful midnight snack over there. Mm. I'm going to pop this in the oven. Why don't you take t tell me what mm. that tastes like out of cast iron? Mm. I was just having a little brownie because we did a skillet brownie. So I brought off, broke off a big hunk. And if it comes in one skillet, that means it's one serving, right, David? Mm hmm. Yeah. And again. Well, according to the box of macaroni and cheese, I'm a family of four. That's right. <laughs> All right. So look at this. You've got beautiful, even cooking with this skillet brownie. We didn't get fancy with this brownie. This is a box mix. Super easy. Cooks beautifully and evenly. I'm telling you why I love me some chocolate brownie. Now, let me just turn this out and show you. Look at how evenly it's cooked on the, on the underside. Also, look Can how we, easily it came out of the just, skillet. I know you, you might want to taste it afterwards. Just run here. I'll do it. Run your finger right what across here. All of that will come right off. That's a little extra. It's delicious. It's a chef snack is what that and is. And again, th that cleans up so easily. You get beautiful texture with it, even with a box brownie mix. It really does make your everyday food taste you, even sir. better. Now, let me also tell you that we are getting very, very busy here in the last couple of minutes of our presentation. We will have one final look at this a little later, but it will be short. That's right. So what you don't want to do is wait. You also want to make a skillet brownie when you get this home, because that's a nice way to inaugurate this pan. That's right. Doesn't that white look nice on the stovetop? It really does. White is one of our most popular colors for wedding registries, for bridal shower registries. It goes with the clean, modern aesthetic of a lot of kitchens, mm -hmm. and it goes really with almost anything. I, of course, mix and match a lot of colors at home. I have a lot of blue. I've got some white, and I love it because it's just a bright, fresh neutral to uh, brighten up your kitchen. Oh, that brownie is good. Do the cinnamon roll, Chef. Oh, pour some icing on there so you can see how mm. delicious that is. And again, you talked about the box brownie mix. This is just canned cinnamon rolls. I'd love to say I have time to wake up and laminate dough and roll cinnamon into a big uh, log and cut it, put it in there. You have two young children and a life to lead. Pop mm -hmm. the can, put it in the skillet that's already on your stove, pop it in the oven. They will think, and also it will taste like, the most special weekend breakfast ever. How about that? How you do it? And it's not just mm. the beautiful presentation, David. That creates some amazing texture around the exterior of those cinnamon rolls 
and it bakes it all the way through, just like the pizza we saw, just like the um, pie crust that we were talking about. Baking in cast iron really is the next level. I've only got about a minute left, so let me do a quick color Go tour. For it. So I'm going to head over here reminding you we started our day with 41,000 skillets and 10 colors. Seven are all we have left. Three have sold out. In the palm now, I have fewer than, I have 75 left in the palm. That would be 75 left, fewer than 100. Here it is in the white, 2300. Here's the Provence, 650. Here's the Marseille, 550. The Emerald, 600. Here's the Oyster, 300. And finally, the Cerise, 650. All I have left to go around. Eight recipes come along with this. Our final look for say today's special value of the year. Let me also remind you that at retail, this is $170. We're going to do it at $70 and two minutes less. Chef Nate, if you'll come over and join me. You got it, David. We've got one more look at this, but it'll all be at a short one. We'll look forward to having you back a little later. I can't in wait the show. to show you some more. In the meantime, I think Stacy Lou is standing by with New York City bagels. Yeah, Ooh. you know, some people may say a bagel's just a bagel, but not when it's coming from New York City. Yes, this is a brand we've just debuted, I think around in May, and becoming a customer and foodie favorite, Just Bagels. And we have the New York City Kettle Boiled Bagel Sampler. It's a hot pick tonight. This is the everything. So if you love sesame, onion, garlic, puppy seed, this one's for you. We also have Just Sesame or Plain. These are made with special ingredients that are synony synonymous with New York City bagels. Yes, they're thick crust, they're chewy centers, and they're oh so good. And these are baked and shipped fresh to you. So it's coming up soon. And because of this, we wanted to build a trivia question around our bagel. A New York bagel's thick crust and chewy center is due to which of the following? Is it the use of New York City water? Is it boiling the bagel before baking? Baking the bagel at a higher temperature in less time? or baking the bagel dough immediately after it's made. Mm. Hmm, what makes it? I don't believe messy? it's the last one. Chewy, no, we like aged dough, I, don't we? I believe we know that we can take away the last yeah. option. Uh huh, for sure. Yeah, if this was who wants to be a millionaire, I would have already eliminated one of your options. Yeah, that leaves you with three. That improves your odds. Yeah, phone a friend. Just cut me in for some of the dough. <laughs> bagel dough, get it? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> ha ha! They're all like this. Ha <laughs> ha, whatever. All right, hey, let's talk about something far more uh, interesting and better than my jokes. Let's talk to you about Blendjet. Let's talk about a battery operated rechargeable blender that allows you to go and blend. You don't blend and then go, you blend as you go. That's what makes this so extraordinary. There are only two places to buy this blendjet.com and right here at QVC. This model is only available here and at Blendjet. Let's welcome in Melissa Fleming Epps, who's going to give us the Blendjet story. I'm just walking and blending and You're blending and walking. And walking. walking. Mm -hmm. walking. How are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm so good. Great to see you back. It, thank you so much. It's good to be back. Let me ask my producer, John, this. John, how many ordered tonight? Oh, now we got the reorder in yesterday. Yes. Right? Yep. A thousand ordered since yesterday. Oh goodness gracious! Since they got back in stock. Goodness gracious! These well, are amazing. You. How much do these hold? Love this. Twelve ounces. Holds okay. Twelve ounces. And Blendjet, we're known as kind of a social media phenomenon. We've kind of lit the world on fire just by our social media presence. Only place that you can get it, as David said, is right here at QVC or at Blendjet. Twelve ounces, fully rechargeable. It's a high quality restaurant grade material, BPA free. Has six stainless steel blades. It's going to cut through ice. It's going to cut through your kale. It's going to cut through all. Types of fruits and vegetables, and we'll show you how easy it is to use. Well, we've also got some great color choices, yeah. and I'll remind you that this is four easy payments and free shipping and handling. How are you doing, free shipping and handling? <laughs> all right, now we're going to take you through the blue. This is Carolina blue all day, boys and girls, okay? Just saying. So here's your blue, here's red, this is the pink. I have it in green, black, and purple. 
They all come with gift boxes. So they're ready to roll. And when we get these at home, we need to charge these up. How long do they right. need to charge? Great question. Love the fact that they're fully rechargeable. They're going to come with a USB. You plug it in, charge it for one to three hours. It's going to give you eight to 12 blends. Wow. Truly incredible. And again, the power is so remarkable. Right here, I've got a two, thir two thirds cup of orange juice. I've got half of a sliced banana. And I've got a third cup of vanilla yogurt. And we're going to make ourselves a little bit of an orange smoothie. So, so great, so wonderful, so easy easy, so quick. So really it gives you all the power of a blender, except it's portable. You can take it with you on the go. And that's what BlendJet is all about. We wanted to give you that convenience and it was really important to us. So we've done some great things. We went ahead, we did a very berry smoothie. Mm -hmm. We went ahead, we did an orange smoothie. How about something a little bit more fun, a little bit adult now that we're in summertime? Right? Well, and it is uh, after hours. It, it is. It is. Is this a strawberry daiquiri? How about a rosé frosé? A rosé frosé? Yes, sir. Is we, that a frozen rosé drink? Oh, you know it. You right. know it. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to add my rosé. I'm going to add my fresh strawberries. And then I'm going to add just a little bit of ice. Now, should we pour some of that rosé? Yeah, out? probably a good idea. Maybe a little I, I think, ambitious. Maybe I was a little heavy with my pour. Thank you, sir. All right. This is why is we're better? such a good team. I think that that is absolutely perfect. Going to add some ice in there. And again, so simple, so easy. All you need to do, I'm going to put the cap on. Love the fact that this cap, it also has a strainer inside. You can see right here it also has that great carrying strap. I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to put the top on. 12 ounces, one touch easy operation. I'm going to press it just like that and look at that. It's cutting through those strawberries, it's cutting through that ice, cutting through that rose, froze. It's going to make it up for us so perfect. And we're going to have this nice, delicious, refreshing drink all ready for you to enjoy, Mr. Venable. So you could take Whoops. your ingredients you in a cooler to the Concert in the park. Oh yes, sir. And then make yourself a drink while you're listening to your favorite, you Look know, band. At that. And this is a frosé rosé. You know it. All right, let and me try that. And that's for you. Let me let me know how I did. Mm. I'm a bartender on my mm. other nights. Oh, it's good. Isn't it good? Really refreshing. refreshing. Yes. And I blended it just a little bit because I like a little bit of a chunk in there. I yeah. like a little bit of the strawberries. Could you let it blend longer and you, it would break absolutely. it up even finer? Absolutely. Now, I will tell you, uh, John, you were saying the blue and the red. Blue and red are both very popular. So if you're looking to pick this up tonight, we've got some great color choices for you. Here's the blue. Here's that red, both of which are very popular. Then I've got it for you in the pink. Here it is in the green. Here's your black. And finally, the purple. Yeah. So all these coming together with a little USB port. You can even plug this into your computer while you're at the office you to can. charge it. You can. Love right? this. I mean, it's summertime. We're going to barbecues. How great if you can go ahead and you can blend when you arrive at your party. How about some very fresh lemon poppy seed dressing for a salad that you're bringing for your guests? You know what you could also do? What's that? You could put the liquid in here and bring your protein powder in your gym bag. Uh huh. Make your own protein shake to enjoy on the drive home, oh, right? You know it. I actually have a protein shake right down there, right in front of you, sir, in that pink Just blend. The one? It sure is. It's got one of our chocolate protein powders that we sell here at QVC. And that's exactly what we've done. And that's what BlendJet is really all about. We wanted to give you the portability so you can do things like that. So you can take it with you on the go so you can blend fresh because that was super important to us. And that's really Isn't amazing. That How do we clean this? Soup, great question. I'm going to show you. Let's say I, we went ahead, we just did our rose frose. I'm just going to take it. I'm going to add a little bit of water. And then I'm going to add myself just a little dab of dishwashing soap. And then I'm going to blend. And that's the simplest way. It's how you go ahead and you clean it. And then you're going to blend it just like so. And then you're going to give it a little rinse of water. You're going to pour it out. And then you're going to be ready to blend your very next Blendjet beverage. I love it. Isn't that great? Don't miss out Super on this. Simple. We're very, very busy. John, how many are gone now? 500 already wow. spoken for in this presentation. Lots and lots of you are looking for ways to go and blend. Not oh, yeah. blend before you leave the house. You can actually blend on the go you with can. this, which is really phenomenal. What are you making here? An iced how, coffee? How about a mocha frap? We've got a half cup of milk, we've got a half cup of coffee, and then we just added a quarter cup of ice. We're going to go ahead, we're going to blend simply one touch operation. You can hear those six stainless steel blades cutting through that ice perfectly. Just because it's a little portable blender, 12 ounces, don't let you think that it's not powerful. 
so perfect. Gonna go ahead and do it like that. Gonna open it up. Just took just a few seconds and then whoops, blended perfectly. Here we go. We've got a mocha frap for us on the go. Gonna top it with some whipped topping, some chocolate drizzle, and we've got ourselves a gourmet coffee drink right like that. Look at that. Isn't that wonderful? Beautiful. So fun. Don't miss out on this. We're very, very excited to have this back in stock in all of our colors. And we have it for you in the blue, in the red, the pink. Here's your purple, the black, and the green. Melissa, thank you, darling. Thank you so much. Mwah. Always Great a pleasure to see, to see you. you. We gave you a little trivia question, and we'll remind you of that question. A New York bagel's thick crust and chewy center is due to which of the following? Is it the use of New York City water? Is it boiling the bagel before baking? Is it baking the bagel at a higher temperature for less time? Or is it baking the bagel dough immediately after it's made? Well, I told you before, baking the bagel dough immediately after it's made is wrong, so we took that one off the table. The answer is boiling the bagel before baking. Kettle boiling, to be specific. According to the, uh, to, uh, to, uh, the Culinary Institute of America, boiling the bagels in a solution of water and malt barley locks the liquid inside the dough, expanding the interior while thickening the crust. This step often gets skipped simply to save time. But if you skip it, you're going to have a less good bagel. Well, fortunately for us, we've got the real deal. We've got New York City bagels. We've got just bagels. 24 of these four ounce New York City kettle boiled bagel samplers. And we're awfully excited to welcome back Cliff Nordquist, who is here. He owns the bakery. Owns the company that makes these. You've owned it for 26 years, Imagine sir. That. Welcome that. back to QVC. Thank Good you to very see you. Much. Thank Your bagels you. have taken this place by storm. Oh, this is exciting. <laughs> this is this is unbelievable. This is a dream come true. Well, we're, we're humbled, thrilled. I'm thankful. Well, I we're appreciate thrilled it. to have you, and we're thrilled for the great bagels you bring us. Oh. These are made the old-fashioned way. Of yes, course, they, they are kettle boiled, which uh, Cliff will tell us all about. But they're also made with New York City water, aren't they? That is the secret. That is the key. That is right? the secret. We. And so what we're talking about tonight is a bagel sampler. You're going to choose either 24 plain, 24 sesame bagels, or 24 everything bagels, or you can get a combo where you'll get a little bit of each flavor. Is that mm -hmm. right? Yes. Now, Cliff, when these arrive to us, they arrive fresh. Is that They're right? They're going to arrive fresh. We're going to bake them. We're going to pack them fresh. We're going to put them in a two dozen box. We're going to ship them either overnight or second day air. But they ship the same day they're baked. Yes, they do. Wow. Yes, they now, do. Now, when they arrive at my house, they are uh, room temperature. Mm hmm So I, if I'm going to eat all 24 right away, God bless, Oof. great. I don't know if that's, that's possible. A that, that's, that's a lot, a lot of, of bagels. Maybe got a big family. That's a lot but of bagels. But if you're not going to eat them right away, how do we store them? Uh, good question. You know what I always recommend? What's that? I want to get them in the freezer right away. Okay, and, and do you put them in the box they came in, or do you put them no, in the No, 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 they're in six packs. You pull them out of the six pack. Yep. Uh, I'm sorry, you leave them in the six pack yep. and just put it in your freezer. They're good for a long time. Bang, right inside. So you got the plain, you got the sesame, or you got the everything, or the combo where you get a little bit mm -hmm. of all of it. Yep. Top these any way you like, with a savory cream cheese, a sweet cream cheese, straight up butter, however you want to do this. But here's the thing when you start to look at these bagels, they're soft, they're okay, perfect. Though. You fill this with a, is this uh, cream cheese and chives? Yes, it is. Oh, my word. Would you like to try that first? I would first? love to try that first. This is crazy. Made with New York water. We it's actually. It's also warm, so that cream yep. cheese is getting all melty on me. So we start it with mm. the New York water. Then we mm. actually proof the dough. And then, you know, you know where the magic happens? In the aging of the dough. No, I'll tell you where the magic is in my mouth right oh, now. Oh, is it really? Mm -hmm. Is that no, pretty is. good? Uh-oh. This is amazing. It's pretty good. John, huh? my earpiece popped out because it was so good. What did you say? Uh, where were we? We were at the... Eight. 200, already gone. Oh, nice. Thank you very now, much. this is amazing. Mm -hmm. Now, this is the plain. That's the plain. With just butter. You want to try that? Let's try it with Let just butter. Let me cut a piece of that for you. So we were at the aging process. Mm -hmm. 10 to 12 hours in a walking box. Let me hold this so our director can shoot this. I want, them, I want everybody to see this. Look at this gorgeous bagel. Nice crust. Chewy center. Melted butter. Doesn't that look great? Now, That's course, the New York water. Of course, I would probably smear a little bit of strawberry jam on here. Ah, uh, well, we can make that happen mm. too. Would you like a little butter with that, and and mm. or just the strawberry? Right now, I'm just having uh -oh. the butter. Okay. I'm having a New York City bagel butter moment. Mm. Boy, is this good! And they arrive fresh. This is like you went to the bakery in New York City, and you brought them home in a brown paper bag. Except they're not going to be on your front doorstep in a brown paper bag. They're going to be shipped in a box. They're shipped the same day they're baked. 
Absolutely. These bagels are crazy good. Don't miss out on these. If you love good bagels, go to the grocery store. If you want great bagels, buy these. These are crazy good. Thank you. Oh man, are these are wonderful. Nothing artificial in there. Mm -mm. No colors, flavors, preservatives, nothing. Mm. Malt, molasses, New York City water, aging process. Everything bagels are going quickly. What's on the everything bagel? Poppy, sesame, onion, garlic, salt, caraway seeds. Wow. Mm. A lot of flavor. Everybody is making their choice now. Get it's my favorite. Home. If you're not going to eat all 24 at once, I know, maybe a little ambitious, uh, then pop them in the freezer. They're good, they're good in the freezer how long? One year. Not, mm -hmm. It's not necessary. Oh, it's no. a, they freeze really well. These bagels, are we bake these in a certain way. We bake them a little faster than your typical New York City bagel, which is baked in about 15 minutes. Mm. We bake this in nine minutes. So we retain the water. Wow. We want to keep it fresh. What your job is to do, and everybody at home is to take it, put it in your freezer right away. Because mm. like I said, there's no chemicals in here. So it's not gonna last. It's, it's good for about three to five days. So you take it, you stick it in your freezer, you pull it out, you thaw it out for 30 minutes. If you don't have time to thaw it out, just nuke it, microwave it microwave for 20 it. to 30 seconds and toast it. And this is, do you feel the crust on that? Look at that. The, this, look now at guys, that. come in, uh, let's take a look at the one Cliff has in his hands. I want look you at to the see crust, the chew, the pull. You get the crispy crust, and you look get that pull. beautiful, chewy center. These bagels are amazing. I'm sorry, the one thing I didn't do was the happy dance. Uh, there it is. There we go. I was too busy watching what you were doing. <clears throat> 800 of these are now gone. Everybody's loving them. Order 24 plain, order 24 sesame, order 24 everything bagel, or get a combo. Oh, if you want the 24 everything bagel, 200 left. If you want the combo, I have to believe that's pretty popular today. So this is an opportunity for you to get a little bit of each one. Mm -hmm. So that way you can tuck them all away. I, myself, more partial to the plain because I look at this like a blank canvas. I can do a savory cream cheese on mm -hmm. here. I can do a sweet cream cheese on here. I can do just butter and jam. Yep. I can do honey and butter on here. However you love your bagel, however your kids love their bagel, this is the kind of bagel that you go to the specialty bakery for, right? Absolutely. But if you don't live near a specialty bakery, then you just have to put up with what you can get at the grocery store. Well, those are good bagels. These are great bagels. You know what's in a grocery store? What's that? Can I be honest? Hit me. A bag of chemicals. A bag of chemicals. These bagels in a grocery store last for anywhere between, and this is crazy, mm. 20 to 35, 40 days. Oh, wow. These are good for three to five. Before you freeze them. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. And Depending the on the weather and, you know, sometimes it's Humidity. hot somewhere. Yeah. yeah. So that's why I bake them today. I ship them out today. You get them either tomorrow or the next day. Mm. Get them in your freezer right away and they'll be fantastic. Now, great crispy crust, chewy center. This is one that is covered with butter. Yeah. Hello. Everything is my favorite. Mm. I really, it's just, it, it, it does everything for mm. me. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> mm. I know I already did one, but I did one without taking a bite, so I almost didn't count. So do another happy dance. There that's it is. That's two. That's two. Stacy Lou, I know you love these bagels, boo. I do. She does. She's that busy typing. I love hearing that. Mm. You know, I, it gives me a lot of joy. People are very passionate about their you bagels. You got some more down here? Absolutely. What do you want to try? How many left? Well, in we, the everything bagel, only a hundred left. Let me taste this everything. Do you bagel. want to try it with the strawberry? Because you had mentioned the strawberry. Oh, okay. This is going to knock you out, I think. Really? Because it's a, you We go for three happy? No, all right. Let's oh, not get, let's not get let's crazy. Not get crazy. Mm. Let's not get crazy. Mm. Mm. Isn't that something? Oh, this is really interesting. I wouldn't have paired a sweet cream cheese with this. I mean, it's not my favorite either, but it was, people but love really it. Really nice. A nice uh, contrast in flavor. But if you do a plain cream cheese on this, the everything really sings mm -hmm. with all those great flavors. Absolutely. So soft. So perfect. You coming up for bagel stays? She, oh, she needs some everything uh, right here. Clint. Butter, cream cheese, which one? A little bit of butter, okay. not everything. You These I'm gonna are cut one so for you. perfect. And this was coming from when we first worked together. I was kind of a bagel naysayer. <laughs> I kind of thought they were real dense. They feel like a brick in my stomach. So I kind of always passed on the bagel buffet. And then I tasted these, and it was a complete revelation. I'm a bagel believer. So soft and airy on the inside, yet that thick crust for that great chew on the inside. And that's when I love, and I always squeeze these for everybody, because you can see how everything kind of starts springing back. Most bagels I know, that would squish down, 
and it would just thicken and be a rock. And these, the crispy crust, how it just hugs the butter. It's very light. It's mm. a light bagel. It's mm. not heavy. It's not dense. It's not going to lay in your stomach. Mm. Uh, by the way, they're kosher. Ooh. I don't know if we've ever spoke about that. Oh, okay. These are also kosher. All right, wait. Mm. Mm. Not the Asiago bagel, if you ever order that from another airing, but all the other bagels are kosher. So good. Everything just sold out. It's gone. What? Oh, wait. I'm sorry. No, the everything sold out, not everything. Oh, oh okay. Okay. <laughs> all right, let's go. That's it. We're done. I was like, wow, that was quick. <laughs> we got a lot of bagels. Okay, so in the, the everything choice by itself just sold out. You can still get it in the combo. 2,000 sets are now gone. Wow. In I have 1,200 left in combo, 400 oh. in the plane and 200 left in the sesame. I am so in love with this bagel product, and I think this is going to be the kind of bagel that really sets the bar. And then once you've had these, it's hard to go anywhere else. And don't you love the flavor that's in that dough, that malty? It's hard to make a better molasses. bagel. Yeah. It has everything you want in a bagel mm. and everything you don't want. There's mm -hmm. nothing in there that you don't want. And it comes perfectly baked. So all you do is take it out of the box and start eating or take it, <laughs> take it out of the package and put it in the freezer, right? So this way it's going to be safe in the freezer up to a year. Now, thaw these out before you reheat them? Absolutely. Yeah. And these are going to ship Monday. Yeah, you we're, bake them Monday? We're airing today. Yeah. We only ship Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. So we're airing today. We're going to bake these Monday morning, and they will be out Monday afternoon. And you guys will get them Tuesday or Wednesday, depending on where you live. Wow. How about that? How many are gone now, John? Over 2,000 gone. The everything choice uh, alone has sold out. Mm. We Good still choice. have the everything available mm -hmm. in the combo choice. Try one. Everything's going quickly. Stay on the line for this. Stacy right. Lou, I know you've got next item you're going to present. I do. I'm trying to say this. Well, you got some time because I have to talk about <laughs> Tina's um, KitchenAid attachment. So go ahead and chew up, Can baby. You you'll talk about it for me? I'll do it for awesome. you. Awesome. Okay, so you eat. Hey, we do have the KitchenAid attachment coming up. What was that, John? Okay, so let's talk to you about this great uh, attachment for your KitchenAid stand mixer. This is going to come with four cylinders. So it'll do your slicing, your shredding, even the fine shredding barrel is included here. And all this coming your way on Easy Pay. It's a little later in the show. Stick around for that. But right now, Stacy's standing by with a really fun idea from Mark Charles Masilli. And a good friend who's going to tell me if I have any poppy seeds. No, and if you did, I'd okay. pick them out. <laughs> oh, you're the best. That's Charles how good friends are. is back. Everybody, you're asking in the chat with a way to help organize your cabinets and countertops without breaking the bank in a stylish way. This is Store More. You've known this and seen this here on In the Kitchen with David. This is a great set because now we're giving you a large and extra large. You're getting two of these cabinet kitchen organizers in a choice of color. Now, here's the thing. We just reduced the price on these. They're less than $20 for both. They come in three colors, but no reorder. And what's great, they're customizable. And that's customizable. what set your store more apart. Yep. Then all of them, whenever I saw a rack in the a store, it was welded. Mm -hmm. So that means it was one space, one shape. Well, what, by the way, we all have different things. And the beauty behind this is not only does it not tip on you, it's customizable. So when you put something in there, you decide by just springing this closed, it actually does this kind of job every single time. Now, instead of stacking your stuff like this, you're stacking them like a deck of cards so you can pull them out easily, less damage. You're using more than what you have because when you stack things, the thing on the bottom you're never going to grab because it's piled on top of everything else. You know so it. now, you, I call it the deck of cards mm. of organization. Stack it all up in a row, and now you've got a great way to organize. All right, normally uh, both would be $34.98. We are almost $15 less. Here's your set that you could get in black. Again, you get an extra large and a large. We also have it for you in the white, which would look great if you have those all white cabinets Correct. in the kitchen. And then there's your Papa Drama, your red. And if you bought any of these sets before, Stacy, I used to sell the two extra large, the two small, the two mediums. They're the same colors. So add these to your collection. This is a way whether you're a renter or you mm -hmm. have a custom kitchen, you can customize your cabinets, folks, with no tools. And if you move, you just take it with you or you change your mind what cabinet it is, you move it. Okay, because a lot of us are going to open up our cabinets. I, I challenge you to do so right now because this is what you're going to see. Look, there's inside, your pile. Right? There's the difference. That was the same stuff before and after. There's all your lock and lock, your Tupperware, whatever you have. Look at that. Just the lids alone. Tell me that wouldn't be a lifesaver just to have that. Two of them side by side. Look what fry pans and lids can do. 
it's it's amazing. Like it just takes everything you normally do. And remember, this adjusts to whatever you own. You don't need anything special. You do not need a tool. You don't need a special cabinet. This works on pullouts. It works on top of cabinets, on the cabinets, on the countertops. It even works as a drain board, even in office for files and oh, for that's books. That's a really good idea so right there. Yeah. yeah. And Lots files and books. So I wanted to show you real quick about on nice. here. Okay. It doesn't tip over. Look, we put one of the heaviest, my favorite, you know, cutting board that I sell here. Mm -hmm. It could stand up or on its side and it's not going to tip over. Everything is accessible like a deck of cards. I can go in and grab that. I can go in and grab this. Look, in between two metal sheet, I have a ceramic piece that I can pull out and it's an oval. So it doesn't matter the shape. It doesn't matter if it's scalloped. It doesn't matter if it's metal or cast iron. Mm. There's no weight issue. It's not going to tip over on you. It's everything's organized. And think about the fact that what we would normally do is have this on top of each other. How do you get to the cutting board? How do you get to the bowl? And things are going to chip. If you have your grandmother's favorite platter, mm -hmm. I promise you, if you keep pulling at it, it will chip. Over here, bakeware. You know, I, I love bunt pans. Look how odd this shape is, okay? That's a really odd shape. How do you pile anything on here? You can't, right? But all you have to do is that, measure, and I was able to put that, two different things of a uh, muffin, and then your metal pot in there. Uh, think about the, the big three quart temptation bowls temptation we have. Temptation pieces, your five look at quart this. Le Crusade Fits Dutch all oven. temptations. The Lake Crusade, the, the TSV, today's special value today is here, right here. Mm -hmm. I mean, it holds the lid. It holds one thing, an all clad piece. Look at the height. You can have the handles upward. A big Lake, Lake Crusade stone piece. Look what I did here a Lake Crusade pie plate with the stand. Oh, it actually stand fits it. behind it because look, there's a little indent right there. Look, let me go back so you see what happens. It actually sits inside the indent. So you can actually do pie plates in here. We did everything from scalloped pieces to big pieces to look at this. No tipping over, no chipping. You're using all your pieces. No mounting, no installation. No installation and move you it. You adjust the size that you need. So as you move or change spaces, they grow with you. Okay, so a lot of you are being smart. You're picking up more than one because smart. this is it. There's no reorder. Normally, almost $35. We're under 20. That's 15 bucks savings for you. Here's your set in black. We call this the large. Here's your extra large. The white, very, very popular right now, going to work great inside your ki kitchen cabinets. Or if you love a pop of color, go for the red, yep. especially if you're collecting a lot of your red temptations mm -hmm. in your Le Creuset. If you want the red or the black, I have 900 each, and then that is it. If you order with your Q card, you can take advantage of your Q card and get four easy payments. Now you break up the price to about five dollars a month. So again, you're saving fifteen dollars. You know, when you see everything, you're more apt to use it. Correct. Organization. When you open up a cabinet like that, it feels I don't know, panicky. Stressful. Right? Yeah. And by right. the way, you know, Stacy talks about using it, but also protecting it. Pans that are on top of each other will scratch. If you have platters and dishes, they will chip. So now, I, I, I was always the advocate when they're piled, I don't want to go for the bottom one because I don't want to struggle with everything mm -hmm. and chip and break it. But now I'm using everything because they're standing up and I'm using it a lot more efficiently. It's a lot easier to grab one heavier Le Creuset piece yep. on its own on than its trying own. to lift three that you've stacked. To get underneath and there. Nested. Yeah. Yep. Which was our only choice until until Stormore made this great piece, and you know you know all the Stormore pieces. I brought you all these pieces; they all match. We've been bringing them for years. They are a storage organization concept that works for everybody's kitchen, everybody's mm -hmm. cabinets. That's what makes these so special. Anything can work in this. Again, you can take it into the office. This could be great for uh, dorm rooms for the kids at school. Use one just as your cookbook stand. Just your cookbook stand. And by the way, if you just want to collect your lids, remember this was done creatively. The lid holder, see the way it dips in? This is actually a lid holder for the knobs. Mm, so even if you just wanted brilliant. one for all your lids so they're not piled on top of it, cookbook holder. Remember, see, there's the, the customization of it. And you just keep putting one in like this, squeeze it, and that's it. All metal construction, powder coated, not going to slip on you, not going to tip on you. It just works great. I okay. love this. By the way, I just custom did my kitchen two years ago. There was all my cabinets have this in it. I didn't ask for certain dividers being built in there because I don't know if I was going to change my mind. Well, the, well right? right. So right? you're using the cabinets. I'm using Not the to mention they're incredibly expensive. Yes. Better solution again. K48555, 1500 now spoken for. Again, this is all we're going to have. No reorder. Here's your black set. 700 remaining in the black. If you want the white, very popular right now. You got to be on the line to make sure you get that white home. A lot of people picking up more than one set. And then finally we have it for the, or in the red, 
also getting limited on that your store more set of two kitchen cabinet we love right we and love. countertop organizers too i know you and you can be top. very very posh and bougie when you say i have cabinet organizers you, you bougie me bougie oh yeah I love bougie. <laughs> my favorite word of the year bougie. <laughs> uh, okay go grab a just bagels yes oh okay I, i'm a new yorker i know so I know good bagels. we um have an update on the just bagels um this this was your kettle boil bagel sampler. Which was your favorite, David? You know what? I loved all of them. Did you? I thought they were great. Do we have an update on these guys? We started with 4,000 sets of bagels, Stacey Lou. I have 800 left in the combo. Ooh. If you want the plain or sesame, 150 each. Those were so good. What you all didn't see while Stacey was presenting that item? I might have housed a whole half of another bagel. Yeah. Strawberry cream cheese. Yeah. People who could hear my microphone heard this. And then it was gone. Gone. Okay. So those are going very quickly. Hey, let's talk to you about another hot pick. Hot picks are our star products of every day on QVC. And if you've got a KitchenAid stand mixer, and I don't know, there are about a three scrillion of you out there that own a KitchenAid stand mixer, then we've got the perfect attachment because this is going to take the work out of prep work. And we love that because this is an attachment called Fresh Prep. It's a stand mixer attachment, comes along with an extra blade. Now that title doesn't tell you very much, so let me show you very much what this is going to include. First of all, you're getting this great box to store all of your, uh, your pieces in, and it, uh, it will store, it'll come in this box, but also become a storage box. You're getting one, two, three, four of these barrels. One is for slicing, the other three are for shredding. This is coarse, medium, and fine. Then you get your food pushers. Someone, some people have accused me of being a food pusher, a little bit. And then you plug this portion in to the power hub on your stand mixer. Do you know that if we went into the uh, museum at KitchenAid and got the first stand mixer ever made back in 1919 and we plugged this in, it would work. Isn't that crazy? And that just lets you know KitchenAid makes things to last. Tina Varelli is our KitchenAid representative. She's been with us for three years now. Welcome back, Angel. Good to see you. Tina is also the 2012 Pillsbury National Recipe Champion. Don't mess with her in the kitchen. She knows her way around. But this is extraordinary because what we're talking about is a tool that will do all of the work that we need done in the kitchen. Look how this shreds. I'm telling you what, I have a devil of time shredding mozzarella cheese. Right? It's so difficult. Isn't it the trickiest cheese to shred because it's so soft, because it has a high moisture content? This is the best tool that I have discovered for shredding mozzarella cheese. I take it right out of the refrigerator, nice and chilled. I'm using that coarse shredding blade, and I think we're at, are we at double, triple cheese pizza here, David? Well, I think you're pretty good, and I would just spread them out here to the edge. <laughs> So that when he bakes, that'll bake right into the crust and the edges. Look at that. That is awesome. I Ooh. love that. Heavens. Now, this sold out the last day it was on the air. This was on the air back on March 17th on St. Patty's Day. Mm -hmm. And it sold out completely. It's on six pay tonight, but that six easy pay will go away end of day today. And guess what? We're 40 minutes away from end of day. Wow. Yeah. How you doing? So uh, this is going to be really important. $72.36 at retail. We are $22.00. And 38 cents less. So great. So I want you to think of this as a motorized box grater. Okay. So it's going to do everything that your box grater can do, but you don't have to get that arm workout doing it. So I'm just showing you how to put it together. So it's super, super simple to use. So this little square piece here is going to fit into the square hole of your power hub. And let me show you how that turns. So that's how it is powered. Now this is going to work with any stand mixer. And I posted on Instagram. On my 1953 model, I was shredding cheese with this today. Mm -hmm. Well, what's really amazing about this is you're going to be able to do so many different recipes with this and appreciate how easy this is to use. Now, many of you will remember when our buddy Meredith Lawrence was here and she made her version of buttermilk biscuits. That's right. She would freeze the stick of butter and she'd shred it on a box grater. Mm -hmm. You're gonna do the same thing here, aren't you? Right, so but I have- But in this machine. Right, so I have my barrel blade in. I'm using that coarse one. I have frozen butter, so I'm just gonna pop that in and it's gonna go right into the bowl here where I have my self-rising flour. So look at that, you know, you would be afraid to, you know, scratch your knuckles on there. 
Now, some foods are a little bit stickier than others. Some tumble right out like the cheese did. To release this, you just use this little release on the side and you just wanna tap that out or just get in there with a little spatula or something. But it really does such a wonderful job. So I made you some biscuits Ooh. A little bit ago there, David. I see, the, and you brushed them with a, a lot of that creamery butter. I'm yeah. going to try, oh, look at this, Tina. All right. Mm-hmm. Got a little bite right here. Mm-hmm. Light. Mm. Fluffy. Fluffy. Buttery. And delicious. <laughs> Let me back up a little bit. Happy dance! Woo! Yeah. Woo! I'm Thanks cheering with some flour. And a little butter. <laughs> What could be nicer? Now, this is very popular. Uh, let me show you again what you're getting. 300 of these are gone. Here's the box that it comes in. This also works as your storage box. Slicing barrel. Mm -hmm. Coarse grade, medium grade, fine grade, two food pushers, and the housing. All of it for $49.98. Six easy payments, but that six easy pay will go away end of day to day. This sold out the last time on the year. How many gone now, John? Over 300 now spoken for. Okay, so in here I have that fine blade, and that blade does not come with every pack up. So if you're out in the marketplace looking for that, you are not going to find it. So that is something that we packed in here, special at QVC. So this is white chocolate, and it is just literally snowing powdery white chocolate down on this chocolate cake that is chocolate on the inside and chocolate frosting. Well. But how fun is that? And of course you don't have to shred right onto the cake. This is kind of fun here to do, but you can shred it, um, you know, right into a bowl. And this also works really great with Parmesan cheese. I have some questions. Does it work great oh, with hard cheese? So okay. you can definitely grate your hard cheese there. So that was that fine blade. Let's come over here and I have that slicing barrel blade. Now take a look at this and I just wanted to point these out. These are dishwasher safe and stainless steel and really sturdy, sturdy construction. To put them in, you're going to put this side in and just kind of twist and press until it locks in. When you want to go ahead and release it, hold on here because it can shoot out and just press this little release lever. So it's really, really easy, intuitive to use, and it's just a great attachment. People ask me all the time, what's a great attachment to start with? I don't have any attachments. Right. I think this is the perfect attachment. I couldn't I agree think more. Everyone who has a stand mixer should have this because it's so simple to use. So here we have some little baby cucumbers. And I'm putting them in the small feed tube. You're going to have two feed tubes. So if you have a bigger, wider cucumber, you can put that in the top. Or single things like carrots and radishes, you can just pop in the top and it just comes right out. Sometimes I don't feel like making a salad because it's tedious to do. But this makes it so easy. I just bought the greens, you know, that you can buy pre-washed. Yep. And then you just want to add a couple things to it, and your salad is done so quickly, so easily. And it's really no effort. It's really lightweight. It's really easy to use. It's very well made. And it's just the perfect tool if you've never had an attachment and you want to start really harnessing the power of your KitchenAid stand mixer and turning your stand mixer into a culinary center that can do so much. We have over 14 different attachments. Which is so, great. So, you know, it's great to use that. And look at how quickly and easily I use speed four on any of the stand mixers. When you're done, you just release it, take it out, and that's gonna go right in the top rack of your dishwasher. So then all you need to do to finish your salad is add a little dressing here. Mm, look at that. Wow. 800 of these are now gone. Everyone's loving this great price tonight. Remember, $72.36 if you were to buy this at retail. We're $22.38 less, and we're on six pay. However, that six easy payment plan will expire end of day today. We're getting mighty close to end of day today. This is K46136.
Lots and lots of you making your choice. Now, will these barrels, the grating barrels, go into the dishwasher? They do. So let me show you. All the barrels can go in the dishwasher. The pushers can go all in the dishwasher. The only thing you want to hand wash is the housing because it has that metal piece on the end there. Okay. So it's just so simple to use. Just pop your barrel blade in. And the tube, the feed tube, has a little groove on the side and it matches a little ridge oh, here. Oh, that's smart. It's so like it's a puzzle piece. Get yeah. in the groove there. And you notice the bottom is curved there to kind of fit along the barrel. And to mimic the barrel, yeah. Right. So, how about really hard things, even like a sweet potato? Okay. Let's say you want to make like sweet potato pancakes, or this would be great for zucchini fritters this time of year. You know how dense and hard sweet potatoes are. That is just doing such a beautiful job. It just powers through that whole sweet potato. I'm just putting a little bit of pressure on it, and it just cuts right through. They're nice. Here's a they're question sharp. For you. Yes. When you're, uh, what speed are you using? For this? I use speed four all the time, and I start it before. So you want to have the barrel rolling okay. when you add your food. I saw some friends on Facebook mention that they love. To use this for making cauliflower rice. Oh, that would be clever, mm -hmm. yeah. So you can see it there kind of co mingling with our sweet potato. It just comes out, it does such a beautiful job, and really you can put a great big bowl under there and just keep going and going and going and filling up that bowl. As I say, it takes the work out of prep work, and that makes all the difference. When you're busy in the kitchen and trying to get great food on the table, this is the way to go. Miss Tina, thank you so much. Thank great you. to see you. Thanks for the biscuits, to too. too. The biscuits are amazing. Oh, you're welcome. Now, let me remind you of a couple things that we had earlier in the show. Our one day only value from Rostelli, the eight or 16 five ounce bacon wrapped sirloin fillets, and over a thousand of these already spoken for. Choose either the hickory smoked bacon, the peppered bacon, or the applewood smoked bacon. The hickory is sold out in the 16 count, two dozen in the eight count in the hickory. And the applewood, four dozen in the eight count, and only one dozen in the 16 count. A few more to go around in that peppered bacon choice. We also want to remind you about today's special value. The final look is coming up shortly. And we have taken orders in this show for how many? 14,000 in this show. We don't have very many to just go around. I know we don't have that many left. So this is going to be your opportunity to pick yours up now. We started the day with 41,000 of these. We've already taken orders for. 36,000. Wow. So uh, we'll be giving you your final look at that coming up very shortly. Right now, Stacy is looking sharp, <laughs> cutting right to the heart of the matter. <laughs> <laughs> He's been full of puns yeah. with this product tonight, that's for sure. Hi, everybody. I'm here with Jeremy Parker. He is known as our king of knives, and he brings an incredible three piece knife set from a name you've Seen probably before in your local stores, Fraberware. This is a three piece forged knife set. And what's so cool about these is not just that you're getting three, but the sheaths, the protective sheaths that you put them in, if you go to throw them in a drawer, will help sharpen your knife every time you go to use it. Right. It's a fabulous price. It's under $25 for all three. And tonight we also have it on two easy payments. This is a new low price we just reduced for you today. And you get. What Jeremy calls the three essential knives every home cook should have. That's right. And the great thing is that these knives will stay sharp because in the sleeve is a sharpener. Every time you pull it in and out, it resharpens that knife. You always have a razor sharp knife. These are three essential sizes. This is a seven inch Santoku knife with the scalloped edge, so it slides through things like butternut, squash, and potatoes. This is a four inch, sort of a utility knife here. That's a good little meat knife. And then you also get a really uh, essential three inch paring knife. That's about the size of your finger there you see. So uh, the three basic knives that you're going to want in your kitchen. Okay, and we offer them in two color choices for you. So I want to show you the complete set and our choice that we call black hair, which is going to be great. This is a wonderful gift to give to a new couple, wedding registry, maybe somebody getting their own apartment that they finally, you know, are leaving the roost, so to yes. speak. So you want to get your <clears throat> son or daughter their own knife set, great price. You could get them black. But if you love red for your kitchen, we also offer the three piece set in red. K48606 is your item number.
number. Okay, Farberware, too, has been yes. around since the early 1900s, 1900 right? from New York City. They're a staple in the kitchen world. I'm sure you've all heard of Farberware. They're workhorses in the kitchen. And you know, knives and cookware are the two most important thing in any kitchen. So a lot of us have a drawer full of knives that are dull. You'll never use them because they go dull. So you go buy another one. Inside here, if you look closely, there is a ceramic V sharpener. It is so clever. Pull it out, put it in, it sharpens the blade. Mm -hmm. You always have a razor sharp knife. So. This also has scallops on it. Now, this is a Santoku knife, which means three virtues, which is dice, slice, and chop. Okay, what this what does, we do. this will easily pass through this butternut squash. If you've ever had a problem going through that, this allows you to pass through, this air passes through those little scallops. That's why it doesn't stick like a regular knife. But the hardest thing to cut is not hard, it's actually soft, like this soft tomato. And when you have a razor sharp knife, you can just drop that and oh. it will cut right through there. Folks, this is such a sharp knife. You will use this all the time. You just let the knife do the work. Mm -hmm. If you drag it through, I'm putting very little pressure. It will cut through. Normally you need a serrated knife because it cuts through the skin. This will easily cut through. That's your workhorse, that's that seven inch Santoku. And when you have that sharper knife, it's actually a safer knife, Jeremy. A safer knife. Because it does, you don't have to put the pressure on, well, look, it doesn't skip. Yeah, you're right. And, what's, and if I look up, I can look up and look at you and chop this entire green pepper here. Our okay. green, green onion. You're kind of making me nervous. That's okay. But I trust you, I know yeah. you're the king of knives. The reason is here is that when you have, to <laughs> and you could do it this way too, if you're mincing, you have total control, so you're not gonna slip um, and, and lose control. Now let me show you the other two knives. And that would be good for cheese too, because of that non-stick with the, with the Absolutely, yeah. great cheese okay. knife, or also um, uh, meats and things. Speaking of meat, the four inch knife is just a nice in-between size. So if you have like chicken breasts, things that you want to carve through, there you go. There you go. This will just carve right through that. You can see I'm doing one stroke. So if that's pieces of like tuna uh, and you don't want to crush it, you don't want to wreck it, that's the right knife for that. That's a four inch blade. That's also a good size if you want to like carve down the size of a bell pepper here. And, and peppers can be waxy. Again, very difficult sometimes for a very dull knife to get through. You're never going to have to worry about having a dull knife. Every time you reach you reach to use it, as long as you had it in that sleeve while it was sitting in the drawer, it it's going to come out resharpened for you. So no need to get out, you know, that rod and try to get the right angle, which doesn't even really sharpen your knife. That came, The rod that came in the wood block is what I'm talking about. That's right, about. yeah. That doesn't even really sharpen. You don't have to do a thing. That's you just right. Store it away, and it's sharp when you go to use it again. It's, yeah, and this is that three-inch paring knife. Always nice to have. Can I show you a little trick with this paring knife? Sh please. If you're doing limes or lemons, and you want to focus the juice, what you do is just squeeze that juice over the blade, and you'll see how it falls right off the tip. See how that does that? It runs right down the tip of that blade. You probably get more of the actual juice out of that lime. Out of the limes. That way. See how that drips down there? Anyway, there's a little. Uh, Chef Jeremy Trick. Yeah, I love that. that. Hey, yeah. you learn something new every day, and that's what we love about In the Kitchen with David. Yeah. We learn things. Okay, so let me just show you your th two color choices. This is a set of three with a brand new low price for you, and we do have easy pay. So order with a credit card, break up this price um, to two easy payments. Here's your set in black, so you get a sheath per knife. We also have the set in red for you. Is this a full tang knife? Yes. And if so, what does that mean and why does that matter? Okay, what that means is that all these knives are full tang, meaning that the blade goes all the way to the back of the handle. It's one piece of metal continuously all the way through. These are triple riveted. They have a very hard handle. So if you whack it, it won't break. Uh, and then you have total control with this knife. So even when you're doing things like, here's an eggplant, one stroke through. See how I do that? One stroke through, every time you put this in and out of the sleeve, it's going to sharpen itself. I'm telling you, a good knife in the kitchen is the most important thing to have. Um, how is it? How do we best take care of our knives? Hand like wash this? your knives. I, I never put knives in the dishwasher. I just come from that school. Keep your knives um, safe. Hand wash all of your cutlery. I can tell you, for $24.96, for three knives, knives that you're going to use most in your kitchen, this is a fantastic value. I've seen paring knives alone for about this price or more for this quality. You're getting the Santoku, the seven inch, the four and a half inch utility knife and the Perry knife with the self sharpening sheaths in here. I know a lot of you have your sharp shark, but how many times do you forget to pull it out or it gets lost in the drawer? Now you got your sharpener in the sheath. Here's your black, there's your red. We have the new low price, but no reorder. Your item number one more time, K48606 is your item number. Thank you, Jeremy Parker. Thank you.
Okay. See you. Um, so I heard there was a little breakfast being made in the kitchen tonight. But before we talk about the recipe David made, let me give you an update on our store more. These are the set of the cabinet organizers we had with Mark Charles Masilli. First day presented at this new low price of under $20 and no reorder. All we have is all we're going to have. We started with about 4,000 of these. I have 300 left in your black, 400 in the red, and just a few more in the white. You get two pieces, a large and an extra large. It's total customization for inside your cabinets or on top of your desk or countertop. Oh, it smells so good! Stuffed French toast, my mm. darling. I love breakfast for dinner. Well, I love breakfast anytime. Okay, you can just keep pouring. Well, I figured you would want a little extra. So, okay, so Big Mike, you know, um, our director came down earlier because he was watching you while doing another show. And he said, yeah. what was the filling again? I said, I know there was cream cheese, I know there was bacon. Cream cheese, pecans. Pecans, okay. And maple syrup. Yum. All right, so get in there and get a little bite. Okay. So good. Uh, Did you used to do breakfast a lot for dinner growing up, or was you know your what mom we would not do? Into no, that? no, no, no. She was actually okay. really into that, and um, we didn't do it all the time. Then every now and again. This is good. I'm oh. a big fan of breakfast okay. um, after dinner. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How's that working out? Mm -hmm. And you know what's great about this? Mm. It's it's a sweet French toast, but then you get that salty bacon in there, mm -hmm. and it balances, mm -hmm. doesn't it? Buttery really, too. really yummy. And remember, mm -hmm. hala is an egg bread. Mm -hmm. So it really, really plays nicely with all of the, the great ingredients the batter, the butter, all that well, kind of Well, I thing. know it's sometimes like the better chefs like the hala for their French toast. Everybody likes the hala. Buy a hala, hala. Be hala. Why don't you, well, I'll holler about the today's special value while you Well, you need, to holler, you need to holler about the new today's special value. The new today's special value? Aren't you? Right I think you're doing that next. Oh, that one. You're gonna I'm glad you that. know better than what I'm doing. I just hear today's special value. I think of the one that we're doing today. But well, coming up. You do that, I'll do this. Tonight with Jane Tracy. And we had an earlier preview of this. So um, if you've seen this and picked it up, get excited. Because this is one of the most popular products at QVC UK. Becoming a, a, a name brand here in the United States. So much so we wanted to do our first today's special value from Cook Pluma. It's their four-piece silicone brush set. These are brushes that go into things that sponges your hands can't. Cleans your napkin rings, your wedding rings, baby bottles, tall thin bottles. Four pieces. You even get a pan brush. And what's so awesome, they can really take the heat of a hot pan up to 400 degrees. We have all four pieces plus... What we've also included, because it's our today's special value, are two of the fluffiest, yummiest microfiber cloths to help clean your stainless steel, your appliances. Ladies, I gotta tell you, they're amazing for washing your face. They just suck all the makeup right off, but you're getting all of it for under $30 and on two easy payments. So we're gonna have a full presentation with Jane Tracy coming up tonight at midnight with great colors, our first today's special value with Cote Luma. But in the meantime, going from Germany to France, Le Creuset, and the final presentation of our awesome and only last or last today's special value with Le Creuset. David, take it away. All those things are absolutely true, and let's get busy because we've got 20 minutes left to show you the six only remaining colors. This has been extraordinarily popular. This is your final look of the day before Janie kicks off the brand new value of the day. Let's kick this one off and finish it up in grand style. Here we go. So 36 thousand of these skillets have been ordered today and in our show alone over 14,000 ordered during in the kitchen with David we started our day with 10 colors now there are only six another color sold out after our last presentation palm is now gone this is an extraordinary value and as Stacy mentioned our final today's special value of the year from our friends at Le Creuset and this is extraordinary because what we're talking about is an amazing value on a skillet that is 10 and a quarter inches in diameter. First time we've ever done this size, stick handle, helper handle, and not one but two pour spouts. As I mentioned, there were 10 colors when we began the day. There are now only six, beginning with the white. Now, white is a color we don't do very often in Le Creuset, and this one is going to be great 
particularly if you are pairing it with other colors that you might be buying. I have 2,200 left in the white. This is Provence. Now, this was introduced only about 18 months ago. 600 are left in that Provence. Beside that is the Marseille Blue. 350 to go around. This next color is special because it's only available at Looker Say and right here at QVC. And I help pick out this color. This is the emerald, and we have fewer than 500 left to go around. Then we've got it for you in the oyster. 100 left in the oyster. I think it's probably safe to say we will lose oyster. And then finally, I've got it for you in the cerise. I have 350 left in that cerise. That's been our most popular color all day. What does your value story look like on this? At retail, $170. We've got it tonight, $70 and two pennies less. That's what makes this an extraordinary value. This is your final value, today's special value of the year from Le Creuset. So if you're hoping for one closer to Christmas, there won't be. This is it. This is tonight. This is your moment. Bring home that superior tool made in the same way they were first made way back in 1925 in this small village in France. 94 years later, this brand continues to thrive. Let's welcome Chef Nate Collier from Le Creuset. Good to have David, you back, Chef. David, great to be here nice again. Nice to see you, my friend. This is extraordinary. Coming along with this is eight recipes. That's exactly right, David. So many of which you're showing us today. We will show them, and I want to show people how to use this skillet because it's almost a shame to call this just a skillet because it can do so much. The skillet is really the workhorse of the kitchen. I still tell everyone that if you have a good sharp chef's knife and a good skillet, you can cook almost anything that you almost or your family anything. wants. So the skillet shape is amazingly versatile and easily maneuverable. On top of that, you're getting cast iron, which provides heat retention unlike any other material out there, right. dating back thousands of years for its heating properties cooked right over coal. So that's what gives you the flavor. Then you add to that Le Creuset's proprietary enamel. We started doing it in 1925. Mm -hmm. We were the first to add color to that enamel. So you're getting that beautiful color on the outside. So the, the cast iron heat retention, the beautiful enamel that we pioneered, plus the versatility of a skillet. I'm so excited that we've sold so many of these tonight because I know there's going to be a lot of people that are cooking in enamel to cast iron for the first time very soon. And it's amazing. Don't cook on super high heat. You don't need to. You got it. You put this on a medium heat and you're going to get that beautiful sear like Chef is showing you on these pork chops. I mean, this is a gorgeous, gorgeous cooking vessel. We've got breakfast sausages going. We have vegetables that we're trying to get a little color on for fajitas. We'll do some fajitas. David, we've got beautiful ricotta meatballs here that we browned in the oven. We're going to build a sauce around them and melt a heap load of cheese on top nice. of and pull it out and just dig in right with a fork. The other thing I love about this skillet, David, is the helper handle and the stick handle. It's easily maneuverable from the stove to the oven, back to the stove, to your table, to the sink, to the outside, to anywhere. This is so versatile, it's really amazing. And of look, course, you get delicious, delicious Yeah, food. look at these gorgeous pork chops. I mean, you're getting such a nice sear on these. And you're going to be able to, OK, there it is. Beautiful. How are you doing? So that's flavor, David. That's texture. It's not scorched. It's not burned. It's perfectly seared. The fat is rendering. And it's because the cast iron holds on to the perfect temperature that you need. These will cook through right on the stovetop, but if you wanted to take it to the oven, of course you could. If you were doing a thicker chop or a really big double French uh, two bone chop, you absolutely could take that right to the oven from there. Wow. We're gonna take this, just a few fresh from the farmer's market um, peaches. We've got beautiful ones in South Carolina right now. Oh, I bet you do. If this were the fall, you could do apples right in there with it. Um, you could do vegetables. You could put some Brussels sprouts or anything else right down in there. We're going to get some color on this. And what I also love about the Le Creuset cast iron is this interior black surface is actually enamel that's baked onto the skillet. Yeah. It's not raw cast iron. It's not some chemical nonstick coating that just gets sprayed on. It's baked into the cast iron. It provides the durability, the easy maintenance, and of course, you can do so many things with this that you could not do with your grandmother's raw cast iron pan. Well, as you add a little wine to that skillet, and we're gonna deglaze and then make a really beautiful sauce. I actually have a little butter here if you'd like some. Let's put some in there, just maybe a little bit more than a little. Oh, <laughs> well it is the last look Perfect. of the day, right? There you go. Let's get one more little pad over here. All right, I've got an update for you. We just lost another color. We did. And I'm going to throw a little more butter in this pan because we're going to saute some apples in yes, butter and are. brown sugar and make an apple pie. 
All right, so we have, we started our day with 41,000 skillets in the white, 2,200 remain in Provence, 550 in the Marseille, 270 wow. in the Emerald, 450 oyster just sold out, gone. Thank you, Alana. All right, so now we've sold out of five. Now I have 200 left in Cerise, but let me caution you about Cerise. If you want Cerise, you want to get it sooner than later. And here's why. Cerise is always our most popular choice. Red is our, our, our favorite foodie color. Cerise is the French word for cherry. You want to get this now while the getting is good. We brought in more Cerise than we did the other colors because we knew it would be popular. But it's been the most popular of our show tonight. 4,000 just in, wow. in the kitchen with David ordered have been Cerise. And David, that's our most popular color overall for a brand too. Did you also see here, and, I'm, and I think you can read that, made in France. Let's take a look at some factory footage here because this is extraordinary and I'm gonna get these apples into the butter. And David, you said it, made in France since 1925. Every single piece made in the same foundry in northeastern France. Individual black sand molds are broken apart. Truly one of a kind. 15 different pairs of craftsmen's hand touch every single piece. These are generations of people that have, whose family has worked in the, in the same foundry. And this is what really sets us apart. That enamel, those colors are not achievable by anybody else out there in the market. Le Creuset pioneered this process. It's baked on at unbelievable temperatures. So that's how you know the enamel is chip resistant. It's durable, it's beautiful, it's easy to maintain. There's me getting put to work at the factory, packing up the boxes for such a large order for QVC. But I love it, I love the cast iron. Just like I said, knowing that so many people are gonna cook an enameled cast iron for the first time, it really makes me happy because there's a couple of different things. One, it's Le Creuset and everybody really should have a piece of this in their kitchen. But two, it provides such beautiful food with such easy, easy maintenance. I've been telling you all night and a few of the other hosts, let the pan, get some good ingredients and let the pan do the work. This is just wine and butter and peach juices and pork juices. You see the pour spout working beautifully. No drips anywhere. All of that beautifully over some pork chops. It's a mashed potatoes. You could do buttered noodles. Clean you up could do is anything. a wipeout in this, let's, right? Let's, let's show that, David. Let me grab a dry towel because this is gonna be a little bit hot. Look right here into this skillet. You see all that fat from the pork, everything that we cooked in there? You know what, and while it's I believe clean. you can put this in the dishwasher, I would just uh, wash it in the sink. I, I would cook right in that same skillet right away, David. You'll have no issues, nothing sticking. Plus, it's a heavier piece, so I wouldn't put a heavier piece like this in my dishwasher, exactly. although you could. Well, I would I, probably just do it in the sink. I have the problem of my dishwasher being filled with kids' sippy cups and bowls and <laughs> all sorts of other messes that those things, there's, no, right? there's no reason for me to even think about putting the cast iron skillets in there. Um, Mr. Nate. I have another update for you. Oh my goodness, already. So we started with 41,000 skillets for the day. We are $70 and two pennies less than retail. We started with 10 colors. Here's what I have left. What's that, John? We started the show with all 10 colors. Here's what I have left. The white, 2200. Provence, 500 remain. Marseille, 200. The emerald, 400 and cerise. Gone. Wow. Whoa. Cerise has left the building. You know what? I think that might be the first time we've ever sold out of Cerise in anything, David. Because we always bring in more Cerise than anything. All right. So we started the, the day and this show with 10 colors, and then there were four. This is all we have remaining. And if you are someone that just loves the property of this pan and the color is unimportant to you, then just order whatever you love. If you're looking for a safe, color to buy as a gift. White is always a good choice. I would also think this blue is a safe choice because those tend to be good safe harbor colors if you're buying as a gift. That's what I started my collection with, David, that Marseille blue. The Marseille blue yeah. named after the southern port city in France. So this is the white, the Provence, the Marseille, and the QVC exclusive color of emerald. I helped choose this color. I love that green. I just think it's fantastic. Now, we've been sauteing these apples in butter. I'm gonna go ahead and add a little brown sugar. Please. Just because I feel like we should. 
Now, and David, then that'll kind of caramelize you, along with the apples. You said earlier you could turn this right into a dish to spoon over that delicious French toast you, you just certainly made. Could. Over some breakfast. I love this type of sweet apples with some uh, salty bacon or sausage. Oh, now that's yes. But what we did was turn this into a pie. You can either put a crust right over top and have, have it without the bottom crust, or when you take these out, once they've cooked down, you put the pie crust in the bottom, mm -hmm. and baking in cast iron gives you that beautiful, crispy crust on the bottom that's still tender. Because there's nothing worse than cutting into an apple pie, and the bottom crust is just soggy. Soggy and a mess. It's just, pastry is meant to be crispy and golden brown and delicious, and Ooh. cast iron will make that for you. And this is lovely, you guys. Check that out. That is now simmering, and all that butter and that brown sugar will turn into a lovely, thickened caramel that will become the filling for our pie. Or you could just serve that with ice cream. Hello. One scoop. Why not? Um, three. All right, so this is what it's all about. We're down to the final six and a half minutes of our show. Wow. Or six and a half minutes of this today's special value. And that means we are down to also four colors only out of the 10 we started the day with. So John, we began the day with 41,000 skillets and we have, uh, how many have been ordered on the day now? 15,000 in this show. Wow. And then for the day, where are we? Okay, we're gonna do some math Do here. some math, get the calculator. Got a lot going on. Huh? All right, as we do that, we'll remind you that this is five easy payments on your credit card. That's any card you use. You're also going to love that this is $70 and two pennies less than retail. And we're excited that we still have four gorgeous colors to offer you tonight. So 41,000 is what we started with. We've taken 38,000 orders on the day. Wow. That's pretty incredible. With only four colors remaining. This will come to you in the beautiful Le Creuset box. It also becomes a great gift idea. It's our final look, we're today's special value of the year. So you may want to think about this in terms of a great holiday gift. Oh, yeah. I think this would be marvelous. Remember, a skillet is the most used vessel in the kitchen. It really is. Now, breakfast time, it's scrambled eggs. Hash browns, sausage, cinnamon French rolls. French toast. You got it. Pancakes, whatever you love. Lunch time, it's a grilled cheese sandwich, right? And then for dinner, maybe it's a skillet meal of these gorgeous meatballs and sauce, or perhaps you're doing a stir fry or fajitas. Fajitas, and the thing I love about this, David, you can see it's still steaming. I turned this burner off, um, and you walk through the Mexican restaurant, you see everything steaming and delicious. This goes right to the table. Before you we go to the table, can I make sure we just lost another color? Oh my gosh. I'm going to walk it over while you give us you the You do that, news. and the color you're holding is now gone. Oh. All right, so we have, for uh, out of the 41,000 we started the day with, in the white, 2100 Provence, 400 Marseille just sold out. Oh Marseille is gone. There we go. Thank you, Alana. Dave. Now, if you want the emerald, which is the QVC exclusive color, the one I helped choose, and the one that is only available at Le Creuset and QVC, I have 250 of those to go around. It is likely we will sell out of the emerald. If you have any other emerald piece, either in stoneware or cast iron from Le Creuset, all the colors are exactly the same in the emerald. They'll all match back. So if you have any other pieces in emerald or you're building a collection, then absolutely think about picking that up tonight. Let me also tell you that we have, out of the seven, excuse me, ten colors we started the day with, seven have sold out, three remain. Emerald's going to get limited and then sell out probably here in short order. Don't miss out. On this opportunity, we are over $70 less. Now, Chef, talk to us about what you did here. So this is one of the recipes that comes included with this eight recipes designed specifically for the skillet so we can talk you through anything that you want to do in it. These are sausage ricotta meatballs, so tender, browned in the oven in the skillet. Oh, wow. Then you build your tomato sauce just with some onions, some garlic, some crushed tomatoes, a little red pepper flake, and oregano. Let that simmer just for a few minutes to cook the raw tomato sauce off. Meatballs right back in it a heap of cheese on top. And again, we got this beautiful brown in the cast iron skillet. Yeah. We've got the tomato sauce simmering, so you know you're gonna get that beautiful, rich taste of the tomato sauce. And this is broiler safe, so I'm gonna walk over to the oven with this, pop it inside, and when this comes out, I would sit down, I mean, I've been going all day, I would sit down with a fork and eat this whole thing myself. Yeah, well, I, would, I would want a great big piece of crispy garlic toast to, to 
uh, to dunk in the sauce. Or a Caesar salad on the side, too, well, yeah. David. And a nice uh, Cabernet to wash it all uh, down. Now we're talking. Now I think that's what we have in the day. Now, look at this. Uh, speaking of these steaks and Cabernet, something that would go nice. That's right. Steak. Absolutely right. Uh, and you could also use Cabernet to deglaze that pan to make a nice sauce. This is extraordinary because look at the sear we're getting on those steaks. If, the, if Mother Nature is not agreeing with your grilling plans, then don't wait on a, a pretty day to fire up the grill. Do it inside. Absolutely. So, David, July 4th weekend, I have to tell you, I ordered a 48 ounce uh, porterhouse steak to cook with another couple friend of ours. I wow. left it at home. <laughs> so, I got home with just my girls. They're three and five, but they love steak. So, I slow cooked it in the oven, but I wanted to get this beautiful sear, and it was it, the fat was firing on my grill. It was catching on fire and turning oh, bitter. Wow. So I put my cast iron skillet right on the grill, got it hot. You can do it inside, but if you don't want all that smoke, take it outside, mm -hmm. heat it on the grill, and just really get that beautiful brown sear on the steak. That's flavor, that's texture, that's a delicious high quality steak, some mushrooms, some red wine, and a piece of cast iron, and your dinner is done. Wow. This is an extraordinary day and an unbelievable today's special value. Our final look, we say today's special value of the year. You need to be aware now that we have only three colors remaining out of the 10 we started our day with. Wow. We began our day with 41,000 skillets. And this is what I have left in the white. 1,900 are left in the Provence. I have fewer than 300 left in the Provence. And in this emerald green, four dozen. We will very likely sell out of that emerald probably here in the next moment or two with only four dozen of those left to go around. You know what? I wanted to, I asked our prep chefs before the show if they would do something for me and do a skillet brownie. Yeah, I wanted to eat it. That was part of it. <laughs> but also, I wanted to show everyday cooking in this. Absolutely because right. Because we've shown some really higher brow dishes. We've shown you some really nice things tonight. Right. But if you want to do a box brownie mix, it bakes beautifully in yes, this. Because you get the chewy exterior all around and on the bottom. I think even Stacy would venture off the <laughs> clean eating path for a big old piece of brownie. I'll make you some french fries in it too. You can fry and Stacey Lou, come out here, darling. <laughs> We've got brownie for you. A lot of brownie for you. Ooh, and yum. I'm thinking, I don't know, vanilla ice cream, chocolate yes. syrup, yes. sprinkles, right whipped cream. Whipped cream. And then just a hand, handful of forks, and everybody goes right <laughs> into it. In. With a skillet like it. this one, bring the whole thing to the table, Absolutely right? right. Mm -hmm. And you could you could cut in there and then serve right out of there. Oh. You guys, we just lost our final color. Oh, did the emerald, emerald go? just sold out. Let me take the emerald away. Mm. Emerald is gone. Thank you, my dear. Wow. I have 250 in the Provence, and we still have the white. And that is all, That's it. my friends. Wow. What a day. Miss Stacy, join us in the middle here, what my a dear. Day. Sure. I'm going to be the rose between the two thorns. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but as we wrap up, we want to, uh, Miss, um, Miss Alana, come way over here. Thank you, darling. Hey, let's welcome the 414 brand new customers. Oh. Hi, everybody. Many of whom purchased Look Rose Tonight's so first PVC purchase. So really excited that we were able to welcome in 414 brand new customers, many of whom made this their first QVC Great. purchase. Now, tomorrow night I have Down Home with David at 8 p.m. Okay. And I saw that there will be some magic in the show. Hmm. That's, a, that's a tease. Like a magician? Hmm. I saw, you saw, saw that there's going to be some magic, magic. in the show. Well, now I've really got to watch. And let's just say that when I say I saw it, I didn't saw it with my eyes. Oh. This is like Stranger Things season three. <laughs> the, 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 no the spoilers. Snacks. I haven't started oh, yet. So be wait. sure and join me. I'll actually be with you tomorrow night at 7 for cleaning the kitchen with David. Perfect. And then at 8 with Down Home with David. But is my girl in place? Yes, she 